excited I am for today. I said to Tom this morning, and he's like, oh, I'm half asleep. I was like, Tom, I'm with Claire today. Oh, I had a lovely hug, didn't we, we this had, morning? We haven't seen each other in so it's, long. I feel like it's been months and months it and months. It has been months. And our eyes met across the car park. It was like this. Slow. That's that's us running to each yeah, other. Yeah, yeah. That's how fast we run as well. It was lovely. It was lovely. Oh, it has been months. I've been, I know. I and know. I mentioned Too to long. Alison yesterday. I was like, I miss Claire. Oh, I, I miss you. I miss you. Oh, we're gonna have such a lovely we show. We will. Jewelry makers. Yes, we we got Claire McDonald. Oh, thanks. Yes. Thanks, Michael. Yay. <laughs> and a lovely Tuesday show. I know. An amazing Tuesday I show. Know, yes. Stunning projects. Your deal of the day is well. Let me just put it this way, jewelry makers. I'm fairly sure we said at some point. We can't, we've been told by our supplier who supplied the first parcel. I can't get any more, that's it. That's it, I think that is mm. literally it that's come out of the ground. I think what, what, what was there is you've had. So done, dusted, you'll have to go back to the more traditional Blue Angel light, which is lovely. Don't get me wrong, it's lovely. He's only done it again. He's only managed to acquire a small parcel. And it was like, it was like the conversation was like, guess what? Guess what I found? Um, we have today, jewelry makers, the official relaunch, which will only last one show. I can tell you that for certain, of natural green angelite. It's absolutely stunning, isn't it? It's so gorgeous. Like that, yeah. I I would love to say that this is your number one gemstone, but I think to quantify that status, it would need to. We'd have need to see more offerings. Yes. Do you see yes, where I'm coming yeah, from? Definitely. We'd yeah. have had to have had, had a bigger supply of it. I think had we had the bigger supply of it, it definitely would be. Um, but it is so limited in its availability. It sells out. It's probably the most in-demand gemstone, I'll put it that way. Mm. Um, and it's all natural. Because you get these wonderful, look, look, cloudy formations with this hint of spearmint green that's natural. It's so calming, isn't it? Oh, really, really calming. Which I always thought about Angelite in its more, you know, in its um, the blue that we knew mm. and have yes. known since yes. nineteen eighty-seven. But then when we when this parcel first emerged, and we saw it in the peacock, and then we saw it in the green, mm. which was such a fleeting opportunity because you know it was discovered. It was like, oh gosh, you can get it in natural greens. Oh my goodness! And then it was mm. lost again. Literally, yes. the yeah. Mother Nature did not offer us any more. Um, but they have found another another small deposit and that's what this show is all about. Now, you might also notice whilst we're looking at that tea bar that this was something that Ross, you, you championed, didn't you, Ross? Um, he spoke to the supplier. This was all about, was it Appetite that you had this discussion with or was it Amazonite? Amazonite um, and Seraphonite as well because um, Ross does obviously gets involved in, in, in these... Uh, well, I'd like to say, Ross, if anyone's to know what the customers really want, it would be you, because you see it right there in um, on the computer screen. And one of the things we were finding is, because obviously the larger sizes would come at a higher price tag, mm. um, <clears throat> they were very popular, of course, but the, the price was that much more expensive. So Ross came up with the idea, okay, how about the sizes like 10 and 12 millimeter we do on shorter strands? And that's a genius idea because they're often the focal piece yeah. where you might just use one, isn't it, as well? Yeah. So that would work. That's so you don't a really clever idea. Need a full yes. Thing. So yeah. it brings that price down dramatically. Um, <clears throat> and then obviously you've got the full length strands and the smaller sizes. Yeah. So this is Ross's Very baby. clever. He's, he's a smart cookie, isn't he? He is. Yeah, he is. So we've done that with this parcel, jewelry makers. Would you like to know what's coming up on today's show? Because, like yes. I said, yes. it is. It, uh, it's going to be a gorgeous Tuesday, it really is. So, eight o'clock jewellery makers. I'm going to say it again, the return of the S-Class. When was the last time we had an S-Class? It's been ages, is not it? Yeah, I can't think of one. These are lovely, aren't they? Look at those. Aren't they gorgeous? Let me grab my tweezers. Um, so, you've got, you get two in sterling silver. Look at those. They are nice, aren't they? Super simple it, to use. It's been years, hasn't it? A long time. Years and years. I think the last time we had S class were in base metal as well. Yes, yeah. That I recall anyway. Yeah. So these are your early bird. Do shop ahead on these jewelry makers. The S class was really, really easy. 
It's been that long, I almost forget, forgot it existed. Mm. Does that make sense? Yes, yeah. Um, it's really easy to use because you haven't got like a trigger, like a mechanism to sort of get hold of. Um, and it just sort of slots in. And obviously you can encourage that open um, ever so slightly. Then at nine o'clock, oh, who's ready for the sparkle? So it's not the birds and the bees. <laughs> That's what was in my head though. Yeah, it's not the birds and the bees. It's the bees and the butterflies. Yes, yes, yeah, beautiful. Just so we get that yes. right. Nine yeah. o'clock, we're not going to be just <laughs> discussing birds and bees. Claire, these are wonderful. Oh, I know. Yeah, these projects are really, really lovely. Really lovely. And they actually go together beautifully as well, don't they? So se separate projects. But yes, you've got the, the wonderful um, filigree butterflies and then you've got the, the wonderful um, honeycomb and these incredible bees. They're I so gravitated good. towards these uh, pieces, Claire. That is so, there's a design that, I don't know if they still do it, but Pandora had a, um, a bracelet very similar to that. Right, okay. Do you remember I okay. told you that story that something caught my eye as I was walking past Pandora? And I was like, oh, I like that. So I went in. And I was like, oh, I like that bracelet. How much is that? And it was like 500 pounds. So then I had that awkward exchange of, <laughs> okay, I'll just have to think about it. Um, and then sort of shrink yeah. outwards. But uh, it, like absolutely beautiful projects. And I wasn't expecting it to come the way it does. So it's basically like a sheet of honeycomb, isn't yes, it? Yes, yes, you can basically, you can do whatever you want with it. And we'll have that, I'll show you how, um, maybe you can, you know, to sort of like the get, get the best out of the sheet. Um, but there, there are loads of them there. And, and you can have literally one, one of the honey cones and it, and it has an impact and Loving those bees that. are gorgeous yeah. Loving that so those are both both your projects at nine o'clock today yes. then at ten o'clock we have well we've spoken about it it is the return of natural green angelite jewelry makers so um extremely excited mm. to um to relaunch this amazing gemstone we didn't think it was ever going to be possible again because we were told literally that's it it's done green angelite is all but gone um but He's delivered, um, and we have it in all the different sizes, all in rounds. One in faceted, I believe. I love those. Yeah, They're one gorgeous, in I don't aren't think they? I've seen I don't think I was. Angel, yeah, like. I've been transfixed by it because I don't think I've seen it either. It's Look gorgeous. at those, stunning, and of course the different lengths which we've discussed. So that's at ten o'clock, uh, jewelry makers. That you, you don't want to miss out on that. Then at 11 o'clock, we have, just quite simply put, an absolutely joyful strand. Beautiful, isn't, isn't it? it? Yeah. It would go beautifully with your butterflies, I think. Yes, it would, yeah. Um, because you've got all those lovely colours, mixed gemstones, by the metre, by the metre. So I'm seeing some... That's gorgeous. Aquamarine, some peridot, some citrine, citrine yeah. some amethyst in there, all your, um, some tanzanite. All of your mixed gemstones in one meter long strand. Ross is very excited about that this launch. That is a launch. stunner, isn't it? Absolutely it's beautiful stunning. strand, yeah. And you think Gorgeous. nuggets, because of their popularity, um, it's not deliberate that we don't have nuggets that often here at Jewelry Maker. Um, apparently nuggets are so popular at the moment now, they're actually really expensive to buy. Mm. Um, however, uh, this is a great deal for you today, Jewelry Maker. So that's coming up at 11 o'clock. And then at 12 o'clock, we've got Claire's amazing masterclass, um, which is about donut gemstones, yes. um, which come with bales. Yes, they're um, specially designed bales that, that work really, really well if you've got that, obviously that donut shape with the, you know, the hole in the middle. Oh, does it kind of like open over it? Yes, yeah, yeah. So there's different ways you can use them, but it's a really, really clever finding. I've not worked with them before. Really, really good. Genius. Claire, it's going to be an amazing five-hour show. And I think I we'll know. have a giggle as well, because we've been, I've, already, I've already been like that. Hey, <laughs> laughing, hey. We do have a chuckle, don't we? We do. We do. do have a chuckle. Do get your messages in, jewellery makers. We would absolutely love to hear from you yeah. this glorious Tuesday morning. Um, what's the weather doing out there? It was a bit better than yesterday, oh, wasn't gosh, it? Yesterday. Didn't Ooh. we have like a month's worth of rain? I was driving in it, it was not nice. Not nice. nice. Do take care out there because I understand yeah. some of the roads yeah. are a little bit waterlogged yes, as well. Careful, so take yeah. care out there. Um, oh, yes, don't forget. Um, I purchased, I picked up an order yesterday that's of, of an item that was, wow. um, and I have to tell you, my husband last night was like, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Can I have it? <laughs> I, like, I think it'd be a bit small for you, darling, but I'll make you one. Um, I bought this and I picked it up yesterday and it went straight on my wrist. Malachi. Look at the quality of this malachite. It's absolutely stunning, that is isn't beautiful. it? beautiful. Look, th we're actually going to include oh my gosh, this look, yes. in today's show. Oh, that's exciting. Bullseye malachite, every single one of them 
technically it's in an embargo but because i was wearing it wow, yesterday i know they're amazing um totally natural as well because i was wearing it yesterday ross snuck it in the show um Very so if you good. missed out on that jewelry makers we're going to play it um in the nine o'clock is that right probably at the end of the nine o'clock hour it, i agree we're all in we are all in agreement that this is quite possibly some of the best malachite we've ever Definitely, seen yeah, and, and, yeah. I'm, and i mentioned this yesterday roscoe didn't i, I was like saying our malachite was, has always been great has always been amazing but now it's like off the chart incredible mm. i think it surpasses van cleef quality honestly yeah um it is one of our top gemstones absolutely Gosh, every everyone isn't yeah it? every They're single insane. one like we are yeah I, I think we're surpassed and the price that we bring it to air for as well you know the reality is malachi is a four-figure gem um but we are not bringing it for four figures i can tell you that for certain we're not, mm, I'm not I, i'll stop there just in case mm -hmm. i give the game away but it's just an epic deal um ross also said perfect for christmas well yeah my husband was eyeing it up last night he was like i like that <laughs> so I'll hint, hint. Hint, hint. <laughs> um it's the per like fits Perfect size for a for a stretchy because you can see the bullseye. Yeah. Um, yeah. So yeah, coming up at nine o'clock. And by the way, if I did decide to generously give this to my husband, because he does deserve it, I suppose. Yes. Um, I would. I could just. <laughs> I just add a few gemstones in there. I could just take it off the yeah. elastic. Yeah. Yeah. He's a good egg, to be fair. Yeah. But I'm not ready to give it to him yet. No, no, no. not yet. Not yet, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Yeah. So that's coming up at nine o'clock as well, jewelry makers, about the top of the hour. Um, okay, should we get cracking? Yeah. Oh, I tell you what, you all have forgotten. I bet you've forgotten. What have I forgotten? I've forgotten it. She's what? forgotten. That's right, you'll see in a minute. You'll see in a minute, don't worry. First auction. Oh, I actually haven't got it here physically in the studio, but we can show you one of Adam's amazing recordings. 15 carats Ooh. of kunzite and they're incredible oh look at those oh they've got claire mcdonald's <coughs> written all over that it haven't they? look at that a member of the spod you mean family i like such saying. a funny funny family name isn't it <laughs> it is like uh, oh let's think of a name for that family i know spod you mean um easily one of the most sought after gemstones very much oh, well, it was launched by tiffany's and co it's high end it's a high end gem i never thought i'd own uh, kunzite um you get a pack mm. of five because it's, it comes at a high price tag now claire as i said i think you've forgotten oh no 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 told you no 20p <gasps> per stone that's what you've forgotten because it's been so long since you've been with this shift side that's what ross does to open the show it's crazy isn't it that i'd be multiplying with that to go with your amazing oh, um, yes. <clears throat> nuggets nuggets strand because those colors would work perfectly oh fastest fingers first because it's that's yeah. crazy our, our, our customers didn't forget <gasps> they didn't forget they knew um i have got a blue kite strand all the way from western australia claire <laughs> And I'm <laughs> yeah, Ross is trying to do an Australian accent and he just sounds more Welsh. <laughs> now he's turned into Bluey the dog. Is it true that dogs can watch Bluey? Apparently the colours of the carter, I know they can watch anything. <laughs> They're allowed to. <laughs> no, they design the cartoon in the colouring that dogs can watch it. That's thoughtful, isn't it? Stick, stick Teddy in front of Bluey and see what he, how he reacts. Yeah. See how he reacts. Uh, Claire McDonald. <gasps> it's a Burns. Can you do your best Frank Butcher? <clears throat> oh, if I... Um, <clears throat> pat. A pound. Pound, pat. Pat, Done, it's gone. It's absolutely flown out the door. Um, who does Lauren has <laughs> we do an impression of every morning? We've shown you a photo, right? Yeah, with his, with his, with his bow tie. Yeah, that was like the Christmas Day EastEnders episode when I think was that he, when he didn't wear anything else. No, he just had the, the spinning bow That's tie, it, didn't yeah. he? Yeah, and Pat's like that. Oh, Frank, <laughs> oh, Frank, saucy. 
<laughs> Iconic British TV right there. Oh, yeah. I wonder how many years ago that was. I remember it. I do yeah. remember it. I haven't watched EastEnders for years, but it's because it's not like it was. You know, Frank Butcher's mm. not there, is he? Is Ian Beale still in it? Is he? <laughs> no way. Oh. He's still in it. I hope he's had better luck. Sonia's still in it. What about what about uh, Barry? Uh, oh yeah, he got he, he had a he had a timely demise. Yeah. Oh. Janine, Janine pushed him off a hill. It's not very nice, is it? Oh, gosh. <laughs> I'm not, that's not funny. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so the awkward laugh now. Good, Bear, goodness me, well. Ross. Yeah, give me a product to sell yeah, quickly. quickly. I'm, Come on, I'm Ross. clearly laughing about Paul Barry. <laughs> right. <laughs> Next opportunity. The last gemstone. The last one of this gemstone in the whole company. Right, okay. Mm. Peach Amazonite. So we haven't got any more of this. Oh, it's pretty. Um, um, Ross has asked Wayne to get some. Does he know oh, if he can get it those. or not? Can he get it or not? No, can he get it or not? He's he's working on it. Oh, I oh, look Claire. at those. That's a beautiful Claire, colour, get, isn't it? You get you get tons. You get all these. Look at those. 170 Gorgeous. carats, mixed shapes. You get a, <clears> you get a three a pack of three to seven. Um, but we guarantee the carrot weight, basically. Ah, oh, lovely. So if you love Amazonite, night, but you prefer the lovely nude tones. Um, beautiful, guess what? What are you doing? I don't remember it being this many one pounds. Mm. <gasps> yeah. He likes to start his day with these one pound deals, does Roscoe. That's an incredible deal, isn't I it? I know. You've got to check out nice, they'd be lovely with gallery wire, wouldn't they? Yes, they would. And, uh, you know, your wire work. And I mean, even if you just glued a bale on, yeah. you know. Love it. Love it. If you love your one pound deals, by the way, um, don't forget the early bird and all that catches the worm. Um, that if you get up just that little bit earlier, you might bag a few more of these amazing mm -hmm. deals. Below cost deals, check this out. Did you know that you can shop for pre-show deals on Jewelry Maker? Head over to jewelrymaker.com every day between 7 a.m. and 8 a.m., click on Watch Live, scroll down for brilliant products, last of stock items, and amazing deals. But these deals are only available for one hour, and once they're gone, they're gone. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. One hour only. Like the eight o'clock hour. They're available for one hour. And um, by the way, there are clearly lots of early birds. Mm. I'm an early bird. Are you an early bird? Yes, I am, yes. I, I, like, I like first thing in the morning. Me too. Do you yeah. find you more productive in the morning than you yes. are in the evening? Yeah. I think it's a, it's a special light, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I agree. It's quite magical and I think come, energizing. Come half nine, I start pulling this face. Yeah, ready for a little nap. Yeah, my eyes start to glaze over. Yeah. I'm yeah. like, is that time yet? Is it that time for me to go to bed? Although this morning I set, I set two alarms, one for five past five, one for ten past five, and I, I wasn't thinking, oh yes, I'm an early early bird <laughs> now. I love this. This is magical light. I was thinking, oh no. No, because no it's, it's, it's the equinox, isn't it? Just have the equinox, so it's have dark we? now. Oh, right, We're okay. officially in autumn. Oh, right, okay. Officially in autumn. Yeah. 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 Clocks go back in October, but it's dark. It's dark in the mm. mornings when you get up, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and it is, it's always that period of adjustment, I always find. Yeah. Everything goes a little bit funny. Like my three-year-old at the moment, like her sleep pattern, she's, very, she's got a very disturbed sleep yeah. pattern at the moment. And I think it is something to do with the time of the year. Yeah. Um, <laughs> that, and she can probably hear me banging around. As well. Mm. Anyway, enough of that. Mm. Um, what next, Ross? What should we do? Don't forget your early birds. You've got your S-clasps as well. They will be flying on pre-orders. You've got the rose, the yellow, and the silver colour as mm. well. Shall we do... Oh, yeah, we launched these the other day. Got the final few. These are bale clips. So it's on and off on board there. That yeah. is nice, isn't it? Yeah, they're lovely. So you can literally, um, say you had a big oh, pearl nice, on the bottom yeah. of this, um, one day you wanted to wear it with, a, with the pendant, one day you didn't, you can literally have it on and offable. 
Sorry, Lauren. Um, you do get the pair of them. So 925 sterling silver. You can see how they work, can't you? Literally opens up. A little bit like a carabiner, but it's outward neat, opening. very isn't it? Yeah, they're seamless. Neat and secure. And the itty bitty jump ring that comes alongside mm. it as well. Um, would these work, do you reckon, Claire, alongside maybe your donuts that are coming up? You could use yes, these. Yes, yes, you could you? do, yeah. Um, yeah. Or some of your um, angel eye, why not? Yes. Have one of the big ones on and off the board. Yeah. And yeah. you can clip Beautiful them. Pearls, yeah. yeah, perfect. Clip them in between your knotted pieces of jewellery because nice. you've got that natural space. Yes. Yeah. Um, so we're looking at here, uh, what's that? £20 each, yeah, that's not bad, is it? Because it gives you that versatility to almost transform your jewellery. How about, not £20, how about £10 each? It's not bad, is it? Mm. They are precious metal. 30 second clock on your screen. Very useful. Very useful. And it's little findings like this, Claire, that make such a difference to your jewellery. Yes, and that sort of interchangeable jewellery is very popular, isn't it? Very, very popular. Yeah. Yes, definitely. Because uh, yeah, you can add it to anything, couldn't you? you I know, think especially it? in the winter months, because you know where you wear more layers, don't you? Yeah, so longer chains or maybe chunkier jewellery, yeah. definitely. Loving that. Um, and we're going even lower jewellery makers. How many have we got, Roscoe? 23, so they are limited. They've been very popular on the launch. Um, this might well be the final opportunity to grab them, but I should imagine, because of the popularity, we've ordered more. But that's going to take probably about three, four months to get here. 11 99 for two. Six pounds each. That's good, isn't it? Mm. Sandra, Alison, Mandy, Maker, Maker, Elaine. Morning, everybody. Do get your text messages in as well. We would love to hear from you. We're going to have a giggle today. Because Claire's here, so it's always like a giggle with a, with an element of naughtiness. <laughs> well, there is, isn't there? I think. Do you know what you mean? We just uh, just have a little giggle, don't we? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's always yeah. good fun. Take it as a compliment. Yes. That, Take yeah. it as a compliment. Like Phone lines have gone crazy. Who wants? And we've got two days off tomorrow, so you know we'll be like that. See ya. Do these crazy prices, and we're out of here. <laughs> Um, let's do it, we're going even lower. Morning Atia, morning to you Sandra, morning to you Sarah, morning to you Cheryl, Gillian, Oxfordshire, Elaine and Alison and Mandy, new customers. Um, yeah. What's everybody doing on their days off? What are you doing on your days off? Anyone doing anything? Anything special planned? No? You're here, are you Michael? Eating other people's sandwiches. <laughs> <laughs> I've been eating other people's sandwiches. It has, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's was, a it, was it a nice sandwich? It was, yeah. it was a special sandwich. Oh, I will no. get Michael to tell the story. Oh, I can't wait I to hear this. It no, it's hilarious. It's worth telling again. Willow thought this was the, like oh, the best story wait. ever. Under ten pounds, jewelry makers for all that solid sterling silver. Brilliant. Ten millimeters in their size. Yeah, it's a great, uh, a great way of actually. Um, giving your jewellery versatility and I know they're bales but there's nothing stopping you using these as clasps as well yeah definitely because they look look how secure they are lovely, lovely aren't that'd they? be great yeah and those little jump rings doing a little it's like I've got the shakes a little wiggle. It? Do I have a little wiggle on um oh speaking of wiggle um <laughs> Ross says he's just realized he's got a little bit more wiggle room in that price tag oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, right, jewellery makers, let's sell them out today. We don't want to send any, send any of these back. It's such a great deal. Um, and it's going to be an even better deal in a, in a second because Ross says he's got wiggle room. Um, so he's going to take it down even lower. Um, sterling silver, not base metal, which let's be honest, they're a base metal price tag. Very easy to what? What? Wrap loop directly onto there? Yeah, you could do, couldn't you? You could do a wrap loop onto the jump ring part. Yeah. Yeah, or you could use maybe your wire guardians. Depends what you're gonna True. um what you're gonna work with, doesn't it? If you're gonna use it as a class. Very good. Because if you look, especially you can see, can't you, profile on from the front. That is that's a good amount of, of precious metal, isn't it? Yeah, they're solid. They're really yeah. nice and secure. Um so basically this lifts up, you clip it over, whatever. You can take I, I I'm using pearl because a pearl pendant just mm. springs to my yeah. mind. Yeah. But you can mix it then, can't you? You can put it on a chain, you can put it on a knotted <coughs> necklace. You don't it doesn't have to stay on one piece. So giving you that versatility. Um Dawn, Pamela, Elaine, lots of multi buyers, Gillian, Atia, Sandra, Julie, Jax, S. 
Make sure you're checking out everybody. We only had, do you say 26, Ross? Yeah, at the beginning of this auction opportunity. And there's loads of you with it in your basket. 8 99 Well done. Got to move on. Got to move on. Amazing. Shall we whet your appetite for Malachi? Oh, you need these, don't you? Look. Lovely. Yeah. I do, nice. lo I do look, look at Malachi. that. It's such a lovely cut as well, which I don't That's amazing, isn't it? Look at that. We were talking about the bamboo, um, um, as obviously the plant, but what it means as well in uh, in China and Japan, you know, because it's mm. got um, great meaning, the actual plant, you know, obviously they talk about it being the perfect gentleman. Because, mm. uh, um, yeah, because it literally stands tall, the young protect, oh, sorry, the young um, protect the, respect the old and the old protect the young in the way it actually forms lovely, lots of yeah. meanings. Yeah, love the shape of these. And I can imagine it's quite a challenging shape to actually um, cut in Malachi. Um, we think that this is the only strand we've actually had yeah in um in the bamboo um where you get the bamboo then the four millimeter round you could just restrand that couldn't you um morning to you rachel in north yorkshire i'm neither an early bird nor a night owl i'm just permanently exhausted <laughs> pigeon lol <laughs> uh, lovely to see you both together oh, oh that's brilliant i like that permanently exhausted pigeon that's me it. as well yeah <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Harbinger. L, I got a 245 carat double sided carved peacock and phoenix type A oil green jadeite pendant for £45 in the seven o'clock hour. Amazing! Wow. There you go. So we need to try and be the less exhausted pigeon <laughs> and try and be that early bird, don't we? Because you get deals like that. I do get where you're coming from there, Rachel. I was uh, like, it, it's. Especially this time of year, though, I think I'm just that little, just that little bit more lethargic. Oh, yeah. Just tired all the time. Mm. Tired, tired. But we're busy people, aren't we? That's why. Um, £199. Again, they're carvings, aren't they? Should we go crazy? 30 second clock, all around the world shopping. We've got 14, that's it. There's no enhancement. Do be mindful of synthetic or fake malachite because there is a lot out there because of its popularity. You're getting genuine malachite here. We've got, did you say 30? 16. 14. And they're all going to go today. Morning, Gigi in California. Is it, is it morning with you now, Gigi? Uh, Pauline in Manchester, makers there. Is it evening? I used to know this, Gigi. When I worked on the USA channel, I used to be able to know what time the mm. time zones were in different states. So is it quite late with you now, Gigi? We're not stopping at 199. I've got 14 chances available. Just restrand that. 29, that, wow. That's incredible, isn't it? Because you'd have to buy at least two strands usually to get the two different cuts. And I don't think, yeah. well, we know that's the only bamboo shape But you shape could just have. use one, couldn't you? Because it's that carved special shape. So yeah. just have one on a, on that's nice. you know, a chain. Or a bit of cord or yeah, something like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, one, that'd be gorgeous. Mm. Absolutely gorgeous. Uh, 29.99. Loving that. Hello, Angela in Surrey. Lovely to have your company, everyone, this morning. You've got to check out. And I should mention that this is Congolese. This is Congolese. Now, the reason for you can get malachite from different locations around the world. It's a very shallow forming gemstone, often found in and around sort of uh, turquoise deposits as well. Um, however, the best, what's considered to be the best in the world is Congolese um, because you've got those wonderful natural colours, but you have as well the, the distinction of those different bands. So you want it to have those lovely layers and you can really see it in this beautiful strand. And in that shape it works. Yeah, love it. It's perfect, isn't it, for seeing those those bands. But we've only had it once in the, that, mm. that shape in this gemstone once. Yeah. I think we had it, we've had obviously had it in jadeite, but um, in the malachite, this is the only strand that we've got. And we only had 14 at the beginning of this auction. So if you do want those multiples, jewelry makers, make sure you are checking them out nice and early. Keep your messages coming through as well. Um, are you an early bird? Are you a night owl? Or are you an exhausted <laughs> pigeon? Um, <laughs> make sure you check it out. There's loads of you with it in your basket. Is there a problem on the app? And we're going to test it because Janet on the phone lines has checked out. Oh, uh, okay. You're Aww. forcing our hand on this. 30 seconds then. We've only got 14. We're doing a closeout now, which is... That's already a closeout deal, but we're going even lower. 
Go in oh, even lower. Oh, here we go, look. <laughs> oh, jewellery makers. Barbara's there. Iris is there. That's a nice name, isn't it, Iris? Iris, lovely, yeah. Um, Virginia's there. Oh, Cynthia's Cynthia, there. Yeah. And Glynis on in Cumbria. You've got to check out your baskets, everybody. We're testing the app as we speak in the website. Anne's there. Ivy's there. That's a lovely name, shopping today. Ivy, Iris, yeah. Oh, Ross, oh. it was already a closeout deal at $29.99. Yeah, mm. I mean, can we even source the Malachite for um, $24.99? I highly doubt it. There's loads of you there. I only had 14. You do need to check them out, though, jewellery makers. That's why I'm a little bit concerned. Um, Ella and Essex, Sylvia and Kent. Uh, Cumbria's there. Anne-Marie, hello to you. Um, at another, at Angela in Surrey's there. Lots of people on the phone lines checking out. Um, so I can see you on the phone lines. Can I get the, that would look very nice if you didn't want a knot between it, you know, the nine o'clock um, projects. <clears throat> yeah. You get all of these, you pop that in between, look, that'd be a nice oh, yeah. contrast, wouldn't it? Do you know what, are you getting your festive on? <laughs> that does, that, <laughs> that does. Getting my festive on, yeah. <laughs> it does look a little bit festive, doesn't it? It does, yeah. I ordered my I'd wear that. You've uh, ordered what? My Not, Christmas turkey. Uh, have you? Yeah. Have you got any Christmas presents yet? Yes, obviously. Have you actually? Yes. I, I, Claire, I had Christmas presents in February. Obviously. But that, that, that does go lovely. You do mm. need to check out. There's 36 of you with it in your basket. Can you text in if there's any issues on the web? Only because I can... Oh, no, Ella's checked out on the app, look. On the app. Text in if you're having any issues, jewelry makers, because that is an absolute giveaway deal. Claire's getting her festive on. <laughs> Loving that. Yeah, because you're making your Christmas makes now, aren't you? Definitely. Well, maybe, yes. not, maybe not Claire, because she's not, <laughs> she's not organised enough. Um, oh, let's do... Um, let's do a closeout deal. Massive closeout deal. The price that you're about to see on screen is the lowest price that this has ever been to. Look I'm going to show this. you this first. So, firstly, solid 925 sterling silver peg bale. How lovely is that? But wait until you see the component that you have oh. to literally secure in place. Do you remember the days when we used to say that you cannot carve or oh, drill look. a pearl? You have the most beautiful carved pearl. So secure it into place. Secure it into place and suspend it like so. How beautiful. That's gorgeous, oh, isn't it? That's a natural blush pink pearl. All you need is a little bit of your jewelry making mm. glue, don't you, Claire? Even yeah. I can do that. Even I could do that. Just a bit of patience, let it dry, and then that's it. Oh, maybe I can't then, because I haven't got <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> no, just leave it overnight, and that's all you need to do. And yeah. You've just made very high-end jewellery, haven't you? How about if I show you like that? Is that better? Um, solid sterling silver, a work of art in a genuine cultured pearl. Um, we have never taken this lower, and you get everything than £49.99. pence. However, today, um, close out deal, says producer Ross. I mean, get, imagine gifting that for Christmas. Mm. Let's wake everybody up this morning. No more exhausted pigeons. It's closed <laughs> higher than what's on your screens. And it has actually closed as high as 149 in the past. So this it's is a carved pearl, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, exactly. You know, you think about it. The canvas is an expensive canvas, plus it's pink pearl. Mm. Um, this is an absolute giveaway. If you have any interest, add it to your basket now. How many do we have? 23. It will last for 25 minutes or until stocks sell out. Never been any lower than 49.99. So one of the few carved pearls that we have, not just here at Jewelry Maker, across the entire business. Um, like Claire says, it's a, it's a carving. You know, you've got to be, you have to be an incredibly skillful individual to even um, attempt carving a pearl. And you also need to have 
um, the finest quality pearl with a very smooth uh, nacre to be able to do that. Otherwise, it will simply just chip away. Yeah. Never been lower than $49.99. Well done to everybody that's confirmed already. Ross, that's an amazing price for the peg bale. It's like I'm waking everybody up this morning. Virginia up to a quantity. I don't blame you. Don't blame you, Virginia. That's an amazing price for the silver. I'd pay $19.99 happily mm. for that, would you? That is beautiful, isn't it? Imagine gifting that, Claire. It's so unique. I'd almost be tempted to, um, I mean, you could, you could, I don't know, maybe if wire work is your thing or, or silver work, you could, you know, swap out the bale. If you didn't want to have a quick make, because that pearl is really, it's exquisite, isn't it? Yeah. So you could, I don't know, maybe if silver clay is your thing and you wanted to make your own bale. Yeah, beautiful. Or set it into a ring, something like that. Yeah, because your peg bale could go with any gemstone, yeah, it could can't do. it? Yeah, yeah, um, that, that pearl is really unusual. What on earth? At 19.99, jewellery makers, we're bringing you a work of art in a genuine, genuine carved pearl. Um, we didn't even believe, and I spoke about this very momentarily yesterday, that up until what, a few years ago maybe? We didn't even know that you could facet or carve pearls. Um, it was something that was very much developed. Um, it took 20 years and it was a diamond uh, cutting company that actually sort of took that length of time to sort of uh, gain that knowledge of how you actually do it. Um, and here we are giving it to you for 20 quid. You can't get a bunch of flowers for 20 quid, not a decent one anyway. Um, you're bringing a natural pink pearl. Again, make sure you are checking out your baskets. Do keep those messages coming through uh, to the studio. Um, we're gonna have a giggle today. Gonna have a giggle. Yeah. Uh, do, you think, do you think, like, do you think, Claire, that if we, because I think, they say exercise is the best thing first thing in the morning, isn't it? I'd have to get up at four o'clock though. <laughs> to fit it in? Yeah. And it's very dark. Yeah. In the winter, I don't want to do that. So I'll just stay a little bit tired and chubby. <laughs> <laughs> and happy. Yes. Yeah. Exactly. I'll yeah. stay cozy and warm in my bed. Yeah. Um, Christina Lancashire, you're there as well. <laughs> 19.99. Suffolk, you're there as well. Make sure you're checking out the everybody. Have we had any messages in about the website? Um, yeah. Just let us know if there's any issues on there. Um, Suffolk, you're there too. We have got, don't forget your early birds, there's S class. I can't remember the last time we had an S class. Do you know what that would be? Am I allowed to um, bring this in yet? I if love you must. I love, love, love this strand. I know. Oh, that might be the first time we've actually had That would had be it. nice, wouldn't Ooh, it? Yeah, Look at that together. Because the they're such gentle tones, aren't they? Soft pastel yeah. palette. Yeah. That's quite nice um, bridesmaids, isn't it, as yeah. well? Yeah. Oh, pretty, really complimentary. Really complimentary, mm. love that. Um, yeah, well, that's the that's angel light. The, I, I, I don't remember ever, no, ever actually having an angel light in a faceted strand. Yeah, you put Gorgeous. it back to front now, Claire. <laughs> you put it back to front. Oh, on yeah, the have a knife. Lauren's amazing display. Sorry, Lauren. Uh, make sure you check it out, everybody. Now, again, um, just while we check out the uh, website, Jewelry Makers, I want to show you everything that's coming up on today's show. And remember the website, there's a menu of goodies. Add it to your baskets. We're going to try and look at um, if there's any issues. You've got this beautiful malachite strand that is coming up on in, at the top of the nine o'clock hour after Claire's. It's not just any malachite. This is bullseye malachite. Mm, um, very special. I, spontaneously. <laughs> I don't know where that's... Oh, what was I, what was I watching the other day? Spontaneous. Oh, I know. Happy feet. The, the the singing the singer the singing penguin. Yeah. She says, "Be spontaneous." Now that's stuck in my head. Um, I was spontaneously watching the show and saw this being launched. I was like, "Ooh, yes, please." So I bought mm. that. Um, got it yesterday, and it's been on my wrist ever since. We are bringing Gorgeous. you the final remaining quantity of this jewelry makers in the next hour. Technically, we shouldn't be, um, but we're gonna do it anyway. Um, so this is coming up at nine o'clock. Your deal of the day, I don't know if, if you weren't able to uh, tune in at the very beginning of the show, we have natural green angelite jewelry maker, a parcel that we were told, this is literally, uh, is the expression from the horse's mouth that this is done this is done it's dusted the parcel you know the mm. green um offerings mother nature literally has that's it that's all you get in um but he's done it again he's managed to actually acquire a small parcel we bought absolutely everything that we could you know 
recognizing what happened previously uh, we bought everything that we could and it's all in today's deal of the day hour um, also you might notice that the size 10 and the 12 mil to bring the cost down um, and it was Ross's idea I think it's a cl really clever idea mm. We've shortened the strands um, because as Claire was saying, you might only use those as like a pendant or as a focal bead, maybe yeah, as your yeah. gurus and whatnot. Um, so they're shorter strands and then your um, small, so your eight, your six, your five, are they four? And your faceted strand. Um, are all longer so they're the traditional 38 centimeter strand um, so they're coming up at 10 o'clock today jewelry makers also don't forget this amazing multi gem strand by the meter in your gorgeous nuggets it's lovely, I mean, look it? like at that spring time. look at the colors it's so nice to see different colors I would restrand that, Claire, exactly yeah, as it is. Absolutely. It's lovely. I'd work with the, the, maybe the S. You could, you know, maybe put one of the S, S class on. That's it. Very nice. Because I, um, I can see tourmaline. I can see uh, aquamarine. I can see amethyst. I can see citrine, peridot. And I think some tanzanite in there as well. Mm. So um, you get the whole strand by the meter. This is launching at 11 o'clock today. Um, and then, of course, let me just grab something to prop this up your early bird is all about your s class now we've got them in three colors so if you prefer the silver the rose gold or the yellow gold um i'll pick them up so you can see them properly these are your s class you might want to encourage them open just a little bit um there you go um but they're really easy to work with aren't they s class easy to yes, use yes they are these are really nice ones, aren't they? Lovely. Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, so your S clasps are your early bird. They're on the website as we speak right now, jewelry makers. So if you are having any issues, um, do it the old fashioned way. Pick up the phone, speak to our lovely UK based contact center and they are lovely. 0800 655. Um, speak to our contact center and they'll be able to allocate it to your order. Remember it's one postage and packaging all day all day um so like i said you've got silver you've got the rose and you've got the yellow gold and there's loads of goodies in the eight o'clock hour so, um your project's coming up at nine o'clock yes nine o'clock two basically you get two yep. different yeah so you've got uh butterflies and bees <laughs> yeah Do you know, i reckon we're gonna say it though aren't we uh, at some point just because yes. it's butterflies what, yeah. and bees i swear upstairs do it on purpose to trip us up sometimes yes Sure so we're not talking about the birds and the bees we're talking about butterflies and bees today yes. at nine o'clock yeah um so look at those <laughs> i gravitated towards those the moment that i stepped in the studio they're really striking aren't they yeah i love them really lovely and projects. those honeycombs come on a sheet don't they yes they do yeah yeah so you can really decide what you know whatever shape or size you want you and you know, just cut it out yeah yeah really easily um literally just uh, literally cut it out cut what shape you want and it's uh, it's basically like if you imagine like as you would buy metal sheets mm -hmm. it's that isn't it and then it's yes. sort of cut through yes yeah and it's it's so precise so uniform you know you've got to think if you if you were going to have a go at that you know and uh, piercing out you'd be well furious by the time you yeah. well i would be by the time you actually got to be creative can you imagine yeah yeah so we have to go back to that patience again, doesn't it? Yeah. Hello, Mandy in Derbyshire. Yay! I was thinking, I hope it's Claire today. Oh, that's lovely, oh, Mandy. Thanks. Lots of thanks love for Claire. Much. We have missed Thank you, Claire. You. It feels like we haven't I, seen you. Know, I've ages. missed all of you lot. Not so much Michael, because I have seen him. <laughs> and I want to hear his sandwich story. Um, oh, yeah, that's but yeah, I haven't seen all of you for ages. It has been ages. Hello, Miss Janet. Hi, gorgeous girls Aww. and team jewellery maker. Um, always lovely to see you. I, by nature, am a night owl. But stupid o'clock starts when Ooh. commuting means sleepy. Yeah. Aww. Yeah. It's... It, uh, oh, yeah. God. Lovely Defo the pigeon out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, see, I think we need to get a little bit continental here in the, in, in the UK. Uh, no, no, like start having a siesta because they're really oh, good nap for is you, the aren't best. they? A nap is the best. Totally isn't it? love a nana nap. <gasps> yeah. Love it. I'll, mm. I'll embrace the cheese and the ham and the croissant and everything for breakfast yeah. too. Yeah. If it means I can have a little siesta in the afternoon. I love a siesta, and I know lots of people are like, oh, no, no, I feel lethargic afterwards. It probably recharges me. 
I, lo I just love that feeling of um, mm. snuggling down un under the cover as well. Yeah, whether it's on the sofa or in bed, it doesn't matter. Just getting yeah. cozy, or oh, I'm gonna have a little nice. snooze. And it's one of those twenty minutes. That's not long enough. It's got to be yeah. an hour. Yeah, it's got to be a full hour for a snooze. Oh. oh, Adam says he's groggy after an hour. Yeah, but then you power through that because you've you've had that little rejuvenating. Yeah. Yeah. sleep haven't you so you just power through love it yeah. I'd, I'd love to be able to say right, I'm going home from a nana nap and then I'll go and pick the girls up from school that'd be nice yeah <laughs> that would be nice I'm fairly sure my husband would be like what are you doing <laughs> just having to sleep <laughs> that'd be lovely wouldn't it mm. very nice mm. yeah I am the pigeon most of the time mm. most of the time just tired uh, <laughs> would you like to hear because we are getting some messages in about having um, lots of messages about the website. We are aware, and our IT, I heard Ross literally talk to them just. Yeah, no. um, we are having issues on the web, so I apologize about that. So um, we are in the midst of sorting it out. So maybe now might be an ideal opportunity to hear Michael's story about the sandwich. Yes, please, let's hear Michael, because it. it's a very good story. I've heard it, and I still want to hear it again. I'm sorry. <laughs> You're sick of telling them. I'm sorry, Ross. I'm oh, sorry. Let's, let's hear. Let's hear. Okay. Hi, this is Michael Wolf. Yay! Yay! You might not be clapping him after the story, though. Oh. <laughs> so the only person who hasn't heard this story is Claire. <laughs> and maybe some of you guys. Uh, so uh, last week, uh, I was really busy before work. So mm. I asked Kirsty, my wife, to make me a sandwich. Mm. Made me a sandwich. She wrapped it up in foil, um, took it to work, had my break, took the sandwich. Uh, in Lunt Club, which um, includes a few people from work. Anyway, open the sandwich. Wait, 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 it, there's it, a lunch club? I didn't know about lunch club. Yeah, what? yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like two o'clock. Okay. And some shifts, it kind of falls um, right for it. Anyway, open the sandwich up and it was, it was a good sandwich. It had ham, cheese, um, spinach, and it had pickle on, which isn't usually a thing that Curse would put on the sandwich. And it was oh. incredible. It was, oh. it was so delicious. Anyway, I did a little voice note whilst I was eating it saying, thanks, Kirst. The, everyone was giggling at the table because I was making a massive deal out of this sandwich. <laughs> Two days later, me and Kirst were talking and I said, yeah, great sandwich. Why do you put pickle on it for? It really worked though. She said, I didn't put pickle on it. I was like, you did put pickle on it. I was trying to, I was trying to like say to her, you did, you forgot. She didn't because it wasn't the sa sandwich that she made me. <laughs> I ate someone else's sandwich. Oh, Michael. Yeah. Yeah. So, so somewhere in that. this building, mm. livid. Livid. So, so, so what so did this, you do? So this morning, um, I'll show you a picture actually. Lauren, do you want to grab this? Um, I put some chocolates in the fridge. Oh, <laughs> to be fair, no, no, no. Michael. But you could say, that, yeah, Michael, but I took, it took a week for me to do it. <laughs> oh. so, it's been playing on your mind though, hasn't it? So that's the fridge, a jewelry maker at the moment. What have you put? Are you a victim of a, <laughs> of a sandwich oh, my <laughs> I'll put a little note in there just kind of saying, you know, I'm sorry. It was a really tasty sandwich, uh, but have some chocolates and I hope they're not angry at me. So. Have you explained the story to them? Yeah. Yeah, in, yeah. in, your, in your said note. If they can read my writing, it's quite scrawly. So, <laughs> yeah. So that's the, that's the sandwich story. I'm they, not going to tell it again to anyone. No, so, but it's so. pretty Aww. funny because if you watch Friends, it's like Ross Geller. My sandwich! My sandwich! Yeah. You throw it away! Yeah. How long do we need to feel for? Uh, well, we're just like <laughs> trying to sort out the website. Anyway, so. I'll leave it to you two. I'm going to go back behind camera. Oh, lovely <laughs> Michael. Aww. Um, now, the pearl that we've just brought to you, jewellery makers, there you go, sandwich thief. Don't put your sandwiches in our fridge. No, but I know there's some chocolates in there now. So <laughs> should, should, we go and, uh, should, yeah. we be, should we be a chocolate yeah. thief? Um, <laughs> I'm going to steal the, the, the chocolates. It's like a vicious circle. Now, um, this deal that we have just brought to you, jewellery makers, and I think this is what highlighted that we had situations on the website, um, includes a beautiful carved pearl and the peg bail to go alongside it um, has never closed lower than 49.99 today we took it to a close out deal and it's not just a little bit off we took this to an app i don't even know if we can source the pearls for this jewelry makers mm. you know that the world is in pearl, what i call what i call pearl mania um we can't access pearls um you know i was looking at deals that we used to do years ago for pearls and it was absolutely incredible the price of pearls 
outside of these four walls has gone through the roof jewelry makers so to say that we brought this to you for 19.99 is un unbelievable mm. and you get everything there are the graphics we are aware of the web issues jewelry makers our it team are you might be able to get through it's worth a go isn't it um we are aware of the it issues we are working on it as we speak Someone's going to go and put 50p in the meter. <laughs> put 50p in the meter and see if that works. Hit it. Doesn't that? Yeah. That's my. Hasn't woken up yet. Yeah. Isn't that. You normally just hit the side of the computer, isn't it? Give it a tap, see if that yeah. works. On off. On, On off. off. Turn it. Have you turned it off at the socket? Yeah. <laughs> that's the normal thing, isn't it? Turn it off at the socket. Leave it for a minute. Turn it back on. See if that works. Yeah. I'm sure the IT team will have done something similar. They've probably thought of that already. Um, there are people getting through though, jewelry makers, and you can always shop with us on the phone lines. Um, 0800 644 It's not a lengthy conversation. You won't be sat on hold for absolutely ages. Our call center are amazing. Literally just up there. Very friendly and efficient, aren't they? They are, yeah. yeah they're a yep. lovely bunch of people. Yeah, absolutely. Yep. So um, speak to our call center, especially at that amazing giveaway price. Mm. Um, don't I generally that. don't think we can access, uh, we can purchase the pearl. Uh, and let's not forget the sterling silver. Um, it's not just your standard peg bale, is it? No, it's not. It's that lovely fancy one, isn't it? Um, Why, making me think of flower fairies. Oh yeah, like Victoria Plum. Yeah, yeah. Showing our age now, Claire, aren't we? Yeah. Do you remember Victoria Plum? <laughs> yeah. I had a little Victoria Plum pillow when I was growing up. And do you remember um, strawberry shortcake yes. scented? Weren't they the oh. same? Wasn't strawberry... Were they the same friends? Were they friends? They were, they were friends, weren't yeah, they? Yeah, I thought yeah. they were the same cartoon yeah. there. We're definitely showing our age here, Claire. Definitely. Yeah. Um, late the 30s. The boys are like going... <laughs> late 30s. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> we're of the same generation, Claire. You can't be offended. You can't be offended no, by that. but you could lie. Okay, yeah. Yeah, we could. We late could 30s. Lie. Yeah. Um, um, I tell you what, I tell you what, whilst we're, yeah, Claire, <laughs> you're wearing some lovely earrings, aren't you? Oh, thank you. Yes, I am. Thank you very much. Oh, can... no, don't get my hairy face though, please. <laughs> <laughs> They're lovely, Claire. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, did you make those? I did make these, yes. These are, um, all I can see is my sideburns. Stop yes. it now. Are you doing those on a workshop? They are. They're going to be a workshop, so I'm going to send out details. So, yes. Ah, oh, lovely. So you yeah. can join Claire are, in beautiful Oxfordshire. Yeah, garnets. Yes, you can come to Oxfordshire now. How nice. Yeah. How nice. Um, right then, we think we're back up and running. <gasps> it's exciting. Yes. Let's test it. Type. Oh, these are so pretty. I tell you what, for a tester strand, Ross, you ain't half picked a lovely one. Oh, Ooh, my gosh. 55 centimetre. Wouldn't this go beautifully with your deal of the day? Right, okay, yeah. we're going to test the web now, jewellery makers. Um, oh, my word. I've got to double it over there. It's that long. Type A, apple green, 55 centimetre strand, jewellery makers. Get it under £100. In your three mil, love that size. They would be fabulous, wouldn't they? Would be. Um, I'd almost be tempted to put all three in there. Maybe oh, as, as decoration. Yeah. Nice. That'd be lovely. Or maybe with your angel light that's coming mm. up. That is always a win, oh, isn't it? Wow, Alongside some beautiful <gasps> pearls. You can never go wrong. How about your um, 11 o'clock uh, um, deal that's coming up as well? All oh, your multi-gems. Yeah. We're testing the web jewellery makers. Make sure it's fully operational uh, and back up and running. 99.99, yeah. I mean, we, I think that's an amazing price tag for type A green jade. It's not type B or type C. Are we working? Let's see. For a full 55 centimetre strand. It's a lovely size as well, isn't it? Really, really nice size. You could have this. You know, we had those clip bales. Those yeah, clip bales. perfect. Have perfect. a big Keshi pearl on the yeah. bottom of it. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, really lovely. Oh, that'd be lovely. That'd be like just over a 20-inch necklace, wouldn't it? Which is my favourite length of chain, actually. Or if you've got loads of head pins, that'd be nice to do um, bubble star, wouldn't Ooh, it? Oh, yes, so you get the texture styles. as well. Loving that, jewellery makers. We're not stopping there. We're going even lower. But we've got to test the website, jewellery makers. See, uh, check everything's back running operational oh clearly it's that it's that exhausted pigeon the websites have it's feeling exhausted today um how many got roscoe 
17 available jewellery makers. So again, make sure you're checking out. I love the idea of doing these in a bubble style. It'd be nice, wouldn't it? So you get that you get that impact of that, that soft colour and the, on all the texture with it. Beautiful. It's happening. It's happening, jewellery makers. We need to see you there. We are going to go lower. This is literally a test the website price. So you know it's going to be absolutely epic. 55 centimetres, not 38 centimetres. Type A grade. <gasps> That is a test the website price. Oh, that's lovely, isn't it? That's really nice. Isn't that lovely? Yeah. I just restrung that, Claire. I mean, mm. Nice and tassels. Oh, capriccio. You could do that too, couldn't you? Oh, what? What's that? A capriccio bracelet. That's that. Oh, sorry. Um, that's that kind of woven bracelet that Debbie Kershaw showed. Oh, really? Ah. Oh, that would be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, that'd be lovely. Yeah. That'd be nice. Or with mm. your bead looming and things like that. Nice. Yeah. Um, again, make sure you're checking out everybody. Let us know if you're still having any issues on the website. We are trying to rectify it if it is still the case. Um, would you team alongside? I do not. I've, I've maybe just put one because you probably, if you're not knotted these, you'd have you know a couple left over, wouldn't you? Depending on the length you wanted, but just. Maybe, you know, pop that in there. Gorgeous. Or oh. one of maybe your large. Yeah, the green angel. Yeah. Different greens together. Love that. Absolutely love that. Look at that, those cloud-like formations. And it's all natural. Everything on the back of my hand, totally natural. Gosh, um, I know, it's amazing. A, a parcel that we didn't think that we would actually get back. We have taken it to a price point. If you might be thinking, gosh, that's lower than usual. Yes, it definitely, definitely is. And that is because we are trying to iron out all the issues. Please let us know if you're having a text into the studio. Ross can see your text messages. Um, if you're having um, any problems, checking out your baskets. I have just noticed Nicolette has done. Uh, Gloria, hello. Hey, good morning. It's gorgeous, Claire. Aww. Where have you been? Thanks, Gloria. You've been moving house, haven't you? I've been moving house, uh, settling children to school. Um, yeah. Trying Do to sort the workshop out, looking after a lot of dogs. Have you got lots of dogs now? Three dogs now. Three doggies. Three so. dogs now. And lots more boys in the house who just, well, they eat a lot more, don't they? <laughs> I feel like I've cooked more potatoes than... <laughs> <laughs> than I ever have in my life. Yeah. Um, I've got two left of these. So she's been a busy bee, but she's back. Yes, Glory, yes. we have missed her. Yeah, now I've got the, the final two of these. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> Let us know if the web is all sorted, jewellery makers. Just we want to make sure everything's uh, everything's right. I want to show you on the reverse as well. That gorgeous look at that egg yolk wow, yellow. Wow, look at that. Someone has shopped ahead on this one. There's only two available within the website. Um, the detailing of this <laughs> of this gorgeous carving. Oh, hi Claire, what's for dinner? Potatoes. Just for just. Oh yeah, anything with it? No, just potatoes. Um, we've got uh, unbelievable yellow jade eye again. Is one of the rarest colours that comes with the red uh, red jade eye umbrella, um, and again, it's during that oxidisation process. Notice how it kind of caps, how That's the stunning, master carver has literally sort of just taken enough away to it almost highlights have... it, doesn't it? That's wonderful. Yeah, That's such skill. Unbelievable. Please do text in. Let us know what's going on on the website. We are trying to sort it. Um, right today. It's been one of those mornings. Oh my goodness me, Ross, that's ridiculous though. That's ridiculous. Do you know what? You can make a piece of jewellery. That's a perfect pairing, isn't it? Look at that. Can you imagine that? And you're making it for less than, what, 125 pounds? Mm. Beautiful, Nat a natural jade oak piece that of jewellery. isn't it? How unbelievable would that be? And you can get hold of it on your split pace. You know it's too low. The detail of this, mm. can you see? You've got the pagodas, you've got the, um, the... I never know what the trees are called, but you know the ones that are really structural, that have like layers? Oh, that yes. you see in yes. China. Yes, yeah. They look like bonsais, like, but yeah. big. Yeah. Yeah, really beautiful. So you can see those structured trees, even down to the bridge and the waters, um, all captured beautifully within the yellow jade eye elements. It's almost like the, it's the high, it's the it's it's the high points and the low points, isn't it? Yes. Use of the yeah. colour, which makes yeah. this so genius. Um, well done, everybody. I'm going to bring you one more opportunity. Um, and it's going to be these pearls oh. that I've been teasing you with. Have you noticed the blue oh. colour? One of the rarest colours of pearls is blue. 
um, a blue, it's, I'm not saying they are blue, solid blue, but they've got an overtone of blue. Um, oh, Ripple pearls basically have an abundance of nacre, and it's the, the nacre which makes up the precious pearl. Weirdly, mm. uh, deja vu, I was talking to my husband about this last night. Um, so nacre wow. is, oh, they're amazing, aren't they? Is what makes up uh, the, your the precious material around your um, pearl. When there's almost like a, um, I don't want to say overload, that's the wrong word, but an abundance of nacre, sometimes it can actually call the, cause these beautiful folds. And that, in my opinion, increases the luster. Ripple pearls are one of the hottest trends in the pearl industry right now. And they normally command a very high price point. Um, even here, I mean, that's already too low, Ross, isn't it? Um, at £1,499, these are 10 to 13 millimetres. Look how bright they are. You know, when white almost becomes blue. They really are, yes, yeah. I'd knot these with a, with a baby blue silk. Yes, lovely. And I would definitely, um, you know how I usually go for like yellow gold, or I'd go with silver or, or platinum, something like white gold yeah. with that. Because I think it is about that brightness, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I agree. And the cooler tones, yeah. I normally gravitate towards the gold. Yeah, and I, I would, totally agree with I you. I think this with, a, yeah. this with a platinum or a white gold. Yeah. How many do we have of these, Roscoe? Three. There are three available opportunities, jewelry makers. We're going to go straight down to it. It's been one of their mornings, but we are hopefully out the other side. Hopefully. Wow. What? Look at them. You think what 149 gets you in your average high street jewellers? No disrespect to them, it's not pearls of this quality. No. What? Oh my well, it, might even, it might be what, a pair of earrings or a pendant, wouldn't it? Yeah. Or one of them. Not this size no, though. You know, not the, yeah. Not a oh my goodness me. Now I'll tell you what we're going to do, jewellery makers. Now the um, S class, your early bird, and a few of the other items that we didn't get to play because of everything that was going on, we're going to bring to you in the next hour. Um, we're just going to try and sort out all of these issues that are going on. I can see a mega maker with uh, a mega. <laughs> I can see a maker a with two maker? of those in your baskets. Please check, try and check them out. If you can't pick up the phone, speak to our contact centre. That's a mad deal. Mm. Um, and you've got beautiful projects coming up with our lovely Claire just the other side of this break, jewelry makers. So. Um, don't forget this malachite bracelet is coming up in the nine o'clock hour as well jewelry makers but not just any malachite this is bullseye malachite mm. i literally bought it on the weekend picked it up yesterday straight on my wrist hasn't been taken off um yeah we've got the final few opportunities of those gorgeous, it's yeah. it's like the quad a to a tanzanite in terms of its quality um there's loads of you with that uh, that pearl strand um in your basket so again do check it out if you're having any issues pick up the phone because our call center can sort it out for you um and don't go anywhere join claire and i the other side of this <laughs> Hello everyone, it's Mark here from a very damp and soggy Whitney. I'm here to tell you all about my up and coming show, which is this Wednesday, the 25th of September. I'm gonna be joining lovely Carol, Tom and the crew. And I want to tell you quickly about my two project hours. Nine o'clock hour, we have got the most beautiful shell pearl kits. We've got four millimeter and six millimeter rounds alongside seed beads. They're absolutely beautiful and this will be the tutorial that comes free of charge when you purchase any of the kits in the nine o'clock hour and then at 12 o'clock you probably heard me and carol mention over the past few days we have got two beautiful beautiful howlite kits for the first time i believe we have matte howlite in four different size strands and then we've also got and this is a work in progress we've got this beautiful bracelet here and I've teamed this alongside some beautiful fire polished beads as well and again this is going to be the tutorial that you're going to get in the 12 o'clock and if it couldn't get any better we've also thrown in the most amazing mustard mukite project as well three different size strands Elang teamed up with beautiful seed beads so that's Wednesday the 25th 
We've got beautiful shell pearl at nine o'clock and then the incredible howlite and mukite at 12 o'clock. So I hope you can join myself, Carol and the team from eight o'clock. Did you know that you can shop for pre-show deals on Jewelry Maker? Head over to jewelrymaker.com every day between 7 a.m. and 8 a.m. Click on Watch Live. Scroll down for brilliant products, last of stock items and amazing deals. But these deals are only available for one hour and once they're gone, they're gone. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. something can we wish our um claire's lovely daughter good luck in her first day of a job yeah lovely ellen good oh, luck oh good luck you'll be brilliant she's gonna smash it she will if, she, if she's she anywhere near does. as talented as you are no doubt oh she's lovely lovely girl i'm very proud of her yeah so you should be yeah, um ellen. do you know what else you should be proud of just what's see that what, see what i did there yeah <laughs> your lovely makes oh yeah Claire, i, I really really like these projects yeah i um, really like them and so we're talking about bees and butterflies. Do I have to really concentrate on saying Just that. Just say it, birds and the bees. That's not it, it's done now, and then we won't say it again. Birds and the bees. Birds and the bees. We're not yeah. talking about that, we're talking no. about bees and butterflies. butterflies. Yeah. Um, love these designs. And we've got basically, so the butterflies or the bees, but yes. they'll all work together, won't they? Yes, I think they work really nicely together, don't they? Yeah, and the detail on, on each of these. So butterflies are separate projects, but the, the detail on the butterflies is, is exquisite. It's, it's that filigree that's really, really, oh, you know. Oh, it's three-dimensional. Yes, it is. They're really, really pretty, really pretty. Uh, the gemstones you get with those are gorgeous. And then the bees are really wonderful as well. Yeah, love those. So they are literally three-dimensional designs. So you could, you know, the butterfly is in flight, if you like. Yes. So it's not just yes, flat, it's going to sit flat yeah. to your decolletage. Yeah. Um, so wait a minute. How many projects am I looking at here? So you have five, five yes. all together. Yeah. So you can eat, um, there's two different butterfly projects, so in different colorways. So the yellow gold butterfly filigree comes with some those wonderful crimson red gems mm. and then the blue comes with the silver and then the bees I really want to show you how this um the honeycomb arrives because I've that's that's so mm. clever it's so crisp isn't it don't you think it's just really pleasing it's just it's just I don't know it's so sharp isn't it sharp lines that if you think like I was saying if you were gonna attempt to pierce that out yeah you know, you'd feel pretty proud of yourself, you know, if you'd managed to do one. I mean, how long would that take? Oh, a long time? Yeah. A long time. So basically with this, you almost cut it out then, I suppose. Yes, yeah, so it's a little bit of planning, of, you know, maybe think of the design that you want to do. Um, and yeah, then you're just gonna, we're just gonna, I'm gonna use my flesh cutters or I might use some side cutters here and we'll just 
you know, snip them out. Snip them away. Yeah. Sorry, don't mind me. <laughs> Look at this. Lights on. Lights off. Beautiful luster. Yeah. Um, yeah. So we've got the honeycomb in the yellow gold, the silver, and also in the rose gold colorway. Mm. Um, you can mix them if you wanted to. You could do that yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah, it looks um, good. And th so it's these that come with the bees, and you get a little collection of the bees. I don't know which project, Ross, you want me to start with. All of them are on pre-order. So if you are able, oh yeah, okay. So if you are able to access the web, we'll put them on pre-order. If not, please call and speak to our call center. They, the phone lines are working absolutely fine. So you can speak to our call center and get hold of these projects. Um, so uh, they're on the web or via picking up the phone line. So if you want the, um, Let's have, show you Claire's designs quickly. So, um, so you have got this is the yellow gold butterfly, which can you see? Beautiful, and that comes with three strands, Claire. Yes, three yeah. strands. What's the red gemstone? Sorry, Roscoe. It's like a faceted glass. Yeah, like a. No way is that carnelian. What do you know when you're looking, thinking it's that good? I'm almost thinking it's glass. Yes, yeah. That it had to be man-made. It's not. It's it's carnelian. I know. And look at uh, that. It's so uniform that colour, isn't it, across all three strands? I think that's some of the best carnelian we've yeah. had. Gorgeous. I don't think I've ever seen carnelian such a pillar box red. Mm. It's normally a bit more orangey. Yeah, you get three strands, three strands, and that's gem encrusted as well. The the filigree butterfly. That's on pre-order. Then um, the silver butterfly. No, is that black spinel? I'm not going to lie. I thought these were glass. Um, both of these projects, I thought they were glass. Yeah, because it's almost like the epitome of what you want it to be, isn't it? Yeah. So you think, that, yeah, man-made, yeah, perfection. Oh my goodness. So you get three strands of the coated black spinel. Um, they're on pre-order on the website or on the phone line, speak to our contact centre and even if you make your confirmations now, obviously everybody will pay that final low price tag. Nothing is debited from your account until your order is ready to be shipped, so they don't take anything until the end of the day basically. Um, then your three honeycomb projects, which Claire's made these amazing designs, um, they're absolutely beautiful. Can I solder these Claire? No. So well. I guess you could, I mean, you can maybe have a, have a go, but they are, they're plated with something. You've got enough of them. I mean, you <coughs> could have a, a play about if you wanted to. I don't know what results you get. I remember okay. there was a, the, that, you know, that lovely shiny gold that you were doing. There's yeah. a plating on there. So. Okay. Um, but obviously you can cut lengths, can't you? Yeah. you so. can, I mean, because you've got, you know, a lot of it. So you can just decide, you know, whether you want your sort of long strips like in the one, or maybe you want to, you know, maybe have four together, um, almost like more of a flower. Beautiful. combination but it's these so the, both the um the main components in these projects are so well thought out because when i first saw it, i saw an image of it so i saw the the, the honeycomb and then i saw the bees and i thought well how because it because it's not soldering how how am i going to attach the the bees mm. to the honeycomb i was thinking well okay if i have to use glue you have to use you know and that's absolutely done but these are Look. genius because if you see there, it's a really, really discreet little... Um, so they clip on? Yes, yes. So you're just going to squash that down and there's a, um, a little area in there so it just sits really nicely um, on top of the... That's that clever. Honeycomb. But you could also, you know, if you wanted to put them on, on your own wire work or um, uh, maybe on a jump ring or some, cord, you know, finer cord you could do. So there's lots of different ways you can use those bees. Amazing. And how many do you get of those bees? So uh, I think five. You get five in there. Yeah. Five of the bees, which are um, two tones, which I really like. You also get, I'm just going to pop that down for a second, you also get a nice large lobster claw. Mm -hmm. Um, alongside this and you also get a lovely length of chain oh beautiful length of chain that you can customize now another thing says Ross a lot of you have been asking about the malachite we are going to put it on pre-order because of everything that's what's happened everybody that can get it we're gonna let you get it um, you can everybody can phone um, we are very excited about this opportunity and you've all been asking for it to be put on pre-order. So we have done that. It's on the website as we speak. So bullseye malachite, nine millimeter rounds. It's a lovely size, mm. isn't it? Um, so how many do we have of those, by the way? 
70 available today okay um i, I think they're a gorgeous christmas gift aren't they um so hopefully the web and everything will be back up and running but you can shop ahead and if you are having issues and you've got your heart set on owning something oh eight hundred six double four six double five um so first we're going to introduce the rose gold honeycomb right okay so let me show you that let's see if everything's working once again um let us know please uh, yeah yeah communicate to us let us know what's going on on the web on the app um so you get i'm trying to think of the measurement of this because it's quite a big piece isn't it uh, hmm. Uh, hmm. Uh, it's all right the graphics will tell me in a second so you get a sheet of the rose gold do you know the measurements roscoe then you get the bees there's the bee there the detail on them is incredible isn't it they're gorgeous claire 12 by 12 centimetres um, in your honeycomb. Then you get the matching rose gold lobster claw, and then you get the rose gold chain, of which you get a length of, do we know the length of that chain? Do we know the length of the chain? Twenty centimeters a chain, which is what you'd obviously put, uh, Claire. You've put at the back of your designs. Yes, yeah, yeah. Amazing. So let's see if I'm, and you also get Claire your instructions. Yes. Oh, some nice weighty instructions there. I see. Yeah. Love it. Okay, so you get this alongside as well. Any questions? Do message in. We are live in the studio. So let's test the website. Let's see if everything's rectified and sorted. Forty nine ninety nine. Ignore that. Let's do something ridiculous. It's been one of those mornings, hasn't it? The last 30 seconds and we're gonna drop that price, jewelry makers, so, and we're gonna drop it in a big way too. Um, you get five Bs, five of the three-dimensional Bs. You get the 20 centimeter chain. You get the honeycomb sheet um, and, the, and the bolt ring clasp and Claire's instructions. I agree, Ross has just said those Bs alone would be 10 pound each at yeah, least. Yeah, the detail on them is lovely, isn't it? Oh, the bees, are, the bees are massive mm. motif at the moment. Gucci, Gucci yeah. using it, probably the most um, obvious. Alex Monroe, Lily mm. Rose. Yeah, yeah. Let's see if we're back up and running, jewelry makers, shall we? What? For five bees, for the honeycomb sheet, for the chain, for the lobster claw, and Claire's instructions, nineteen ninety nine. Oh my goodness me, we're at four pounds per bee. And absolutely everything else for free. What on earth is that? That's amazing. Have we got many of these projects? Okay, there's 50 or less of each of these projects. So um, I think, well, I can see movement on the web. Let us know. Do text in, jewelry makers. I can see some people checking out. We've done this price purely because of the issues. Um, yeah, we're just, we're kind of testing everything here. I like that. You're literally just using the jump rings. But that's what you can do because you, if you think about it, what you're getting there, it's almost like a, a parcel of fancy links, isn't it? You, yeah. You're just deciding uh, whether you want single links or whether you want to, you know, you have that have that line and a straight line, or you, you know, you sort mm -hmm. of, you know, graduate up up and down. It's for you to. So if you look at it, it is almost like that. You yeah. Know, you the, you make the arrangement. Yeah, don't absolutely. You? But but they are complete um, links of, of, of metal. And then you can either, you know, maybe if you do card, you know, cards as well, you could you could work with that. Um, but then there are different processes we can do uh, to harden the metal as well. I love it. Like, oh, so you can work hard on this yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. Um, let's bring the gold to air, which I think is going to be very popular because it's very rich, isn't it? Yeah, very very rich. And 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 it complements the bees, and obviously you've got. Um, the honeycomb colour, mm. haven't you? So yes, yeah. you get a 20 centimetre length of chain, jewellery makers. So, and, and it's a lovely chain. Yeah, it's a nice open link, isn't it? Yeah, gorgeous. Yeah. Then you get your lobster claw, which is a nice sizable lobster claw there as well. Let me grab my tweezers, you can see it then, can't you? Um, so you get the large lobster claw. You get the five bees with that very clever clip-on motif. genius, isn't it? So clever. Um, the detail in those bees as well. I'll pick one of them up so you can actually see it better. 
They're gorgeous, aren't they? Lovely. And then obviously you get the gold in the honeycomb, which is 12 by 12 centimeters. And you get Claire's um, instructions as well. You get that free, it's available upon dispatch of your order. 30 second clock, how many we got? Less than 50. Less than 50 available opportunities. The fact that you get a little, co your own little mini colony. <laughs> is it a colony? Yeah. And Claire's the queen bee. Oh. <laughs> Potato cooker, queen bee. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah. Why not? <laughs> no you honey. Have honey, but you can have squads. Um, I've got less than 50 of these available. I can see people checking out on this. They've been available on pre-order jewelry makers. You, hey, listen, don't knock potatoes. They're good. 29.99. 29.99 jewelry makers. Um, again, these are uh, gold plated. So you've got that precious metal content. Um, and the fact that you can make your own little arrangements. So obviously the necklace that we're looking at right now, you've got what, three? Is it three honeycombs? Yes, you've got different sections. Three honey. Yeah, so the three, three and the one. But I mean, it depends on whatever it is, whatever you want to do with it. And when we look at the demo as well, you'll be able to see um, when you work with that sheet, depending on where you cut it, um, you can either connect it with your jump rings or you could do I mean, rosary link or um, you can actually use some of the, the sheet itself to, um, to make the, the connecting links as well. Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Um, I had 50 jewelry makers. We are we have tested uh, the water with the rose gold. Is it is it is it is it working? We don't really know, to be honest. We can't really tell. we I mean I think we're using this as much as an excuse as any. Let's do it. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. I think we're just making excuses now. We shouldn't be going any lower than what's on your screens. We shouldn't be taking this under £20. We are going to just because it's been one of their mornings already. And we want to see um, how many of you are watching as well. I, I love these. I don't think we've ever done anything like it before. No, and it's, it's so cleverly designed in that it just, I just think once you put everything together, it looks very professional and neat, doesn't it? Gorgeous. So those, these are very clever. Absolutely stunning. You think how many connectors you can make out of this one twelve centimeter yeah, square? Yeah, yeah. You know, working with resin as well, you could you could That's maybe use idea. it use it with that. Okay, this shouldn't have happened, jewelry makers. We weren't meant to take it under twenty pounds, but like I said, it's been one of those mornings. Um, oh my goodness yeah i think this is an ideal project for us to test the water because gold is always one of the most popular i think particularly in anything um bee motif because mm. you've got that honey connection um that is a ridiculously low price again you get the 12 centimeter square sheet of gold plated honeycomb um then you get the 20 centimeter belt chain then you get five of your sort of clip-on bees and the lobster claw that's basically four pound per two-tone B mm. and then everything else for free amazing um, we're going to dive into the demonstration jewelry maker don't forget if you can access the web the malachite is available on pre-order jewelry makers so um, shop ahead on those folks to uh, guarantee yours make sure you're checking out on these projects as well make sure you're dialing through um, because uh, there was less than 50 of each of them I'm, I'm really looking forward to seeing this like cut out yeah, it's um. Take it away, Claire. Thank you. It's yeah, it is it is good, isn't it? And it's really tempting to just sort of dive in um and just start sort of snipping away. But if you can, if you can sort of like hold back, um and maybe think about uh the designs that, that you want to do because then you can have a little bit more order in where you are cutting. So, yeah, so don't just go straight. No, to the I mean it's you know I, I, it's really great to be spontaneous but with something like this I would plan it out a little bit because then you're going to get the most out of um out of the sheets. So you can see uh, I've sort of um uh, you can see I'm, I'm trying to use every single part of this as well and so what you're actually looking at is you're looking at the um uh, the the um the sections where you've got the um uh, the hexagons but you've also got these lovely shapes uh, coming down the sides as well you know so you've got slightly different um, if you sort of start looking at this one here you know it's slightly different uh, going down each side so these ones yeah. are a little bit larger um, than these sort of halves coming down here could you go almost like a like a Roman 
bath style, couldn't you? You can almost like think about tiles. Yes, yes. So if you look at it there, look, you've got a lovely flower there, haven't mm. you? If you start to, um, so that, you know, that's a really nice way of um, looking at maybe, you know, a colour in and you'll see then, it'll be, things will sort of start to um, jump out a little mm. bit more. So if you want to have the um, sort of sections where, um, so if we look at this bit here, so you've got, so this is what I'm saying, sort of, so each of these would be that, that fancy link. Yeah. But what you need to think about is, you're actually gonna sacrifice um, the ones that are, are surrounding it. So to get this complete one, what you are gonna do is you're gonna lose some of the ones that are next to it. So that's why I sort of have a think about it, which ones you're gonna cut out. So if I want to have, um, if I sort of show you this one. So this one here, where you've got that really, really nice discreet look. So you've got the, the and it's a great way to do it uh, using your jump rings and you get nice movement there. But maybe you don't wanna use the jump rings and you want to have that almost like a, it's a very, very, very discreet um, and it's still the um, from the sheet. You can see there's a, like a connecting loop there. So to do that, what we want is we need a little bit longer of this section here. So if I wanted to have it where I've got that connecting loop, the area that I'd want to be cutting out is going to be, so if we look here, it's I'm gonna utilize these sections here because mm. they are much longer than oh. anything else so, so these ones here so can you see so you're turning those into jump rings yes yeah oh. so that is if we use these ones along here this row here so these two it means that we can use this section here as opposed to this shorter section there that's okay clever. so it's just having a little bit of a it's i wouldn't say that's uh, that's the most natural way that i would usually work but it really is worth it with something like this so if i if i'm going to i'm going to make some earrings now so let's have a look so i'm going to have uh, let's have this one here and this is the one that I'm going to um, use and this is going to be the base for my earrings that I'm going to have my B on. So I know that I'm going to get rid of, I'm going to snip here and this one here so I can do these so they're short because I'm going to get rid of all of this and that means that I might have a, a longer length say if I wanted to use that one there and this one here so go in there and nice and short there and then this one so again nice and short and I know that I've got that longer length there so I'm going to come in let's get rid of that one there so again so I'm just going to come in and bring that there so I'm going to move this out of the way so we've got our um, mm -hmm the honeycomb there. So now I'm going to go in, I'm going to go in, and if you've got snips or your cutters, just go in there. So as close as I can without actually, because you know, the, the beauty of this is it, you know, these are really, really precise angles, lines. You don't want to then go in with your flush cutters and sort of, I don't know, add curves in really, because you're looking to get rid of that sharp edge, but still to keep that nice crisp, Shape. shape so I've gone in and you can see there so we've got a little bit the notches at the end so what I'm going to do now I've just if you've got a needle file or even if you don't have I mean this is a, you know this is a chunkier weightier just because it's going to get rid of quite a lot of material very quickly if you've got nail buffers um, you know an emery board you could you could work with that so I'm trying to just keep that corner but get rid of those sharper edges that I've just introduced by cutting so I'm just going to get rid of some of that that's fine so I'm going all the way around so I'm trying really hard not to uh, I, I don't want a really really sharp point so it's going to be uncomfortable or dangerous but I don't want to round it off too much either so I'm just working my way around and let's just do that finger test just check there's no sharp edges and one last one. So this is where you've got the, because you've got the lovely luster of the really, really polished finish. So you could leave it at that. But what's a really nice way, and this will actually work hard on it as well. I think it's a, I, I think it might be a, a, a brass core underneath the plating because although it's quite fine, uh, it's flexible, but it's mm. actually, it's, it's pretty, um, it's, it's quite solid as well so yeah, right I've got one more there so let's get rid of that one let's 
get rid of that. Probably cut that down a little bit more. So just a tiny bit. So it's worth, you know, you've got to think, spend your time just prepping these corners because you know like we said if you had to pierce all this out mm. you'd have been you'd still be here well i'd probably still be here setting the saw and the blade up but let's there we go okay so you can see so that the, the effect we've got on that is that it's highly polished so i'm going to bring this in i'm going to leave that bit for the moment i'm going to start to add in so i can either go in and just my flat side or if we want to go in and I can start and just give so this is a different texture and we'll see how this takes more of a, a line like a linear pattern rather than the usually I do a dappled and you can see we'll be able to see the the both so this is going to do two things it's going to obviously add in extra angles texture so it's going to you know work with the light differently it's also going to harden it so let's bring that in and so i could if i wanted to go back over that i could cross hatch that as well so just change the angle so i only do one side and you can see the difference there so if i hold that up now so oh, yeah. that is a lot more um it's a lot more rigid so that's no, and you can hardening. see, yes, you can see how it's catching the light. And you can see, so that side there, that's the one where um, I've, so I've gone in, in this direction and then I've changed the angle to so give it that, like a cross hatch rather than um, just the lines. So we left off this bit because what we want to do with this bit, this is the bit that we're going to um, turn in. So if I just get some, I'm just take that little edge off there. Okay. So now I'm going to just hold this and I'm going to roll this around. So if I do it like that, so you can see how this is now turning, turning in. Okay, so it's really, really nice I would and, never have thought and discreet. Of that, Claire, but that's really it's just a nice way to use. That's why it's it's good yeah. when you're looking at the looking at the sheet. Yeah. You know, look at which ones are, are going to be the longer the longer length for yeah. you and planning it out but that then means so you can see so that then we could so you can see the difference there so okay i know it's the um uh you've got the 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 silver here and then you've got the that the rose gold but you can see that if you use your different hammers and texture you're going to get a different effect it plays with the light differently so now with that one so if i added that one into there get my other pliers And let's just close that up and you can see how then and what because you've got the lovely angles that are really really uniform and neat it's going to sit you know good movement because we've we've used that longer length there so you can see it's not going to rub on it you've got a bit of wiggle room within that loop that you've created but that's going to sit really nicely then all you all you needed to do if you've got um you've got your lovely bees there we've got that it's really really clever clever bit there so think about you know these these bees have got um they're, they're quite weighty aren't they yeah. so i would think about how um when you're pinching them on maybe think about your positioning of uh, on the link of, of whereabouts you want them so all you would do is you just go in so if i turn that over so hopefully you can see with the silver and the gold there mm -hmm. and then you just get your get your pliers this is so clever it's really well designed, isn't it? Yeah. So I apologise this. So I'm going to hold it. I'm going to try and keep my finger out of the way. When I, when you do it at home, you might want to pop your finger sort of there, but I'm trying to do it so that you can see. see. Yeah. So you're just going to go in, squeeze that down, and you can see so it's still you've got a bit of movement, and then that's going to sit. Ah. Sit on there. Could you do like a whole bracelet? yeah connectors. yes yeah if you wanted to do a bracelet i would say you're definitely you, you you would struggle i think to leave it plain i would definitely go in and work hard and from both yeah. both sides yeah 
and maybe curve it a little bit if you've got maybe some nylon jaw or something like that or oh. a bracelet mandrel oh, yeah, you can see you how easy that is shapes. yeah yeah definitely definitely what about one could. as a ring you could do that yeah. too couldn't yeah. you yeah but really really lovely you know a lovely pendant so you just had that on its own on a chain yeah beautiful but you can see how well and they actually work really nicely together don't they the mix of the colors claire these are absolutely amazing They're really clever aren't they yeah really gorgeous. really clever project um okay jewelry makers we have got one more colorway to bring you we think we think we are back which is perfect timing because we're about to introduce what we think is going to be the most uh, most popular project by the way malachi has been popular on pre-order 70 might sound like a big quantity believe me it's not um so if you do love the bracelet um, that i've been wearing since yesterday mm. then it's on pre-order right now this is bullseye malachi we've got 70 available it's, Gosh, it's, it's epic gorgeous. isn't and it every single one is incredible yeah because you think i mean that one there right there prime example malachite forms like the rings of a tree mm. if you imagine something like dripping because it forms in stalactites and stalagmites dripping 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 over over thousands of years it and the ripples that occur within water that's what you see in these bands of green the actual eye or peacock's eye or bullseye often referred to as well um, of the malachite is the most sought after part and you get it in every single one so this is coming up jewelry makers you can go shop ahead on this one um, the color is insane and i know i keep saying this jewelry makers but our malachite has always been good here at jewelry maker mm. and that might sound a little bit arrogant but it's true our malachite has always been good but this is off the chart do you know what i mean um yeah i mean let's i mean i know christmas is what 92 days claire is it 92 days away Ooh, what plenty a of gift. time what well, it's not <laughs> what a lovely gift this would be for christmas yes yeah for so many different tastes <laughs> 99 days before you go into panic mode uh, <laughs> oh got more people to buy for now claire i know can be organized. And do like a yeah bigger Christmas turkey and all that yeah potatoes <laughs> and, uh, yeah. and the different varieties of potatoes <laughs> it's coming up jewelry makers so I do encourage shopping ahead on that one right shall we bring you the last colorway of the honeycombs this is the silver I'm gonna do a 30 second clock um because we believe we're back yes well done the IT department just in time for the silver um so you get five of your bees it's a launch oh we've got a new clock oh yeah uh you get the silver <laughs> then <laughs> then you get it's like it's perfect for our deal today then you get the 20 centimeter length of chain nice belts of chain there so you get that you get five of your bees and you get what we believe is going to be the most popular colour of your honeycomb is the silver plated. That's Look lovely. That. Don't forget, you also get Claire's amazing instructions. I'm running out of hands, Claire. How many have you got, Ross? 50 on the nose. Oh, that's not going to be enough. Some nice photography, Claire. Thank you. Very, very nice. Thanks. Um, first price crash, not what we're paying. Let's see if we truly are back up and running. $19.99! Oh my goodness, that's the first price crash. So you get five of these little clip-on bees. That's such a clever idea, isn't it? They're so clever. Biggest... Oh, have they gone around the wrong way? Biggest quantity... There you go. Sorry, that's me. Biggest quantity, and we're going to do the lowest price. Oh, they're gorgeous, Claire. And that's literally using two of your honeycombs and two bees. Yeah, and so you can see you've got the, the difference in, the, you know, if you work over it and you give that dappled effect of the hammered, the hammered link at the bottom. So you're not actually using any other findings. That, you know, make your earring findings or, if, you know, if you've got some shepherd hooks, we don't need any of the jump rings because you you're making be, it all. You don't have to be a silversmith. No, no. You can literally just, it's basically sort of rolling and folding. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> yeah, with your... <laughs> <laughs> no, but rolling your precious metal, uh, rolling the metal, rolling and folding basically the bees over. Yes. How amazing is that? We're going even lower, jewelry makers. We are back. Yeah, the last of the bee projects. 
Um, we've got the butterflies. They're coming up next. And the malachite's coming up as well. Your early bird's coming up. A little bit late, the early bird today. Wow. Do not go anywhere. We've had all the IT issues, but I think we've sorted it now. Hence why you're seeing these amazing, um, amazing prices. $17.99, Claire. That's so good, isn't it? So good. And, and I mean, you obviously... Um, look around at different sort of places where you can source items but have you ever seen anything like this before no i mean the, i've never i don't think i've worked with um where they've you know you've had that like a, a something as as fancy as that that is so discreet as that that you can literally clip on clip and then you add that that detail and something as as pop you know so popular as a bee and you can see that was with you know chain nose pliers and you can see how you know that is lovely and and, and secure now on there yeah no glue no other findings brilliant absolutely brilliant so if you if you count the bees as an individual component that's what so five add the chain six then the honeycomb seven and the clasp eight and the instructions nine two pound per component Two pound for your instructions, two pound for the honeycomb, two pound for a bee. If we sold those bees individually, there's been mm, no chance yeah. on earth that we'd yeah. be bringing them to you at two quid. And you know, we're a jewelry maker, we do some amazing prices. Yes, yeah. No chance they would be two pound each. Well done everybody, congratulations. Um, okay, shall we do what, uh, look, I, I, I love it when we are proved wrong here at Jewelry Maker because like I came into the studio Claire and I'll be honest when when I first saw you this morning I looked I was like oh, gravitated towards these projects mm. absolutely beautiful I immediately thought they were cut they were cut glass yeah because it is it is isn't it if, if you that's exactly what you want carnelian to look like if that is perfection with that well that I've never seen and, carnelian yeah. that red yeah. before and I think it's the quantity as well that you're getting with it yeah so if you'd have asked me, and generally this was about seven o'clock this morning, if you'd have asked me, L, um, what's this? I'd have said faceted glass. Would we all agree? Obviously Claire yeah, knows. Yeah. I would assume that this was man-made because the color. When have we ever seen carnelian, which is like a pillar box red? Mm. It's normally much more orangey, isn't it? Beautiful, isn't it? Look at that. Oh my goodness, that's amazing. That's the best carnelian I've brought to wear. Yeah, yeah. I would be buying this project. I actually don't know what it's going to yet. I would be buying this project for one of for those that, strands. Yeah, yeah. One of those strands. Now, you get three, and you get this oh, amazing gold-plated 925 sterling silver with a white topaz can you see the it's like Gorgeous, it's one of those it? butterflies that got has got the double wings do they have double wings just thinking that loud or is it in flight is that what it is is that design in flight or it's a kaleidoscope of butterflies hmm. oh my goodness amazing look at that carnelian that is off the chart you get three strands jewelry makers and of course you get the instructions this is a nice weighty instruction clearly hmm. um you get the um instructions for your filigree butterflies sorry we, my sister-in-law's called, called claire and we oh, call i get called clary yeah, do you yeah. we call her clary family, yeah, clary or claire bear yes uh, yeah. you get that too um so you get the instructions to make this beautiful filigree butterfly uh, necklace that you can see here in the studio with that gorgeous tassel that carnelian is off the chart. It's wonderful, isn't it? Do we all agree that it's that good we thought it was man-made? Something like a fire polish or something yeah, like yeah, that? Yeah, It's not, it's a genuine gemstone. I think it's how uniform it is as well, because the quantity, yeah. so it means that you can do things like, you know, you do your lovely tassels, you don't have, you're not adding something. Absolutely, you can add it to a chain if you want to, but it means that you can do really, really gem indulgent pieces, can't you, by yeah. having that. That amount. Well, imagine those carnelians dotted in between your green angelite. Yes, yeah, perfect. Your deal of the yeah, day. Yeah. Roscoe, do you remember us relaunching carnelian? And we actually had, um, a, I think it was quite a brief presentation, wasn't it? But nothing 
nothing they were lovely don't get me wrong but there was nothing anywhere near the same mm. color as what's mm. on your screens that is almost pillar box red now jewelry makers three strands that is gold plated sterling silver and you've got a dazzling white topaz in the center there and the instructions under 50 pounds all day long that's amazing if i was to sit here talk about carnelian you know and you do the introduction you talk about the gemstone you talk about the history of the gemstone which i know i've done not that long ago um and then we get into maybe a showcase that might consist of i don't know eight strands possibly if we're lucky because there was a period of time we had none of it do you remember wait that's also natural carnelian that's why i put it with you know when i held it up with the um seems like a long time ago now the uh malachite strand that we had earlier that's why i put that because it, it you know malachite has got such a power hasn't it yeah. to it you, you can't you know you need to team it with something if you're going to put another color next to it it needs to be really Strong hold color. its own doesn't it oh my goodness 30 seconds we are going lower jewelry makers that's amazing Gorgeous. absolutely yeah. amazing jewelry makers good luck how many you got roscoe 50 exactly i'm tempted by this project claire mm. i love the red i like mm. i said i don't think there's many red gemstones you know and that's including like your rubelites oh yes um and your rubies uh, mother nature is particularly stingy with natural reds she is mm. or yeah. if you yeah. see red it's usually very expensive yes because yeah. it's, uh, uh, you know, Mother Nature, that's why red as a pigment is incredibly expensive. Mm. It forms rarely in Mother Nature. We're bringing you three strands, jewelry makers. What? That's, you're buying your butterfly, you're getting three strands of some of the best quality uh, carnelian mm. that I've ever seen. Do we all agree? Without shadow of a doubt, that's a topaz set in there. I'm putting your... Oh, um, put your early birds. Yeah. Ah, Claire. That's right nice there. together, that's yeah. That's why you're the designer. Oh. That's amazing. Absolutely amazing. If you put maybe some of your bees in there as well. Yes, yeah, lovely. There's your butterflies yeah. and bees again. But I mean, you could just do loads of stacker braces, couldn't oh, you? With, gorgeous. With that. Absolutely. Look at the detail on this butterfly. I'm just going to hold it that way for a second. I mean, look. You've got layers within your butterfly. I mean, look at that. It's wonderful, isn't it? It's amazing, isn't it? And you don't often get, do you? Uh, pieces of, of jewelry you know it's, it's quite sculptural isn't it yeah. it's not you know it'd be really lovely detail if you just had one of those layers and it and it was flat it'd be gorgeous but the fact you know you've got three of them look at those it's very van cleef they've got a collection mm. quite similar to this um it goes beautifully with the malachi you can deconstruct this if you wanted to it will go um, um amazing with the carnelian it's available on pre-order right now so you can shop ahead on this lovely jewelry makers um amazing sorry roscoe i know i'm very much still raving about these projects and i've looked up and the graphics have gone so check out your baskets on that project i'm going to move on because we've got the spinel this is quite Christmassy, I think, this one is. This would be like, you know... 92 days. Yeah. 92 days. Look at this. Do you remember us launching these, Claire? Yes. In our yeah. house? Yeah, yeah. And we went, and I was like, Claire, make a stretchy. And we yes. wore those stretchies yeah, for ages. Yeah, yeah. Do you remember? Yeah. Um, you get three strands. And these were, if I remember rightly, fourteen ninety five when we first launched your coated spinels. Do you remember? Mm. Yeah, they were fourteen ninety five per strand. And it per really strand. works, doesn't it? It really works having that that coating on there. It's just, uh, yeah, ultimate sparkle. Yeah, because you don't think that spinel could get more lustrous, do you? But mm. actually, it can. Mm. Um. So yeah. So that's what thirty four. Sorry. 45, I beg your pardon. And then the butterfly, what do you think? How much do you think for the butterfly? 15, really? Okay, let's go with that. Because there, there's a natural spinel in there and it is solid sterling silver. That's a lovely project. So that means, yeah, 59.99. I'm more than comfortable with that. And you get Claire's instructions now. I tell you what, let's half it. Because we're all about the deals and the inspiration. And tell you we're still not done. Have I got 50 again? Exactly 50. 
coated black spinel, I'm clear, I agree with you, Claire, particularly in the run up to Christmas. Mm. Um, always a big seller. We normally have like um, like an hour of it, don't we? And every single piece will absolutely sell out. That's I haven't seen it stage. in ages. No, no, and in that size. You're getting three strands. Yeah. Again, I literally thought these were faceted glass, like a check glass. Claire. It was a good deal at twenty nine ninety nine. It's an unbelievable deal at twenty four pounds a night. Wait, that's six pound a component? No, there or thereabouts, and one pound for your instructions. Well, you wouldn't get you wouldn't get base metal, I don't think, would you? No, anything like that. And don't forget, like you were saying, if you want to deconstruct things. Maybe you've got, I don't know, a strand of pearls or you want to work the, the butterfly with something else. You know, you could do it um, so it's sort of sitting asymmetrically at the neckline if you wanted to um, and connect in and not from both, you know, because you've got both loops. But if you wanted to have it as a pendant, so in exactly the same way as we went in and we snipped off and we filed down, you know, on, okay. the, on the honeycomb, there's nothing to stop. You could just turn that into a pendant, get rid of that loop at the bottom and then, you know, you just oh, pop yeah, a bail at the top. Oh yeah, there's a loop at the bottom, so you could... Yeah, so it's like you make it into a connector and I put a tassel at the end of it, or you could just have it as a pendant. Um, okay, Ross is confessing that he actually thought these were base metal. Oh, no, no, no. They're not base metal, Ross. They're sterling silver, so I tell you what, we're going to have to put a clock to close on this because we've gone too low. Uh, 24.99. I thought it was a bit low, mm. Ross. I mean, amazing for our audience right now. Our mistake is your gain. Same with Carnelian. Did you not realise that was base metal too? Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, they're amazing projects. Hello, Christine and Sandra and Renfusha and Buckinghamshire and Conway and Marge and Dorset and Linda and Angelina. Hello to you, Maker in Suffolk, Julie, Cardiff, Christine, Alison, Shelley. Make sure you're checking out everybody. We're back. Yay. <laughs> it looks like everything's sorted now. Just in time, eh, for Claire's amazing projects. And also don't forget the Malachite is coming up on the other side of this as well. And your early bird, we haven't forgotten about that. We're not gonna um, not play that. Oh yes. Yeah. So beautiful S class. We had, did you say 50? 50 of this project as well. Started with 50. You've got nine seconds to get it, get this, because we are at, at a base metal price tag for what isn't base metal. Um, because of all the technical issues, jewelry makers, what we're gonna do, I'm going to show you um, how to purchase with us here at Jewelry Makers. So, because we also are very mindful that on a daily basis, um, on a daily basis, we have new customers who tune in, and I do get it. I remember my first purchase with Shopping TV, and it's like, oh, what do I do? You know, it's it's um, how do I actually navigate around this? It's super simple. So, we're going to show you how to buy with us, and also Jewelry Makers, we're going to come back with your amazing star by opportunity, this absolutely beautiful bullseye malachite bracelet. So check this out, to shop with jewelry makers, it's as easy as this. Shopping with jewelry maker couldn't be easier. You can shop via our website at www.jewelrymaker.com where you can watch our live shows and see all the products from that day. We also have a huge amount of products on our website, from your jewellery room essentials to gemstones, tools, precious metals and much more. You can download and shop on the go with our Jewellery Maker app. Simply head over to your app store and search Jewellery Maker. Alternatively, you can contact our UK-based call centre 24 hours a day on 0800 644 655. Shopping made easy at Jewellery Maker. I think we'd all agree gemstones will always peak and trough in terms of popularity malachite has got is steeped in history dates back literally thousands of years but of the moment right now it has never been more popular and I'll be honest with my colleagues on our sister channel I've got a little bit of a smug smug face because the, no, because when we were over in Tucson, it was a little bit of a team joke, shall we say, 
that if ever Elle wandered off, something caught my attention and the team like, where's she gone? Where's she gone? Um, they would hunt down the Malachite and they would find me there. And they were like, you're obsessed with this gemstone. And this is because gems at the time didn't really have Malachite. Gems didn't do showcases of Malachite. Am I wrong, guys? Not really. It was, they used to do amber. You didn't know about it until you came to Jewelry Maker, not really. They used to do amber. They used to do Larimar. Um, obviously do the obvious gemstones as well, but I'm trying to think of the sort of quite quirky different gems. They never really got, and this is only what, 2022 20, was it? They, they, they didn't really get Malachite. And, and I remember saying, having a conversation with Angeline, I was like, mark my words, this will be one of the most popular gemstones in um, the next few years. And it could not be any more popular. Because what do we, what does a gemstone need to, what three traits, this is GIA now, there are three points that a gemstone um, needs to be to be quantified as a gemstone. So firstly, it needs to be beautiful. And you can't deny Malachi is breathtakingly beautiful. It needs to be rare. So that's, that opens up the argument, by the way. Some people say Fordite is not a gemstone. It is, because it's rare and it is beautiful. The third is not the word natural. The third, although Malachi is, it needs to be durable. So you need to be able to wear it as a piece of gemstone. So again, at no point does it actually say that it, it, it can't be man-made. So Fordite, for that reason. Mm. So beautiful, uh, durable, and beautiful. Mm, did I say it twice? Sorry. Durable, rare, and beautiful. Of your Malachi, which like I said in 2024 is absolutely everywhere, isn't it? I think you would be really hard pushed to find particularly your luxury Maisons which don't have Malachi in their collection. It does make it even more tricky to uh, for us to access um, because again, I'm going to tell you in Tucson I saw no strands. And genuinely, no strands. I saw free forms, I saw slices, no strands whatsoever. This parcel though is not just any malachite. I need to point that out. So the person that has provided this bullseye malachite, sometimes known as peacock's eye as well, who provided this opportunity, this is uh, his, his message to you. He said, the bullseye malachite with the concentric circles is the rarest of all the opaque gemstones we deal with. That's massive, isn't it? We are mm, not talking mm. about just malachite. He says, the bullseye malachite with the concentric circles is the rarest of all opaque gemstones we deal with. Um, we have to select from thousands of kilos of rough and it's less than 1% of all the malachite mm. we cut one less yeah. than one yeah. percent we have requests from big jewelry houses who already offer malachite as a premium gemstone but we cannot offer the quantity or the consistency for this type now can i just say we don't need to take his word to get our okay, yeah, yeah. we already know that we've seen malachite in van cleef and arpels for example where it's the linearly banded isn't it um, I've shown you those pieces previously before. I've shown you, here you go. So do you notice how you can see the lines, but you don't see the eye? We've got the evidence, we've got the photographs. You go onto any of their mm. websites. That's 23,000 pounds, by the way. There you go, see linearly banded, but there's no eye. Why, let me just answer a question as well. Single bead in Harrods for Piaget, um, 2,000 pounds. Now you might be thinking, Shopard, same, linearly banded, still beautiful, don't get me wrong, 18,000 um, pounds that, for that lovely double row necklace, happy hearts. But can I just answer the question, because I know people, there might be a few people that are skeptical. Look, if you've got jewelers as, that with jewelry as expensive as those, why aren't they bringing the best quality? I'll tell you why, because you get less than 1% one, 1 of it will actually include the eye. They, do, they believe it or not, even though they're that expensive, they will sell thousands of those necklaces, thousands. So they have to actually drop down a grade. And that applies, by the way, mother of pearl. 
they have to drop down a grade to actually be able to uh, to have enough consistent quality less than one percent of malachite will actually have the bullseye um uh, are they going to say from these are often offered as one um of a kind due to their scarcity and as such are often set into 18 karat gold and again we've shown a piece like that haven't we which is set in 18 karat gold it's a one offering framed um framed bullseye and it's thousands of pounds thousands upon thousands of pounds but look at it this way look at it this way instead of thinking about the actual gemstone let's think let's because it forms in a similar way to a tree does all right different materials but bear with me on this one when a, when a, when a, is it a sapling tree is planted when a sapling is planted the trunk is very small isn't it very very small very very narrow and each year it grows it has another concentric circle another concentric circle another concentric circle and then when you get to um sort of the big vast trees can you imagine what those concentric circles but so if i was to cut something out the exterior of that trunk you would have the linearly banded now there's lots of that but that bit in the center the sapling bit that's what you are looking at right now the sapling of the of the malachite that's why it's as rare as it is so here you go 2826 pounds i'll be honest i'm not that keen on that because yes it is the bullseye but it doesn't have the luster that you're about to see in this in this bracelet there are 70 available opportunities to say this is a, the quad a of the tanzanite world or to say this is the d to the diamond world is an understatement less than one percent i did reference peacock's eye i personally prefer that expression personally but um a lot of traders refer to it as, uh, as bullseye malachite it's the same thing basically now this is my favorite article and i can't talk about malachite we're just mentioned just reading a few paragraphs malachite is the eternal paradise in shades of green mm. um it's perfectly put it's probably one of my favorite publications that they've actually read but let's read this malachite properties malachite is a highly distinctive agreed um, with its variegated banding and rich emerald green colours. That colour comes from the copper deposits where malachite is often found. In fact, malachite itself is used as a source of copper via process of smelting. Can I just say, not anymore. I don't use malachite for that anymore. I use it as a gemstone. Often malachite is found alongside azurite, which is a brilliant blue gemstone that also forms in copper rich areas. Concentrically banded malachite, known as peacock's eye, is especially sought after as it is rarer than the linearly banded gemstone. So that's the jewellery editor, which is completely separate to us, obviously, uh, here at JM, telling you that the concentric is rarer than the, the linear. Um, they go on to say, talk about the hardness and where it can actually form um, as a gemstone. You are sourcing the eye of the malachite the sapling of the malachite and hopefully I've explained mm. why it's as rare as it is when you know the moment I saw this and I saw it a few weeks ago um, I discovered I knew it was it, it wasn't on our shift um, I knew that it was coming on the weekend and I was like okay I'm tuning in to get that bracelet because it's absolutely insane the quality are you gonna buy it Roscoe um, I think you should I'll take it off for a second let's go along take the time to appreciate every single bullseye that you get here or peacock's eye whichever way you want to refer to it so every single one peacock's eye peacock's eye you might want to turn it peacock's wow, eye look. these are the saplings do you know that's always how I'm gonna think of it now mm. the sapling of the malachite we have been waiting yeah, for a ready-made piece of bullseye malachite. Look at every single one. Every isn't it? one, Claire. Look at that. And also, they're quite often double bullseye because, yeah, obviously, obviously you've got that central part. Wow! Look at every them. single one, and it's not dyed. It's totally natural. I did this last night. I was just sat, just admiring. Mm. Look, you've got. Look at that. Another thing, remember, Queen Camilla, who has access to any gemstone. Do you know we've gifted her jewellery, Queen Camilla? There she is wearing her malachite, her linearly banded malachite, because it's Van Cleef and Arpels, which is lovely, don't get me wrong. 
but it's not bullseye malachite it's not the eye of the malachite mm. jewelry makers it has been on pre-order but what we're going to do is we're going to give you a minute to officially bring the graphics to air what an amazing gift this would be like i said my husband last night he was like oh, i like your bracelet and he was like what's the gemstone like, come on you know this and i looked at him i was like you know this is one of my favorite gems of all time malachite and he was like yeah that's cool that's cool i'd I, i'd like that and kind of just waited i was like well you're not having it yet um it's unbelievable isn't it i'd have to make it bigger for him so maybe if I get two in this auction opportunity and I can make it that little bit bigger for them. Look at the quality of the bullseye malachite. Oh, that's a cool picture. That's a really cool picture. Mm. So you've got um, Kate Moss wearing her malachite there. She's gorgeous, isn't she? 18 seconds, jewelry makers. This has been available on pre-order. I was wearing it since yesterday Yesterday when I picked up the... That's li literally... Look at that. I'm forever in my head now, and it kind of came to me when I was on air then. If you think this is the sapling, isn't it? It's the, it's, it's the baby, the eye of the Malachi, mm. you know, where it all began, yes, where this yeah. gemstone grew from. Yeah, which is wonderful, isn't it? And it is the top grade. It gets no finer than bullseye Malachite no finer than what's on your screens we have to select from thousands of kilos of rough imagine that and it's less than one percent of all the malachite we cut uh, roscoe can you show you know that cave and the reason why i'm showing you this is actually a disused malachite mine um because um malachite is very shallow forming um you can't dig to great depths once it's gone, it's gone effectively. Um, but this is a, um, a mine in Russia. And you look at that, you know, that's just the entrance. You can see the azurite alongside it there. So none of that would have bullseye, firstly. And then if I go to the stalactite photo, uh, you'd think, oh, there's loads there. Yeah, maybe in the middle, in the middle. You have to sift through hundreds of kilos to be able to get that eye of the malachite. Jewelry makers. We've got 70 available and there's people multi-buying on this. It's the best grade, I'll be honest, that I've ever seen, hence what, and I have bought Malachite quite a lot from Jewelry Maker. I've got the Malachite Bullseye Bangle. This is the best grade I've seen though, because every single one of those, what are they, nine millimeter rounds? They had to be that bit bigger as well to house the Malachite, mm. has got that bullseye. Oh my goodness, Look at that. So the reality is here, and we've just shown you, lesser grade, one single round. Not even a bullseye at Piaget is two grand. One single round is two grand. We're bringing you a full brace, an eight inch bracelet. If you want to deconstruct it, you absolutely can. And by the way, that's the last one at Harrods. Do you see that? Do you see the concentric banding on that one? I can't see any banding on that one, to be honest. It's not the best photograph. Not the best photograph. We're at a thousand pounds, but that's not what we're stopping. Let's half that price. Surely you might be thinking, oh, well, that can't be the same gemstone. No, 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 it is. It's just we saw, we haven't got the harrods overheads we haven't got to pay the likes of kate moss we don't do the millions of pounds worth on marketing we go direct to source where possible and we work on tiny margins as opposed to their massive margins we are bringing you plus remember jewelry makers um they will need thousands of carrots to make any one piece multiple times to sort of accommodate the entire world's demand for those designer brands. We've managed to access 70, but every single one of them, every, every single one of them is of that uh, um, top grade. There are loads of multi buys mm. on this. I'm not surprised though. What a lovely gift this would be. You know, and again, your jewelry makers, if you want to, if you wanted to deconstruct it, you can. It's beautifully made. It's on a nice look. Can you see that? Nice solid green elastic in the center. So I personally won't be changing it. Um, but like I said, you've got lots of talent and ability to maybe knot it if you wanted to. You might take it apart and say, I'm going to use them as individual solitaires. 
like Piaget have done. Let's get this price moving because we're not even stopping there, jewelry makers. Nicolette, well done. Jane's got three. Atia, well done to you. Uh, Cumbria's got two. Suja's got two. Angela, Tracy, and an honest maker. New customers getting involved. The reason why I'm just keep moving it is because I want you to know you might look at it like that and go, well, that one's not. That's not a bullseye. No, no it definitely is. Every single one is a bullseye. Mm. We have three more price crashes, jewelry makers. Three more from now, that is. The first. Can you see why can you see why I got involved, why I bought it? It's the best that we've ever seen. And, 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 I, and I, I almost feel bad saying we've had lovely Malachi over the years, and we really have. But this is this is on a whole other level, level isn't it? Look at that luster. Every single one is a peacock, um, peacock or bullseye, whichever way you want to word it. Everyone has those distinctive. Remember, remember, jewelry editors say Malachi is the outlandish eccentric, once seen, never forgotten. Every single one of them has got those wonderful natural colours, and mm -hmm. they are natural. Please be mindful, by the way, of synthetic Am Amazon, um, Malachi out there, um, because there is a lot. There's a lot of synthetic Malachi out there. It's dreadful. You can see usually. Um, but with a gemstone as popular, but also as rare as Malachi actually is, of course, it lends itself. People are then going to go want to recreate mm. it. We have three price crashes. That, believe it or not, is your first price crash. Second. This is where it's going to start heating up on the web and on the phone lines. Seriously, though, if, are any of those pieces that we have shown you, even the ones that aren't bullseye, are any of them £99.99? And 99 pence? Nowhere near. You know, you go to places like Astley Clark where you get a slither of malachite, a slither, and that's £350. You go to places like, I mean, this is the thing, Dolce & Gabbana are actually using, making a malachite resin. Mm. Well, look how it's imitated, isn't it? So, you know, in, uh, you think about home furnishings as mm. well, you know, I can think of, you know, inside covers of books, you know, that, it, that people do because it's such an impressive colour pattern, isn't it? So you do, people do want to imitate it. You know what we've been saying about Amazonite for the past year or so? How it's like, it's starting to get traction. It's like the wheels are spinning. Mm. That, that, that happened to Malachite about two years ago. And it is in full swing mm. right now, jewelry makers, full swing. And that's why I said earlier on, I feel a little bit smug about this because I was saying to our, 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 my colleagues, I was, told you, I told you so. Look at some of these pieces that include malachite. High-end jewellers. That's shop art, isn't it? You can tell that shop art. That's amazing. Ah, oh, Piaget. Teamed with the finest diamonds and emeralds. Beautiful. Look at that. Set in a huge amount of white mm. gold. And rightfully so, don't you think? And by the way, that's also the linearly banded. Another example. Oh, that's amazing. Gosh, look at that. Is that Cartier? Oh, it's a it's watch as well. Oh, gosh, that's incredible, isn't Amazing. it? Amazing. Bulgari. I'm not keen on that. It's not great Malachite. Is it? It's not great Malachite, that. Mm -hmm. That's Bulgari. Diva's dream. Pendant with diamonds and a Malachite in rose gold. Again, Cartier, the Amulet de Cartier ring with a diamond. Really simple designs, but again, that's perfect linear. Again, if you, uh, uh, and, and this is what is happening. And we're bringing you a rarer variety. So hopefully we've explained that. Oh, they're lovely. Uh, Bucalati, incorporating them into the opera earrings, but again, per linearly lined. Not so much at the top though, um, but I like that. I like the fact that every single one will be completely unique. Check this out. Wow, Boucheron. I've got friends that work in Boucheron. So that is teamed alongside Colombian Emerald, Mother of Pearl, Diamonds, 
and lacquer and white gold. Wow. This is where Malachite is right now. And we said we've got three price crashes. I've brought you two. You have got a four-way split pay. We are already under £100. 60 seconds because we go even lower, jewellery makers. Do we all agree? Malachite sits shoulder to shoulder alongside Colombian emeralds. Some mm. of your finest diamonds. It is considered a luxurious gemstone, and rightfully so. It screams luxury. It's one of the most distinctive gemstones that I think Mother Nature has ever produced. Um, and you're getting the top grade. Hopefully I've explained what quantifies the top grade malachite. Yes, luster plays a big, par uh, big part in it. Yes, you want those variations of greens. You want color zoning in malachite, basically. You don't want it. The reason why I didn't like that Bulgari pendant, can we go back to that, is there was very little color zoning. Can you see? V yes, you could. very dull. Notice how dull? Not the, the separations of color aren't really vibrant. There's no contrast, is there? Yeah. Yeah. You want that, don't you, Claire? Yeah, and I think with that as well, you, d you want the curves, don't you, with the design. It's like maybe they wanted it to be that, the, the bull's eye, but mid. couldn't get it, yeah. You are getting that, the heart of the Malachite. It is, isn't it? It's the heart of the Malachite. And you're at £79.99 pence only. We had 70 available jewellery makers. Um, over half the stock has gone already. Well done, Angela. Suju's got two. Cumbria has got two. Tracy, Atia, Jane, who got three. Nicolette, Patricia, Barbara, Susan, Tracy, Leslie, Janet in Merseyside, Alan in Manchester, Geraldine and Catherine. Well done, Patricia. Another Catherine Wiltshire. New customers getting involved are absolutely amazing. Again, if you are looking for the best, and not just, I don't just say this casually, this is the best that I think we've ever offered. And I mm. own Malachite from Jewelry Maker. Yeah, um, yeah. Would me you too. Agree? Yeah, and it's incredible, isn't it? But this is, yeah, it's another level. Every single one of them has that bullseye. It's unbelievable. Mm. And for, 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 for my husband who clocked this last night, it was like, wow, that's amazing. I love that, that's cool. Um, I'd wear that. <laughs> I was like, okay, so I think I need to get another one of these. I've got the final 11. You can still do it, jewelry makers, but you do need to be quite quick checking out your baskets. 19.99 on split pay. What a great gift mm. this would be. Get one of our luxury boxes, which we've got on the weekend, haven't we? We've got some lovely boxes coming up oh, on the nice. weekend for Christmas yeah, gifting. Yeah. Pop this in there. High-end jewellery. You are mm. gifting high-end jewellery. Nicolette's got two. Well done. Hillary, you can do it. Make if you want three. I've got seven available on our website right now. So again, if you press your option one key, Stella, you can do it. And you, Pauline. You can leapfrog everybody on the web. If it's sat in your basket, it's not guaranteed to you until you confirm. You can always combine your order. You can do that. No additional cost. Just because you check out doesn't mean you've stopped... You have to pay your postage once again. Combine your order. Um, absolutely unbelievable. Now, oh, jewellery gorgeous. makers, it's been a funny day. And if you're thinking we're a little bit late today, that's because we had all the IT issues. But it's sorted now by the looks. So what we're going to do, go to the Wall of Fame. But in the meantime, we're going to put all of your natural green angel eye on pre-order. We have not seen this in absolutely ages. And I have to tell you, jewelry makers, it was a parcel we didn't think we'd see again. Um, our supplier said, no, it's done. Green angel eye and peacock angel eye, it's done, he said. That's all Mother Nature had to offer. It's a huge demand for, uh, um, for the green and peacock in particular. Uh, <clears throat> Um, I don't know if it's, I'm going to say it. I prefer, much prefer it to the blue. I like the blue, don't get me wrong, but I love the green. Mm. Absolutely love it. So it's all available on pre-order. You've got the shorter lengths in the 10 and the 12 millimetres, which brings that price down as well. You've got it in 8, 6, 4, and you've got a faceted round strand as well, which I don't think I've seen before. Um, so make sure you are checking out. But first up, your wonderful creations in the Wall of Fame. <laughs> McDonald, we've got some beautiful I know, amazing. Pieces. I know. Lovely projects that we've just had. Yes, yeah, what a morning. More amazing projects still yeah. to come. 
Would you? But it's only just started, you know. Only just started because remember your dealer days around the corner. Yes, so exciting. Yes, I will do. Here we go. So I have got uh, six zero four, oh, and this lovely. is Joe Green. And Joe says, this week's entry are resin and gold leaf earrings. Have been inspired by Alison's resin demos. So nice to give another medium a go. They're gorgeous. Good luck, Joe. Beautiful. Very nice, Joe. Um, I've got a lovely necklace, Ooh. which would go beautifully with those earrings, actually. Lovely. And this is from uh, Janet Batty. Hello to you, Janet. You're number 603. Um, hi to all at Jewelry Maker. Uh, here is my entry into the Wall of Fame. I've decided it was time to use some of my Unikite beads. I love these stones and have teamed them with some hematite, red agate spaces and rose gold findings. All around uh, a beautiful centre stone from a bead scoop. The necklace will be a gift for someone I know who loves these colours. The lovely jewellery maker gift bags have arrived too. Um, so all ready to go. Good luck to all in this week's draw. That's gorgeous, Janet. Loving beautiful. that. Lucky friend, you're yeah. 603. Yeah, good luck. Look at this. This is lovely. Here we go. This is uh, 606 and this is Julia Tinsley. Julia says, hi all at JM. Here is my entry for this week's Wall of Fame draw. I've created this lovely lariat waterfall necklace and earrings using beautiful freshwater pearls and tourmaline chips and I love it. I hope you like it too. With love to everyone at JM and my fellow entrants. And that's from Julia. That is gorgeous. Very lovely, nice, yeah. Julia. Good luck. Beautiful. Yeah. Loving that. I have, again, a beautiful, it's a microfaceted gems, beautiful suite of jewellery. And this is from uh, Sally Moore. Hello to you, Sally. Uh, your number 605. This week's entry are resin and gold leaf earrings. Um, I've been inspired by Alison's resin demos. So nice to give another medium a go. Oh, I like that. Oh. Yeah, turning your hand to a new medium. Very nice. Loving that. Your Sally Moore. Um, Beautiful. Wait till you see this. Oh. Wait till you see this. Look at this. Here we go. This is a... Uh, 608 wow. and this is zoe lister zoe says good morning uh all this uh, this will be my second entry to the wall of fame i wanted to share this amazing kit all from jewelry maker set with beautiful pearls and sterling silver white topaz clasp that's amazing absolutely stunning absolutely amazing gorgeous just gorgeous. take a moment just to appreciate how amazing that Peaceful, necklace is. It? Very nice. Um, I have a lovely collection of earrings here, beautifully photographed as well, I might add. And this comes from Deb Buckley. Hello to you, Deb. You're number 607. Deb says, hello, everybody. This is my entry to the Wall of Fame. A trio of hoop wire macrame earrings, glistening teal glass beads in silver wire, check sparkle bead stroke agate in gold wire, Demure black spinel beads and copper Ooh. wire. Deb, you should be doing my job. Yeah. Um, all <laughs> contents from Jewelry Maker, sorry, um, except the black spinel, which was made from an upcycled necklace. Idea from Mark Smith's uh, mixed media macrame DVD. Good luck, everybody, with your creative entries. Loving that, Deb. You're 607. I like the Gorgeous. fact that you can upcycle all pieces of jewelry yeah, as well. Um, amazing. Good luck. Good luck. Here we go. Look at this. This is amazing. My work. Uh, this is uh, wow. 610. Wow. This is Anne Messenger. Anne says, hi to all the great team. Please accept my entry to the Wall of Fame. A whole lot of 80 seed beads from yourselves on silver plated copper wire. This kept me quiet for a while, but I was pleased with the result. Good luck to all and a little to me, please. Keep bringing us all the wonderful goodies. You are such a wonderful team. And that's from lovely Anne. That's amazing, Aww, isn't it? It's gorgeous. Good luck, Kept Anne. you out of trouble. That, that's yeah. incredible. What work, work of art. Yeah, definitely. Wow, Beautiful. well Good done. Luck. I have number 609 here from Teresa Ellis. Hello to you, Teresa. Oh. Beautiful. Um, loving that. Very wearable as well, jewellery, especially this time of year. That is gorgeous, isn't it? Yeah. Um, Teresa says, hi all at Jewellery Maker. Here is my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. It's a bracelet made from three strands of 0.4 millimetre wire threaded with, check this out, tanzanite, mm. peach pearls and sea beads then twisted together to make a rope effect. Everything is from Jewellery Maker. Good luck to everyone in the draw. Well, that's stunning, Teresa. Yes, Loving the gorgeous. combination. I love the peachy pearl edition. A nice white well. work at the end. Amazing. Lovely, yeah. 609. Good luck. 
Here we go. I've got uh, 612 and this is Katura Dixon. Katura says, hello all at JM. I hope I make the wall this week. It's a pair of seed bead earrings. Lots of detail, peyote stitch. Love the re results. All items are from JM. Good luck to all. Hoping for a win and that's from Katura. They are stunning, aren't they? Look Very at all the work nice, in that. Katura. Yeah, Beautiful. it blows my mind the intricacy of seed beading. Yeah, good luck. I'd Lovely. love to have just a little fraction of Katura's I know, patience I know. to do something Beautiful. like that. Um, last but by no means least, a lovely long line pearl necklace, and this comes from Emma Ryan. Hello to you, Emma. They're beautiful. Look Stunning, at that. Stunning, yeah. You're number 611, Emma. Uh, and she says, hi all, here is my make. I bought five metres of peacock pearls many Ooh. years ago. We wouldn't be able to bring that to you now, you know, Emma. So, uh, great purchase. Uh, from Jewelry Maker and some beautiful Baroque pearls two, uh, two years back. Uh, might be longer, she says, I don't know. Um, I knotted them to make an over-the-head strand with a lovely um, infinity clasp, um, also by Jewelry Maker. Good luck to everybody in the drawer. Wow, stunning. That's, that's amazing. Gorgeous necklace, what I, wonderful yeah. makes, Claire. Yeah, yeah, good luck, everybody. I do love yeah. the Wall of Fame, you know. Yes, it's like, brilliant. It really, to see. I mean, we know this anyway, but just it's lovely to see how talented all our yeah, wonderful it audience are. Yeah. It and is. it doesn't Beautiful. matter, jewelry makers, whether you're brand new to making jewelry um, and you're making a stretchy bracelet, something like I would do, um, or you're incredibly established, like all of our lovely entrants and, of course, the gorgeous Claire. We would love to see them. It's really Really simple to enter. Um, enter every week. Send your entries to studio at jewelrymaker.com. Quite simple. Mm -hmm. That's a nice easy, yep. easy yep. email address, isn't it? Um, if you do that by 12 o'clock on the Tuesday, you will be entered into the Wednesday draw. If you miss that cutoff point, um, then you'll roll over into the next week. It's all good. Don't you worry about it. It doesn't mean like, you know, sometimes you enter competitions and if you miss the cutoff point, that's it. You may mm. still be charged, you hear that, don't you? Um, but no, you'll just roll over into the next week's draw. And you know what? If you win and it's literally done by an old school tombola, what will the winner receive, Claire McDonald? They will win £100 credit. A credit into their jewelry yes. maker again? Yes. That's amazing. <gasps> what about the runner-up? The runner-up will get £50 credited what? to their account. And we have Yay! done that every single week. Every <laughs> single week since Jewelry Maker started broadcasting. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, we're like Morgan and Wise and Laurel and Hardy. I am very happy with that, Al. I think I think if we were Laurel and Hardy, I'm the I'm the more stupid one. <laughs> <laughs> Dick and Tom, text oh, in your yes. favourite duos. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's the what? what well, are they the ones that shout bogeys? Dick and Tom. Yeah. Oh yes. <laughs> Yeah, I love gonna, that. I'm not going to lie, it's pretty funny. Yeah, I think it's pretty funny. funny. Um, yeah, that actually amounts to a six-figure sum that we've given That's away. That's a lot of money, isn't it? Yeah. It's <laughs> a lot of jewellery making bits and bobs. I love it. You can make over yeah. the years. You've got to be in it to win it, as yeah. they say. That old Just do it. Yeah. Enter it. Exactly. Yeah. And we get to admire them as well. Yeah. Now, coming up, jewellery makers, can you believe... One of easily the most popular gemstones here at Jewelry Maker. Um, but not that we've brought it lots because we haven't been able to bring it lots, such as the rarity of the gemstone, but certainly one of the most in demand. We are talking about the absolutely stunning angelite, but even more than that, this is that natural green up next. Do you have a stunning piece of jewelry you've crafted? Share your masterpiece with us and you might just see your design featured on the Wall of Fame. Every week, the most dazzling entry will win £100 credit to their account, with £50 credit going to the runner-up. To enter, simply send your entries to studio at jewellerymaker.com by Tuesday at 12pm in time for the Wednesday draw. Snap a pic, send it in, and let your brilliance light up our Wall of Fame. And who knows? Your creation could be the next to sparkle and win. Welcome back, lovely jewellery makers. Now, this is what jewellery maker do and what we do best, isn't it? The fact that we have got a team that work tirelessly, our unsung heroes, they truly are. And I'm going to name the champion of this. 
<laughs> Adam <laughs> says I'm on my way. Um, <laughs> uh, no, sorry, no, on this occasion, Adam, it's not you, but you are a hero for sure. Um, we always have a laugh and a joke, but I, and I know I know I've openly said this on air, and it's funny actually because I won't say who, but somebody was saying the other day that they would love to have Wayne as part of the Gemporia buying team as well. I was like, oh, you leave alone, back away. Um, Wayne has managed to negotiate this parcel for you and it's a miracle, frankly, that we've managed to get hold of this. I Cast your mind back, I forget how long ago it was, maybe six months, possibly, was it six months, Roscoe? Yeah, about six months. We had a parcel of your green Angelite. Now, firstly, Angelite was only discovered in 1987, which is younger than me. Yeah. So um, it's the same age as you, Adam, isn't it? Yeah. So this gemstone was only discovered in 1987 in Peru. Um, so much so that I have shown you information before that doesn't even mention, by the way, it mentions that, that Angelite comes in different colours, but it doesn't mention this because it wasn't discovered. That's why it's not because um, they're like, oh, I just won't mention that. It wasn't discovered then. So this is a very, very, very new gemstone actually to the world. Mm -hmm. 1987 is current, but the green is actually very new to the entire world. But when we speak to um, the miners, the suppliers of this gemstone, it's because it was a very small pocket. So I'm trying to think of another, you know, you know, for example, for many years, we said that you could not get blue in a, in, in a garnet. And then mother nature threw a few very rare opportunities or the natural pink in a diamond. We said once upon a time that it doesn't form in that color. We didn't know that angelite actually formed in these rare greens until mother nature basically revealed one very small pocket which we bought didn't really know that that would be the case because i would imagine we'd have bought probably bigger at the time we bought it's beautiful it sold out it became one of the most in-demand gemstones here on our screens and then when our um, lovely wayne went back to our suppliers said can we have some more of that please they're like no that was it that was literally it it was a very fleeting parcel of course we kicked ourselves then why didn't we get more so and we said it on air six months ago we can't get any more of it it's done what mother nature it's not what mother what mother nature had is done i don't know if they found another pocket we'll hear from the supplier in a few moments time but he has secured some more green angel light for you. It might have been something, and this is the thing about gemstone trading, it might have been something that they reserved for another buyer, I don't know, but you have got it today. But please understand that this window of opportunity is already closed and it was closed six months ago. So it is a miracle that we're able to launch this on your screens today. Now let's, I mentioned earlier on the three characteristics for a gemstone to be quantified as a, as a gemstone. It needs to be beautiful, that's most important, I think. It needs to be durable and it needs to be rare. Well, it ticks all of those boxes and then some. But what is angelite? So here is an amazing gem, like I said, that is a baby in comparison. You know, we've, we've celebrated jadeite for or jade for thousands of years we've celebrated malachite that we had saw a few moments ago for thousands of years sapphires thousands of years here's a gemstone that is what 38 36 years old there you go thank you 37 this year um and i want to read a write-up that describes this amazing gemstone um and you'll notice in here that it doesn't actually mention this color. That's because it wasn't discovered at the time. So they say, Angelite, the sacred stone that stashed out of sight for many years, was only discovered in 1987 in the mystical Inca land, uh, lands of Peru. It sometimes goes by the name anhydrite from the Greek term for without water. This is because angelite is born from parched areas where gypsum crystals once sat in the company of water. As the thousands of years ticked on, the water dries up, 
the crystals get compressed and thus the beautiful sorry the gentle blue angel gentle blue remember um, angelite is born since its discovery in peru it has also been mined incredibly this i'm re britain poland libya germany mexico and egypt angelite is as soft as silk in energy and physicality it will transform back to gypsum when placed in water um, so please don't put your angelite in water submerge it in water for any prolonged period of time a reminder of the feeling of flow that ethereal energy and change that drifts dreamily through this gem i mean how magical is that right up firstly but they're mm. actually talking about the blue the blue that was first discovered i want to show you this and you might be thinking okay that's a bit of an unusual photograph but i show this photograph because really i can't tell you in all honesty i can't tell you what it is that actually transforms what decides your angel light being blue being green or being peacock in color but actually the green and the peacock, I think are very, 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 very closely related. And if you think about that color, which is totally natural, by the way, these are not dyed. Um, it's a color that I think many of us, and Ross was telling me um, about your three-year-old. Yeah, three-year-old who was, loves the color teal. Um, we naturally gravitate to teal as a color and I know the title will say green, but it's more than that It's a greeny blue pastel palette So I wanted to show you this photograph and again remind you that these are totally natural It's the fusion of the sort of silky inclusions of the background the blues that you see within the peacock's head The greens that you can see emerging from its tail imagine that sort of mixed together in one gorgeous gemstone um, again, when you think of the peacock, it's not just a blue. You get that gorgeous green color. And then if you think about the actual bird itself, notice how they've got that silver. Um, I don't want to say chatoyancy, but they have that silvery beauty, that iridescence to the actual feather itself. But can you see, imagine if you were to fuse the, the greens and the blues together, you would get this amazing gemstone. It's a color palette that we naturally gravitate to. And um, I, I, I'm really interested in interior design. I study a bit in interior design as well. Um, so this is something that's quite, yeah, quite, quite familiar to me. And if you look at that actual color chart, I would say um, your parcel today, which is natural, I'm going to keep em emphasizing that, is somewhere between, yeah, the vegan and pool blue. Yeah, I would agree. I would agree. It's somewhere between or, or maybe mixing those two together. Um, we are doing it disservice by just calling it green angelite because it's not just green, is it? It, it actually has, you, you know, how it forms those, uh, um, the gypsum crystals basically gives you that cloudiness, that cloudy formation. But those colours, again, that are not submerged, isn't this, these have not been submerged in a dye, um, they are naturally occurring, that very fleeting parcel that we've got before you today. But look at that. Just look at that and just imagine that in a gemstone. You know by, by looking at that effectively colour chart, it's going to be a beautiful gem, don't you? Um, speaking of colours, did you know that colours have an instant effect on our moods? Um, it's known to be able to stimulate a range of emotions. We hope to make your life extra colourful with this read. Today we're talking about something, this is, by the way, uh, an article that I read that I think absolutely personifies this gemstone. Uh, today we're talking about something that's aesthetically pleasing and universally love, loved, the pastel colour palette, um, one you can't go wrong with. Pastel colours are subtle on the eye and deliver a range of emotions like love, affection, joy, romance, calmness, peace and satisfaction. And considering they're derived out of pure colours, basically where they're completely void of grey or black, they're quite the sight. Um, just before we move forward, one of the, one, my friend's wedding one is still in my memory as the most beautiful wedding I've, I've been to. And I'm not just talking about the sentiment here. You know, when you turn up and you see like the rooms all decorated beautifully and there's usually a color theme, for example, she didn't have, she didn't have a color theme as such. 
she just she had the palette she had a full pastel palette oh beautiful and to this yeah. day it it, it's one of the most visually beautiful things I've seen. You know, literally quite um, roughly binded flowers in the center of the tables. Um, but there wasn't any solid reds, no solid blues, no deep colors. It was all pastel palettes. Mm. And it was genuinely one of the most romantic things I've ever seen. It is what that paragraph that is that list of yeah, yeah, isn't it? It is, yeah. It is love, affection, joy, romance, calmness, peace mm. and satisfaction. That's what this parcel and this, this, this acquisition actually, those emotions actually conjure up, I believe, for many of us. Um, moving on, it goes on to mention that teal, which is what I would personally describe this, a pastel teal. That Rather than green, I would describe it as a pastel teal. Teal combines the calming properties of blue with the renewal qualities of green. It is a revitalizing and rejuvenating color that also represents open communication and clarity of thought. For Tibetan monks, teal is symbolic of the infinity of the sea and the sky, while it is the color of truth and faith for Egyptians. Teal pops with bright white and coral and works well with creams, navies and browns and pinks. It also sets off metallic colors such as silver and gold. And you think of all those colorways as jewelry makers, as jewelry designers, how amazing they would look. Imagine putting them with like a pop of coral. Imagine putting them with a the rich buttery yellow or with the cool silvers. But these palettes, again, I'm gonna show you that tea bar, these palettes, it's not just jewelry or in fashion that it's popular or in wedding events. It's popular in interior design. I'm going back to that paint chart, if you like, um, where you get the fusions, the, 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 the shades, if you like, of those teal palettes. Um, so why is teal so popular? A color trend here to stay. That was an article written in 2021. And it is almost like they have captured the beauty of the gemstone in, in, in interior design, particularly the first photograph, I think. That first photograph, um, you know, with the lovely mirror uh, and the fireplace, I think that colorway. Pastel palettes is not uh, something invented by us, rather it's a gift from nature, um, your gemstone included. You can find pastel colors in a lot of natural elements like the sky, water, flowers, fruits, wood, pebbles, and even across species. I mean, look at that beautiful. Is that a Japanese, um, I think that's a Japanese fighting fish, but look how beautiful they are, and that wonderful palette. Um, not too far away from the Tiffany's branding as well. As you can imagine, um, color pa pastel color palettes are, are used a lot in jewelry designs. Premium jewelry brands like Tiffany's are, uh, are a prized possession for a customer. The jewelry is delicate and to be taken care of. But think about how iconic that, that mm. color is. I don't think we can talk about this gemstone without thinking about Tiffany's. Here's another example. Again, look at that color chart that you see alongside those truffles. Um, and it, it personifies your gemstone. Truffles speak the language of love and romance. Using soft tones of teals and pinks and whites gives, uh, gives it a bond look. The metallic text is the cherry on the cake, a perfect luxury gift. Um, and they even have paint named after angelite. Now this is the blue variety, but I don't think it's going to be long until we actually see the angelite greens or the angelite teals. That by the way, look at that, £69 for a, for a big pot, but what a beautiful calming environment mm. to be in that is because of the actual gemstone colour that they're actually using and naming in interior designs itself. But any customer, whether it's the blue, whether it's the greens, whether it's the peacock that we've actually seen, anybody that has the opportunity to, has either seen it or work with this gemstone, text in, would you all agree it has an effect on your mood? Would you all agree that instantly, whether you're wearing it right now, it calms your senses, doesn't it? Because it's such a tranquil mm, stone. Mm. Now, another variety of angelite that is incredibly popular, not a million miles away from the green, was peacock variety, which I have mentioned today. Moving forward, the only offering that we have had of peacock angelite, that's a message from Bernard, by the way. Hi, Wayne. 
Um, can you use uh, such peacock angel like rounds with the yellow inclusion? So he said, I can bring it to you because he'd asked the question, he'd sown the seed. Wade had sown the seed. We're looking for more angel light. And he was like, okay, I can't bring you the usual, but I can bring it with the yellow presence, which is actually less desirable. Um, you may also remember that we wanted to bring you a peacock angel like bangle with a carving, do you remember? But the demand for the gemstone, it got intercepted, do you remember? Here is Bernard, and he actually said, regarding that bangle, he says, I placed two orders for an angelite, a bangle um, and a disc which goes in the centre. Just before they were due to be shipped, I was informed that they were unable to fulfil the order, um, as the entire commission had been bought by a Chinese buyer who wow. paid three times the price that we had been quoted. Now, please understand that Bernard here is a middleman. Does that make sense? So you've got the miners or the mine owners, whatever it might be, you've got Bernard sort of having that communication, and then you've got us trying to mm. buy it. So we've agreed with Bernard, yes, please do get that. And then basically he's been, uh, someone's gazumped him, yeah. basically. Yeah. So we didn't think we were able to actually, to bring you green angel light or peacock angel light jewelry makers, because the demand is so, so high. This parcel came about, um, it's like, it's like a winning lottery ticket in the gemstone world. Bernard goes on to say, and this is obviously directed towards Wayne, I've been offered something truly special, pure green angel light. What he means there, void of any yellows. Going forward, I thought we would only have access to the green with imperfections or yellow inclusions, but this is some of the finest, cleanest and purest angel light I've ever been offered and probably for the final time. I'm sure you recall what happened with the peacock parcel. To rectify that, I have kept this green parcel under wraps and have had my cutters work in secret to cut and provide it to you. I can only apologize regarding the peacocks, um, peacock angel light and hope this keeps our blessing, our relations um, in good faith. I hope we continue with great prosperity. He is a lovely gentleman, is our mm. um, but again so he understands he's still thinking okay i wasn't able to deliver on a promise so wasn't able to deliver on that we accepted it you know we understand how the gem trade works we've worked in it for almost 20 years across the partnership however bernard literally said i'm going to keep this under wraps we're going to work of it work on it under top the radar secret. top yeah. secret here you, go, here you go jewelry maker um let you have the entire parcel and also Bernard um, has worked, if you remember, it was Ross that sowed the seed. You know, the bigger sizes, which tend to be a little bit more expensive, we get that. Um, how about we shorten the strands? How about we shorten the strands to work on that price point so we can bring that down? Um, so the 12 mil and the 10 mil um, are shorter strands because they're accent beads, aren't they? But it has drastically reduced the price for you, jewelry makers. Then your eight, eight millimeter, six, so on, they are the full 38 centimeter strand. We are at, uh, can I just say, there's a hundred of each of these, right? No, no. Okay, they're all on pre-order right now. We'll keep you informed on the quantities as and when. So this is an opportunity I hope we've covered, a f one that Bernard said, look, I didn't know this, like this is like a lottery win to be able to get hold of this again because we believe that mother nature had literally given everything that she had the what sorry the minimum quantity is a hundred so we have literally or rather i should say bernard has offered us literally everything this is it he has given the entire parcel he could have maybe cut the strands smaller, sold it elsewhere. He's a good guy, Bernard. So he has literally given you the whole parcel, jewellery makers. But I don't think it will see another opportunity other than today. I think it is literally going to be your deal of the day. So if you are as in love with a beautiful pastel palette that comes with this amazing variety of angelite that's not even documented in the gem books, it's that rare, it's that new, now is the time. 60 seconds jewelry makers are we going to do this in ascending sizes 
Eight mils first, we're gonna to bring to you first, jewelry makers. I mean, knock them with a the silk, put them on a beautiful clasp, whatever it is. Um, they are absolute perfection, jewelry makers. The clock is to your first graphics. I'll keep you qu uh, posted on the quantities, jewelry makers. These will sell out because I know we've got designers who missed out on this gemstone and we work here, you know? So you would think, oh, you're easily gonna be able to get a hold of them. No, not the case, not the case. We've got designers who missed out on this opportunity. Um, we've got, our sister channel don't do this variety of Angelite because they don't have the quantities to actually be able to do a collection on our sister channel. So this is one of those chances, jewelry makers, in the gemstone world, collectively, in the gemstone world, is uber, uber, uber rare. Um, Mother Nature literally offered a fleeting parcel. You could read about your angel eye across many different publications. It'll mention the blue, it'll mention other colors, it won't mention your teals, your peacocks and your soft greens. Graphics are live jewelry makers, the first strand of this amazing parcel that is brand new. I'm starting with the eight millimeter strand. This is a full eight centimeter strand as well. I mean, look at that, hold it straight up to the neckline. <gasps> The Gorgeous biggest carrot weight of the entire selection. Um, we first got this variety back in 2022 and immediately it became one of your most popular gemstone. However, it's not like Jadeite. We don't have the supply. We literally, do you know, I'm gonna put this one out there. This color, if we're talking about color specific, has to be one of the rarest gems that we stock, if not the. Because we've got more Grandidurite, more Jadeite, more Alexandrite, more Paraba um, than any of those, uh, than mm. any than this gemstone for sure. We have the biggest quantity. This is the largest carat weight, and it is kickstarting this amazing showcase. Beautiful, gentle, tranquil, it's frat, so elegant. -like foot. It is so peaceful, mm. isn't it? Mm. What? Straight down to a dub to double figures. 14, look at it from there. Look how it glows, look how it lights up the face. Okay, I'm shocked by that starting price, Roscoe. We start at 49.99, I've got 100 available. We have a huge, have had, yeah, a string of problems today. And we are aware of that. And that is as frustrating for us jewelry makers as it is for you, believe me. Because we've been excited about the whole show today. We really have. Um, and it's frustrating when you're like, oh, and we can see you there as well on the call screens. It is, it is, it's annoying. But I tell you what, there is a way of apologizing to you all. We shouldn't really be apologizing with this gemstone, but we're gonna do it anyway, because it was scheduled. We have got big quantities. I don't believe this strand, uh, this this collection, will see another show. I think it's going to be on and gone. I think every single one. I wouldn't be surprised if everything sells out because once, even if it doesn't, as we're on air, there'll be members of staff that'll join in because afterwards, we're at forty nine ninety nine. I have one hundred available opportunities. Let's show you a price point that you are not paying. Are you ready? It is natural from the original location of source of its discovery. A baby in the gemstone world, but even, even younger, in its embryonic stage in this color. $24.99 and we're not stopping there, Roscoe. We have the biggest quantities that we've ever had. Um, the biggest quantities that we've ever had of these colours of your Angel Light jewellery makers. That is why we're going as low as we are. You get wonderful, almost Laramar-esque mm. formations, don't we? It's a wonderful overall colour, isn't it? But when you actually look at each individual round, there's so much going on in, you know, within that, that sphere, isn't there? It's, it's fascinating. It's like that clouds in the sky, isn't it? With Stunning. that greeny... It works with the name as well, doesn't it? Angel Light. Yeah. You, know, you think yeah. about Angel Light, you think, uh, you know, you think of the heavens above, mm. you think of angels, yes. with yeah. angel wings and cloud formations. It's that with this beautiful natural colour. What's that? Keep dialing through, jewellery makers. Twenty four ninety nine. Cheryl, Patricia, Margaret, Sandra, Pauline, West, West Sussex, Maxine, Sharon in Essex, Pauline in Berkshire, um, Anne in West Midlands, Pamela in Yorkshire. There's loads of you getting involved. We've got 100. That's the biggest quantity. The biggest quantity we've ever had of this gem. 
um, in your most sought after color for sure. I'd love to say it's the number one gemstone. We haven't had the supply for it to actually gain that title. Certainly the most in demand. The largest quantity that we have, 19.99. I'm shocked by wow. that, Roscoe. That's way lower than I was expecting these to go. Is that all down to the quantity? Because of the big quantity, but also because of the string of issues that we've had online today. It's all ironed out now though. Make sure you are checking out the first piece of this amazing parcel. The parcel that, bless him, Bernard kept, kept under wraps, worked on, on, on the old QT and said, look, this is all jewelry maker. Because he was mindful of the fact that it wasn't his fault. It's not his fault with what happened with the Peacock Angelite bangle. And I'm fairly sure, you know, you know, we, we forgave him even back then. But he's thought of this, I thought of you um, with this parcel and that's the only reason that it's on your screens today. 19 pounds and 99 pence, Pamela in Yorkshire, Sandra, Anne's got two, West Sussex, well done to you, Cheryl, Patricia, Maxine, Multibuy, Margaret, Christine, Leslie, Yorkshire, Brenda, Jennifer, Wiltshire I can't keep up with you jewelry makers yeah to, to be anywhere near 20 pounds Roscoe no it's that I have I know so little as in in terms of the, normally I can gauge a price of a gemstone mm. I'd like to think but this has actually only been on air a couple of times this colour this gemstone, not through the want, um, but because this offering is so limited. A third of the stock has already gone. And in my head, this was going to be £49.99 there or thereabout. I'd have been totally happy with that price, would you? So it has shocked me to go here. But Ross has just said, it, and I'm gonna repeat his exact words. L, this is no way near our closing price. Is that what this variety of angelite goes to normally? On this occasion, I, honestly, jewellery makers, we, it's the quantity, the quantity which is actually be, uh, securing the best deal. We bought the whole parcel. That is how we are driving the price down, jewellery makers. Um, so, again, make sure you are checking out. There are tons of you getting involved. Um, Catherine, Wiltshire's got two. Margaret, Leslie's got two. Loads of multi-buying. Brenda, Jennifer, Pamela, Patricia, West Sussex. New customers. It's going crazy on the phone lines. A hundred might sit... Well, it is a big quantity. It's a big quantity for this gemstone. But at the same time, it's a deal a day. A hundred could go in a nanosecond. So please do check out... This is the launch of the entire showcase. We, if you want 12 mils, got it. You want 10 mils, got it. You want six mils, got it. You want four mils, got it. You want faceted, today, got it. So it's, there's never been a better opportunity for you to pur purchase the beautiful, calming, relaxing gemstone that is Angelite. Today, 17 pounds and 99 pence only for a full 38 centimeter strand. Claire, what would you do with something like this? I love it how it is, because I do think you've got, although you've got that overall very, it's a calming, isn't it, mm. look. From, but when you get up close, it is like that, you know, you've got all that movement in each gem, but maybe with, you know, the, the wonderful uh, ripple pearls that we had oh, earlier, you could just put one of those. But I'd, but I'd be playing around with the collection as a whole. So maybe think about getting one of the larger size. That's your, that's your focal gemstone in there. Um, you know, because you don't have to think about other colour and other gemstones then, do you? Just all the same gemstone, but then you're playing about with sizes, scale, and we've I, got I that collection. I love what you just said there with the, with the ripple pearls, which have got a bluish presence to them as yeah, well. Yeah, so they yeah, would really yeah. work beautifully yeah. alongside this. Yeah. A um, hundred jewelry makers, half the stock has gone already, um, just over in actual fact. 55 confirmations and there's a whole heap of multi-buyers. You can get involved. Is the showcase on pre-order or not? whole showcase is actually on pre-order jewelry makers imagine knotting it maybe with a powder blue mm. imagine i mean it's going to go with everything like that article was saying it this color works with everything doesn't yeah. it the rosy pinks things like that going for those those pastel colors nice. yeah gorgeous or a bright coral if you want mm. to really contrast yeah, it yeah yeah 
Now I've got 39 of these left within the vault jewelry makers. Again, loads of you still there. Alison, Patricia says, give me two. Leslie's got two. West Sussex has got three. Wilts has got two. Maker's got two. And those are some of the names that I can see, just the multi buyers. Ross, you did say in my ear that 1999 was no way near. I knew it, Ross. 60 seconds for the final 30, approximately 30 odd. This is gonna be an entire showcase sellout. I've got 37, there we go. 37 of these left, the start of the, show, uh, the showcase. And it goes even lower, jewelry makers. That shocked me. How rare this gemstone color is. This gemstone is firstly, but how rare this particular color saturation is. You know, like, you know, like paparazzi is to sapphire. That's what your greens and your teals and your peacocks are to angel eye. Um, so you pay a premium for the rarer colors, but we seem to be doing the polar opposite. I've bought blue angel eye for more than this. Here we are at 17.99 and we're going lower. Wilch has got three. Um, bless Bernard, and I know he does watch on occasions. Bernard, thank you so much mm. for this amazing parcel. Um, our customers are absolutely loving it as we fully expected. And it's an opportunity, a moment that we didn't think would actually, um, would actually come around again. So I love it. Never say never in the world of gemstones, eh? Totally natural. The largest carat weight on a strand a full 38 centimeter strand and today wow 14.99 that i agree that's half the price that, that 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 ross is saying that's half the price that we should be i had in my head that this was going to be like 49.99 mm. upwards yeah. unbelievable uh make sure you check it out there because they're flying now and so many multi buyers if you've got a phone in your hand stay where you are our call center will get you um yeah the queues are building on the phone lines but don't worry they're an amazing team christina in suffolk christina in channel R, sharon maker susan ha uh, hampshire marilyn maureen monica sandra lynn county antrim maker pauline ann diana in the isle of man wiltshire sue patricia allison Pat another patricia lorraine lynn catherine leslie three quarters of the stock is already confirmed so i've got exactly 25 of these left within the vault jewelry makers um there's so much potential with a classic eight mil round but the beauty that that you get within uh this opportunity this parcel i don't think you can really make comparisons to many other gemstone maybe maybe your laramars but actually it's a much more creamy silkier gemstone to your laramar uh, I, I, i'm just gonna put this one out there i prefer angelite this variety of angelite to laramar i actually do i actually prefer it because it's almost yeah like I love the cloudy formations. Mm. There's something much more gentle about it. The final 10 of these, make sure you're checking out everybody. We're super over allocated. So keep on uh, ch dialing through. People with fours and threes and fives, the pre-orders have gone crazy. I think because you've set, you've set that bar now, Roscoe, haven't you? Let's do the six mil. Now, Claire, six mil still the go-to? Oh, it's a lovely size, isn't it? Yeah, it's lovely. Mm. This has gone. Cr this has gone crazy on pre-order, and luckily, we actually have over a hundred of these available. The first price crash on your screens. Lots of multi buyers straight away. Yeah, first. Not always stopping. This is a full thirty-eight centimeter strand. You could just take one of your ten or twelve mils. Literally have it at the centre, couldn't you? Just knot it really you simply. Still, you've still got that interesting effect, haven't you? And every yeah. single, even though you drop down that that size, the quality doesn't yeah. change, no. and the ability to see that. So if you want to do graduated pieces, absolutely perfect, oh, isn't it? Perfect time to get everything. Let's get it under twenty pounds because you know we're not stopping there, jewelry makers, don't you? Ah, oh, it's stunning, absolutely stunning. Yeah, it's really gentle and tranquil, mm. the formations that you see within this. And it's all natural colours. Look at that. See, it is like a feather, like a silvery chatoyan. See, we are under £20, jewellery makers, but it is not your price. We're just staggering the auction because it is super busy, jewellery makers. 
a, a return of this gemstone that we didn't actually foresee. We've kind of made peace with the fact that, okay, green angelite, that's it, done, dusted. Hopefully you were lucky enough to be one of the collectors that secured it. If you weren't, it was like, okay, sorry, that, 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 that window of opportunity is gone. Um, but here it is. Bernard has delivered once again. Next price crash. We've got a bigger quantity of these. So we've got over triple figures, um, but there's a lot of multi-buyers. That doesn't surprise me. Six mil is very much a go-to size for us as uh, jewelry designers. 14.99. Wow. Not where we are closing today. Do have a look on the website because all your items, all your sizes, shapes and cuts are available on pre-order as we speak. So you can guarantee your success. Uh, Janice, Lynn, Margaret, Sandra, Maker um, in West Sussex getting three, Wiltshire, Cheryl, Jennifer, Pauline, Sue, Hamida, Christine, Wiltshire, Maxine, Conwy, Marilyn, Jennifer, Maureen. I mean, that's literally before we've even come, got, got to your final price tag. That is the popularity of this gemstone. That is why we say this is one of the most in-demand gemstones that we've got on our screens. Sadly, jewelry makers, we aren't able to fulfill it normally. Um, today we are, so really, really, really capitalise. Can we get another parcel of this? I already know the answer. Can we get another parcel of this, Ross? Not according to Bernard. There you go. And and he would know, wouldn't he? Um, he would know. Uh, he's been um, an amazing gem supplier, gem trader, on the rarest gemstones as well um, for many, many, many years. He delivered today. £12.99 pence only to get hold of this absolutely beautiful gemstone um, in your favourite size, the go-to size for us as jewellery makers. Um, that you, yeah, I mean, you could just literally restrand it, Claire, couldn't you? You could, and even if you didn't know all that lovely, you know, the lovely story and how rare it, it is, you know, that even just looking at aesthetics, you know that's going to go with everything that you've got, don't you? Mm. You think of all the things, the other gemstones that you've got um, in your stash, it's going to work really well with it. I'd be tempted to maybe put, you know, in the, the nugget strand that you've got coming up. Yes. Because again, you sort of, it's lovely colours, isn't it? Every time you've got, you know, a break in that or a change in that colour blocking, maybe put the uh, the green angel light, you know, in between there. It's just going to break it up a, a little bit more. But look how well that goes. I think you could pick up any strand. Yeah. Put it next to that that angel light and you know it's going to work because they're pastels yeah yeah, yeah. And, and that's what that article was talking about not necessarily specifically about your gemstones but pastels do complement everything mm. don't they yeah um your metallics and even your vibrance yeah. like to, to, to color contrast six mil is going crazy jewelry makers you're at 12.99 not crazy enough says roscoe oh really to the point where he's no don't do that ross to a point where he not, might not play the whole parcel. He thinks that sometimes, look, this is shopping TV. I'm gonna be a little bit of inside information. Because of what happened this morning, sometimes it actually does have a knock, knock on effect to the show. So we are thinking maybe we haven't got the volumes of audience that we, did, that we would normally. Do you think it's affected the, the show? So, and he says, right, I wouldn't want to waste this launch. If we bring it to air and they don't sell out, which it should sell out. It should have sold out already, I agree. I agree. I was absolutely floored by the price that you saw previously. I'm floored by this price. Okay, so what do you want to do? You want to test it with this? Don't just drop it now. He says, "If okay. Six months are usually the most popular. This is the thing. This is what our producers have to navigate, basically. We can't waste our gemstone parcels, obviously, especially something as big as the, uh, as the green angelite. So this is what our producers have to navigate. We've got 150 of these available. Six mil we know is the most popular. We've only had 49 confirmations. 
uh, retail is very different to shopping TV. You know, you've got to remember, um, we've only got so many hours of the day um, on air, of course. Um, we do understand that sometimes IT issues do happen and unfortunately sometimes they do have an, uh, an effect on our audience. So if this one doesn't go, I do get your predicament here, Ross, because if the six mil doesn't go, then it tells you that the other sizes most likely won't. Maybe we don't have enough eyes on the show. Yeah, I see where you're coming from. So what are you going to do? Test it. If there's enough people adding it to their basket in the next minute, Ross will take this strand under £10, but please know it should not be under £10. We're only doing this to test the waters. You've got a minute to add it in your basket. We are testing the waters, and that's literally... We have a meeting every Monday, I say we, the manager and team, um, and literally that will be relayed back, because they will re question it, Ross, won't they? Why have you taken the six mil strand to under £10? 100% says Ross, and you can literally say, look, look because of what happened in the 8 o'clock hour, well, we've had six months previously and the quantity of 50 has been on air. They would never in a million years be under £10. Never in a million years. We've got 150 today and that's the only way we can justify what we're doing. <coughs> However, sorry, excuse me. If they don't sell out today, we don't want to waste a launch. We might as well save it, put it on a day where we haven't actually had all those issues. The issues aren't there anymore. Not enough people, says Ross. There's not enough people. I don't want to drop this all, all this this showcase. It's so beautiful. Not enough. Another minute. I do get it, Claire. Do you? Yeah. It's a tricky one, isn't it? Because you think about the amount of work that has gone in to, and how excited Bernard is as well mm. to be able to actually offer these. A few technical issues. They can have a big impact. Use this time to show Ross that you're there. And we can we can say, look, Ross, they are there. Our customers are there. Because that, that's the only way we can tell here in the studio. That is the only way that we can tell that we have eyes on screen. Does that make sense? We're going to take it under £10. But categorically, we should not be under £10. Absolutely categorically, shouldn't be anywhere near that price tag. If there is enough people, you don't even have to check out your baskets yet. You're just basically showing Ross that you're there. That's what you're doing. Or picking up your phone, pressing your option. Uh, you don't even have to press your option one. Just show Ross your name. Show that you are tuning into Jewelry Maker. Is that is that okay, Ross? Is that what you're thinking? Yeah. Three seconds. Is there enough, Ross? Really? I want another 30 seconds. I'm literally repeating Ross word for word here. It is massive that we're taking natural green angelite and saying that we're going to do it under £10. There will be repercussions on our part, by the way. There will be conversations. Why on earth have you taken a gemstone that we know we cannot replace? You know you can't replace this gemstone. Why on earth have you taken it under £10? And we will say, look, IT issues. This happened at the 8 o'clock hour. Basically, it was all a little bit slow. Um, and I get it. I do get it. It does sort of... It, it sort of interrupts the flow of the show, doesn't it? Not just for mm. you guys at home, but for me as well. It feels different, doesn't it? It takes a little bit longer to kind of get the wheels in motion once again. Are we going to do it then? Let's do it. There's 103 in baskets. That's got to be enough, isn't it? Let's do it. Know that this is not planned. You know, in the 7 o'clock hour, we do those below-cost deals. That's like this. You know, in the 8 o'clock hour, when we launch the show with those, like, ridiculous £1 deals, that's like this. It is. It's a gemstone we physically cannot replace. Because think about as well how much jewellery you could make out of that. So I know you've got your time and maybe if you're going to add in findings or uh, other things to that. But the, to that 9 99 you know, get at least two stretchy bracelets, wouldn't you? You're getting yeah. suites of jewellery out of that. Maybe you want a rosary link it. Um, you know, earrings, the lovely macrame we saw in, you know, at Wall of Fame. It, there's loads you can do with that size. The fact that they're rounds as well, knotting, loads of different techniques. And the fact it's from the original location of Source. Yes. Yeah. And, and a colour that is not even documented it's that rare. Mm. It is natural. It is that rare. 
I'm yet to find a single write-up on this beautiful gemstone that includes the tealy greens. Mm. I am still yet to find anything that says those words. Um, that's because it was an extremely fleeting parcel. Is it even worth you know, a gem expert actually writing about it? Um, because we know that we can't replace it. We had 150. Well done, everybody. I, I need to really emphasize the fact that please moving forward know that a no angel light, not even the blue should be 9 .99. Um, Should it? Because of the rarity of the gemstone, not even the more frequently seen blue should be 9.99 let alone a gorgeous strand of this rarity in this natural color um it's not a million miles away from what a jade eye yeah, yeah yeah but more spearmint i think much more spearmint in its color with much more um i like the word spearmint i like the color spearmint as well mm. um but with like a silvery chatoyancy internally as well Lots of you there. Uh, Maker Suffolk, Catherine, well done to you, Pamela, Jacqueline, Alison, Suzanne, hello to you, Sandra, Sarah, goodness me, all the S's. Um, Alison, hello to you, Margaret, getting to Cumbria, Helen, June, Pauline, Sally, Ivy, Leslie, Maureen, Lorraine, Sylvia, and Sue. Uh, Suffolk and Wiltshire getting four, and Maxine multi buying, Lynn, and West Sussex multi buying three. Cheryl, Jennifer, Pauline, Maker, um, I can't keep up. Nottingham says, I'll have three. Lorraine says, I'll have three. Pamela, well done to you um keep on dialing through on this opportunity i need to move on let's do the 12 mil so again for those of you that have just tuned in ross kate ross you came up with this idea was it upstairs when you're having this discussion so a couple of months back and it was actually talking about and we introduced it for the first time alongside his appetite um, an appetite parcel that, that Ross uh, negotiated. He does get involved in the gem buying as well. But, um, and it was a suggestion that Ross put to the powers of being. Really clever, really clever. Because we, what we were finding, and obviously we've got the history on our systems of our, what our customers buy a lot. There are certain cuts that we've dropped now altogether because they're not very popular with our audience. You know, you, you, you read your audience, don't you? Mm. Um, so, and we were noticing that the larger sizes, your 10 and 12s, whilst popular, we were, they weren't as popular. And um, what we were looking at is going, well, they're quite expensive, that's why. So Ross was saying, well, you think about it, a 10 or 12 mil, you, not many customers will go for the full, full 10, 12 mil necklace, not many. Um, so they tend to be more accents, as you said earlier on, Claire. So Ross's idea, why don't you bring the, the 10 or 12 millimeter smaller in size so it brings the cost right down right down keep the six keep the eight keep the four mils at your longer lengths but the larger sizes do them at shorter lengths and the feedback from you guys at home was huge absolutely huge wasn't it do you remember we did it on air Ross. there were loads of customers saying love this great idea mm. it means i can afford to get the different sizes maybe not just choose um and I hope that this is something that we're going to see moving forward with all parcels of similarity to this. Now, I'm about to bring you the larger size that we have in the collection. It's a perfect strand for me to show you how it forms. Look at that. Look oh, at how beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. Serene. You do get more, yeah, like cloud plumes. Look at that one there. It's amazing. We've got how many? 100 available. And already, already, people are making their confirmations. I don't blame you, I would too. So remember, we've shortened the strand in the larger sizes so we can bring the price down. Uh, that being said, remember, if this is a 38 centimetre strand, this would be more like 50 pounds, wouldn't it? Probably more, to be truthful. And also, you know, we probably wouldn't be able to bring you as many of the other strands because it will take a bulk of the rough, wouldn't it? First price crash under 20 pounds. Have we got problems on the app and the web again? Oh, I'm so sorry, jewelry makers. Please use your phone, uh, the telephone. 
It's a free phone telephone number if you dial off your um, landline or on your mobile. They're very quick. You won't be on hold um, for a massive time. I promise you they're amazing. There's nothing more frustrating than calling a call center and then you sat there waiting for ages. I totally get it. I have to say in all my years of shopping, not just working, but shopping across Jewelry Maker and Gemporia, I've never been on a queue for a massive amount of time. Never. It's true. You get answered very, very, very quickly. Um, so please, if you are having issues, use this free phone telephone number um to secure yours i have a hundred available we are i tell you what we're gonna do as an apology because it's literally been one of those days isn't it it's been one of those days oh okay let's just let's just take it to the lowest possible price that we can on each of the um of each of the pieces there let's do it it's been one of them days Oh God, that's infuriating, isn't it? Absolutely infuriating. Try though, jewelry makers on the web, on the app, and if not, use your phone lines. We're trying literally as we speak here in the gallery as well. Uh, Wiltshire, well done, you've got through on the web. Patricia's got through on the web. Elizabeth got through on the app. Maxine's got through on the web. West Sussex, Pauline on the phone lines. Warwickshire, Penny, Georgina, Susan, new customers. There's still customers there, don't get me wrong. What we're gonna do is just take everything to rock bottom. Um, and we're doing that, rock bottom prices you know we should not be as low and we'll look back on the history and we'll have forgotten that it was admin errors we'll have forgotten that it was basically wi-fi and things like they're not wi-fi sorry web issues and we're like why did we do that price we almost need to make a note of the yeah, fact definitely. that this is why yeah the only reason we've taken this to 12.99 is because of the web issues that we're having right now jewelry makers um that being said i can see people shopping so if you are Oh, that's frustrating, isn't it? So frustrating. Our only way of apologizing, jewelry makers, is take advantage of these extra low prices. The reality is as well, even if you are paying for the cost of your call and you're dialing on a phone, on a mobile, you've made it back on the on the price reductions. Does that make sense? And and by the way, if you're phoning on your landline, we pay for the cost of the call anyway. So, um, so <laughs> look at it that way. I know it's infuriating, but that's why you're getting the prices as low as you are. Um, we'll do what we can only do. That's the only way we can actually apologize to our audience, I think, is with price. Um, unbelievable, but again, I hope Bernard isn't watching right now. Sue, Jeanette, Patricia, well done to Wiltshire, um, Kate, Georgina, Christine, Patricia and Elizabeth, Maxine, West Sussex, Pauline, yeah. Um, we were just saying that, yeah, Bernard might buy him back at that price, to yeah. be honest. <laughs> but we are a live TV show, we have to be reactive. You know, that's the thing, you know, these will be available on the web a little bit later on when hopefully everything's sorted. Um, so, we think the problem is with your checking out. So if you're adding to the basket, just keep trying, keep trying, keep refreshing. Um, they will be on the web, um, stop permitting, obviously. We've taken them, just to clarify, to a ridiculously, stupidly low price because literally from the eight o'clock hour this morning, we have had web issue after web issue. Everyone knows, but the, for the one of the rarest colors of Angelite that exists, for, for te 12 mil, sorry, they shouldn't be 12.99. No. No, because with these, where we said before, wouldn't you? You'd maybe put um, one of your ripple pearls in with the others. You'd do the reverse on this one, wouldn't you? So you'd have one of those as, as your focal, your yeah. focal gemstone, in amongst it could be, and you know, any any pearls you've got, and lovely. then that is, you know, that size. Those, you know, the the wonderful markings on there, that becomes the focus of the piece. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. I would just use them that selectively as well. Yeah, so. yeah. We're going to do this in one price crash jewelry makers because these are the 10 mils. Um, I think I've only got two more strands after this. Again, I know I keep repeating this, but we've, we're just, please don't expect, because we do get this a lot as well, actually. People, when we do, things like this happen, don't they? It happens. Um, and then we'll have customers when we bring it back, well, not that we'll be able to bring this back, but say we bring you a rare variety of angel like back on screens and our customers go, oh, we repeat this on air. Um, and it go, we'll, we'll bring it to air at the price it's meant to be. Customers might say, oh, on well, such and such a day, you did it for this. Yeah, we did it because of all the web issues. That's the only reason we're doing it today. 
30 second warning jewelry makers and we're going to do it in one price crash the only reason we're taking it as low as we are is because of the web issues moving forward if this if this parcel gets repeated please don't expect it to be as low as what you're seeing because um it's more of an apology to our audience today in fact, it's totally an apology to our audience today. You can still shop with us on the phone lines. There are no issues there whatsoever. Um, it is infuriating because we've all been so excited about this parcel. You can, a lot of customers are still checking out on the web, so just keep trying. Hang on, you took the, you took the 12 mil to 12.99. It's wrong on so many levels, Ross. On so many levels. A waste of a launch, he says. Mm -hmm. I agree. I agree. I do agree. It's upsetting. But great if you are one of the people that's not having any issues on the web. Our team are working on it, aren't they? Our team are working on it, by the way. So, um, and I can see people checking out. Wilshire's has got four of these on the web. Warwickshire's multi-bought. Uh, Christina, you've got yours in London. Well done. Elizabeth and Jennifer and Margaret and Sharon and Pauline and Lynn and Ray and London. You're all happy jewelry makers, aren't you? Because you're not having any issues. If you are, just keep, yeah, keep trying, keep refreshing. It'll be available on the website all day. So hopefully you'll be able to secure it. Um, if not right now, then hopefully a little bit later on. Um, it is, it is very, I do feel Ross's frustration now because obviously we hear of, we hear of launches and opportunities like this month ago um so that that you know there's that anticipation straight anticipation mm. straight away and then when it comes to wearing something like this it's just annoying it's really annoying um so keep refreshing your screens nine pounds and 99 pence only for your 10 millimeter strand claire it's so pretty it is really really pretty isn't it really pretty and again when you've got you know the um doing the class as well because yeah. you could work couldn't you with any any of your colored metals there and it would work fabulously alongside the s class yes would they yeah. work um um would you incorporate them maybe into your 12 o'clock projects yeah absolutely they're still you the components, could. aren't they yeah yeah absolutely you could peg bales yes yeah and maybe either side and um, you know if you wanted to glue them in and then just add to chain nice. you know but again with that size you know they're focal aren't they that's yeah. a big you know it's a big size absolutely beautiful jewelry makers well done we have a hundred did you say okay we're gonna leave those with you poor ross I, somebody give adam give ross a cuddle <laughs> <laughs> and i have to say ross is not a cuddly person are you ross <laughs> he's one of those he's like mm, you don't like cuddles see i'm coming in every morning and give everybody cuddles <laughs> Adam likes a cuddle. You like a cuddle, Michael, don't you? Yeah, Ross, you don't like him. Uh. <laughs> I feel like you need a cuddle right now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's do the four mil. I do get it though, I do get it. It's a weird thing, isn't it, a cuddle? I like a cuddle. This, story, this has just gone on there. Tangent, isn't it? Cuddles are good. They're really anyway. good for you, yeah. We Come always on, have a cuddle, Ross. don't we? We do, yeah. Now, we took the six meals to what? Oh, you did as well. You did too. Let's do 30 second clock. Oh, look at the four meals, they're so pretty. But see, again, you you know, the size has dropped down, but you're not losing anything, are you? You've no, still, still got that, yeah, individuality in every, sing every single one. It's beautiful. You know when you look up into the sky and the clouds are moving in the wind? Mm. It's almost that in a gem. It transports you, doesn't it? Yeah. Sort of, you're and you almost just want to lie down and watch yeah. what happens before yeah. you. It's that in a gem. Drift off and daydream. Dreamy. Yeah. Dreamy. We're going even lower. We took the six mils here, but we are going even lower. I really like the four mil. I really want the four mil. They're so pretty. This is your penultimate strand of this uh, parcel of this opportunity. Don't forget, you've got the multi-gem strand coming your way. I don't know if Ross is going to play it, to be honest with you. He's, he's, he's a bit upset. Mm. He's never upset. <laughs> 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 7 
99. It's like, it is what it is. I'm totally cool. Uh, oh, you're not upset? <laughs> but you know when someone says they're fine too many times? <laughs> <laughs> high pitch. I'm totally fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'll say no. I'm totally fine. <laughs> well done, everybody. Multi buying. Um, I think everything looks fine on the web right now, Ross. To be honest, it looks very busy. How many have you got of these? 150, or rather, we had loads of multi buyers. Ooh, tassels, Claire. Tassel, yeah, definitely. And with the next strand, definitely tassels. Yeah, or would you mix mm. them? Yeah, absolutely you could, couldn't you? That would be nice. Yeah. It's fine. It's totally fine. fine. It's fine. These I'm, I'm, I'm fine. It's fine. <laughs> yeah. And then when you... They're no longer fine when the yeah. tone yeah, goes that yeah. bit deeper. I'm it's fine. fine. <laughs> 7 99 Well done, Ray, Lynn, Sue, Christine, Gloria, Warwickshire, Maker, Janice, West Midlands, um, Hampshire, Christine, Wiltshire, uh, West Sussex, Jennifer. The phone lines are completely clear, jewellery makers. So, um, yeah, they're fine. <laughs> 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 you can totally use our, um, our call centre um, on that free phone telephone number um janet patricia make a good and linda june there's lots of you in the process either of checking out on the web or picking up the phone lines um it's good to talk and it's good to talk mm. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to talk so you can chat to our lovely team upstairs jillian hellion and isle of man janet patricia well done uh lanarkshire and shona well done this is the penultimate Oh, something's just dawned on me. And I'm not fine with it, Ross. Something's just dawned on me. This might be the last ever strand. Ever. I'm not fine with that. No. I just had a little laugh in tea and now it looks like I'm actually crying. <laughs> but no, seriously, I'm not okay with that. Potentially ever. Have we? ever bought you faceted faceted peacock or green angel out before i don't remember it ever being faceted i mean if this is the last strand this is this is the loveliest isn't it this is a you're going out on a high it's that mic drop in yeah. it yeah because this is beautiful it's the green angel out that's the one drop. i was drawn to when i was with you, you did like, I, yeah, I saw I that loved it she beelined yeah, for it yeah. straight away. And I can imagine with some with a parcel as rare as this, and again you think about it from if we put our uh, our gem um traders hats on for a second, obviously you want to retain as much carrot weight as possible. That's how they gel uh, they sell them literally by carrot weight. And we had to sort of overcome this when it came to type A J dye. It was like, okay, we want you to facet that round. Well that's cutting carrot weight away yeah we still love them faceted round so the fact that there is only one faceted strand speaks volumes in my head but there is 200 and yeah you're right oh i'm gonna put it on the on the bust i think so many people are drawn to this because then what it brings to it, isn't it you take away that carrot weight but look at all the light that is now being brought to that and that you know that sparkle to it it showcases the chatoyancy, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. And I don't know if chatoyancy is even the right word because technically it's not a phenomena gemstone, but you actually do get those almost like silvery cloud formations. Um, we're opening this up, jewelry makers, at under ten pounds. It's your finale of this strand. I don't recall. I apologise if I'm wrong, but I don't recall ever bringing you faceted green or peacock angel eye. I know we mm. did like, sa like a, a, almost like a satellite bead in the blue, but that's more plentiful. For a parcel that's as limited and fleeting as, as green angel eye, we are about to take this jewelry makers to the lowest price that we have brought you thus far. In fact, not so far that we've brought you. Because there's no nothing after this, is there? We've got no more green angel light after this. It's mm. the last rank. Mm. So this is the lowest price of the parcel. And our finale strand. 30 second clock, jewelry makers. Because we're going even lower. 
even if you're you've been watching this showcase which is the most affordable showcase of green angel light that i could have imagined honestly and that's because of the issues that we've had on the web um and i have never imagined them go as low as they were if you've watched in the past and you're thinking okay it was lovely but it's not within budget hopefully this is going to introduce natural green angel light to your uh to your portfolio because we've never we've never done these prices have we not no. for the green and most likely never will and these quantities we only went lower given the situation of today it's the only faceted green angel light strand that we've had if you are having issues oh goodness oh oh and i need to say please know moving forward we cannot take angel light of any color really to 4.99 not even the blue i don't think which is more plentiful i mean faceted strands are, are whatever it is you know yeah not even nuggets claire no no angel light strand blue green peacock should be anywhere near a fiver Ross, this is another one of those. It's that 7 a.m. deal, isn't it? Or the or your one pound deals. We've been so excited about this launch and it's just typical, isn't it, that we've had all, all the web issues. Um, that being said, I am seeing people getting through. So please do keep refreshing. Please do keep trying. Um, Ray, Susan, Katie, Gloria, Susan, Angela's got four. Well done. Uh, um, hello to, oh gosh, sorry, there's that, that many names on the, fo on the phone lines. Anne, Patricia, D, Tracy, Multivine, Christine, uh, Susan, Gloria, uh, Ray, Julian, Westler, Morgans, Linda in Shropshire, Sue's got two. Two, Elizabeth Warwickshire's got two, Susan in Perth and Kinross getting two, Nicolette's got two, June Tracy's got two, Sally, Mary, Hamida, Tracy in Norfolk. There's lots of web bidders making their confirmations now. Um, so hopefully everything is uh, it's ironed itself out. Hampshire's got two, uh, Wiltshire's got three, lots of Wiltshire customers getting involved. Sylvia, Pauline, D, uh, Sandra, Hamida, Nicole. Um, we had 200 of these jewelry makers. Um, that's not a massive quantity actually no because um, I'd be multi buying with yeah. that you know you think about it, you know make the most of those facets and that size you know if you're multi buying and maybe I'll thread it onto wire twist it together if you've got Ooh, some nice. small seed pearls things like that so you know it could still be quite a big piece of jewelry but you're layering up aren't you you know get that nice twist your nine o'clock kits you could use that butterfly which is precious yeah. metal yeah you had some epic deals today in amongst yeah, the issues do your tassels with that yeah cool. yeah and use that with your yeah. butterfly that would be lovely mm. um yeah we have to be reactive we are live tv it's one of those things isn't mm. it it is one of those things 4.99 well done there are so many of you there lovely with your projects actually claire i think yeah and with um, the, the um the gemstone donuts later you could you know if love you that to, yeah love that well done everybody you literally have bagged a bargain there and that for the rarity of the gemstone the beauty of the gemstone the popularity of the gemstone um it's, yeah it's one of those things it's happened um, and it's fantastic for you guys at home because if ever you wanted your green angel light um, today, I think you've seen it at the most affordable prices. How about incorporating this, Claire? I'm just going to take it off the bus for one second. How about incorporating this? Gosh, that gets more and more beautiful every time I look at it. Look at those colours. Huh. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, look at that. Oh. oh, I have just heard something though, jewelry makers. We probably won't play this today. I'm so sorry. And that is because, again, it's a brand new launch. Mm. And if they, we're having all these I2 ish, I2, uh, web issues, sorry. Mm. Last thing we want is, is for you to not buy it and to waste an auction. What we will most likely do is after the break, do the early bird, mm -hmm. the S clasps. Um, and obviously you've got your master class and everything coming up and we'll bring you some more amazing deals also. But we will probably launch this on the weekend now, jewelry makers. Okay, okay, yeah. I, I do get it, Ross, I do get it. As I'm so sorry if you've been waiting for this, but there, I do understand at the same time. So I'm gonna put that there, so I'm not teasing anyone. Um, and make sure you, you know that on the weekend that we're launching that. Oh. I'll let you know what day. I will let you know what day. Um, how many have you got left of that of, of, of the faceted? 
Okay, well done, make sure, limited now, make sure you're checking out. Um, and again, that collection is all on the web. Ordinarily, on any normal working day, <laughs> <laughs> these would not have sold out uh, sorry it would have sold out sorry on any normal day they would have sold out but they wouldn't have been those prices um, they would have closed higher so have a little look on the website or the w's at jewelrymaker.com keep trying as well if you are having any issues um, they're all on the web right now all still available um, and again the only reason it's not saying sold out sold out sold out is because of the web issues um, so then what, sorry? Each item went, that's amazing, isn't it? Each item went under 15 pounds. Wow, that is incredible. Likewise with Claire's projects, because these issues started at eight o'clock this morning. So frustrating. Oh. So frustrating. Amazing. Anyway, well done everybody. So we're going to just cut to a very short break and we have got these gorgeous, uh, it's your early bird, but not so early now. <laughs> it's that, what was it? More of a, what pigeon was it? Oh, what pigeon was it? Yeah. The exhausted pigeon. <laughs> <laughs> <You know? laughs> so that's my impression of an exhausted pigeon. You know, there's like a, you know, there's a video of this, two chihuahuas, long haired chihuahuas. One's up by the window, all bright as a button. And then there's another one that pops his head up after like this. <laughs> That's the exhausted pigeon. Well, your early bird was meant to be um, in the first hour. However, exhausted pigeon, we've, we'll bring it a little bit later. Hello, Rachel, this is it. And I'm just gonna stick with me, this is Rachel. I shall forever think of you. I'm neither an early bird or a night owl. I'm just a permanently exhausted pigeon. <laughs> Love to see you both together. It's tickled me that as Rachel. That's brilliant. Um, okay, do not go anywhere. Your exhausted pigeon um, is coming up after the break. Hello everyone, it's Mark here from a very damp and soggy Whitney. I'm here to tell you all about my up and coming show, which is this Wednesday, the 25th of September. I'm gonna be joining lovely Carol, Tom and the crew. And I want to tell you quickly about my two project hours. Nine o'clock hour, we have got the most beautiful shell pearl kits. We've got four millimeter and six millimeter rounds alongside seed beads that are absolutely beautiful and this will be the tutorial that comes free of charge when you purchase any of the kits in the nine o'clock hour and then at 12 o'clock you probably heard me and carol mention over the past few days we have got two beautiful beautiful howlite kits for the first time i believe we have matte howlite in four different size strands and then we've also got and this is a work in progress We've got this beautiful bracelet here and I've teamed this alongside some beautiful fire polished beads as well and again this is going to be the tutorial that you're going to get in the 12 o'clock and if it couldn't get any better we've also thrown in the most amazing mustard mukite project as well three different size strands Ellen teamed up with beautiful seed beads 
So that's Wednesday the 25th. We've got Beautiful Shell Pearl at nine o'clock and then the incredible Howlite and Mookite at 12 o'clock. So I hope you can join myself, Carol and the team from eight o'clock. Quarter to twelve. I know. Where's it gone? I know. <laughs> Time does fly when you're having fun. Or maybe you look like this guy. <laughs> there he is. He's an exhausted pigeon. I literally googled it during the break. I googled it. <laughs> oh yes. I look like him quite a lot. I felt like my eyes were like that this morning when the alarm went off. Like... <laughs> Most of the time of the day, actually. Yeah. Yeah. There he is. There he is. That's Ro Ross. Is that you right now? No, he's fine. He's fine. fine. <laughs> he is fine. He is totally fine. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at him. It's the whole posture of him as well. He's brilliant, isn't he? Oh, I like it. Um. Anyway, Claire McDonald. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> Let, shall we do the exhausted pigeon auction? Yes. I think we should make that a thing, you know? Yeah. We should have like a sort of midday-ish, it'll happen when it happens, auction called the exhausted pigeon. Can we do it, Russ? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and just have that little guy, little guy is the, is, I think it'll work. What do you reckon, Good Claire? Good plan, yeah. <laughs> You're all just humouring me now, aren't you? <laughs> totally just humouring me. Mm, that's a great idea. <laughs> I like it. Okay, S class. When was the last time we had an S class? Um, by the way, the nuggets. Saturday. Oh, don't miss those. I'm so sorry, but it is pointless us launching them on such a lovely strand if it's going to be wasted. So we're going to do a on Saturday with the whole nugget selection. Um. By the way, on Saturday, we really, we have a coy of pearls. You know, a coy of pearls are dying out. I know. Mm. The original culture pearl. They, uh, there's a disease, there's a disease that's attacking the baby, the juveniles, basically. Oh, that's um, horrible. So it means they're obviously not getting to the point where they can mature and they can culture pearls. Oh, that's so, um, uh, Ross has just said in our ear they're absolutely incredible as well. So mm. another reason why Akoya mm. pills are as expensive as they are. Um, so that's coming up on Saturday alongside your um, nugget selection. So if anyone's wondering where the nugget selection is today, it's we've dropped it because of, of the issues. We will yeah, launch you don't it want on to miss Saturday. those because they're... Uh... Lovely. And also, we'd be rushing it now, wouldn't we? Yeah. Um, because sometimes when issues do come, it obviously slows down the show. Um, so we haven't been able to squeeze in as many auctions mm. um, effectively. So, we, w yeah, I agree. We wouldn't be able to give it the time that it quantifies. Um, or we'd overrun and then we've got your sort of your project still to come, etc. cetera. So um, best thing to do is just go, okay, draw a line in it. Let's schedule it for Saturday. So it's coming up on Saturday. Um, but... We are going to include um, your early bird jewelry makers, which is your S class and an S class. Do you know if you were to sit and list all your clasps, how many of us, being honest, would forget about the S class? I think mm. I would have done. You'd go, maybe no particular order. Bolt ring, you go. Lobster. Toggle. 
box. Magnetic. Trigger. Trigger. <laughs> Exhausted pigeon. Yeah, a trigger is basically a lobster. It's just basically one's rounded, one's smooth. Um, you got the S class, which is kind of a little bit like a toggle, but all in one piece. Now, um, I'm going to start. We've got it in the three different colours. Now, I would personally encourage these open a little bit, um, but it's quite, um, quite self-explanatory how they work. So you just attach a jump ring, don't you? Mm. Yeah, yeah, or, but yeah, absolutely. You can, can't you? With wire guarding, if you've got that in there. But yeah, jump ring. I mean, look how they are nice ones, aren't they? They were good, really good lovely. thickness, and yeah, yes, I love the ends on them lots of solid so basically your jump ring would almost push in there wouldn't it is that right yes yeah so you push your jump ring the end of and your i had, piece a, of I had a little manipulate of them um and they are they're really nice yeah yeah very easy nice and solid yes yeah um you don't want it to be too open because obviously then it's not going to be secure yeah you want it to, to, to be a, you want to be able to have to push it over does that make sense so we're launching the gold plate in sterling silver these are precious metal and you do get two. Um, are they all available on pre-order? No, oh. says Ross. No. Um, so we'll do the gold first. We've also got your, your rose gold, which we rarely actually see lately. Um, and then we're going to be bringing you um, the silver. How many do we have? Oh, we've got 100. That seems to be quite a frequent number that we've had today. Sorry, one second. I'm just going to adjust my chair. I realise I was really low then. Um, okay, so you get the two of them, everyone. You can see that 925 stamp. I, I, I think they'd be great for people who maybe struggle with dexterity issues. It's another alternative. It's not quite as fiddly as a lobster, a trigger, or a bolt ring. Yeah, and they're very, to me, they're very much a, a decorative detail. Yes, they, they function, aren't they? But you know, it's having that to the side, maybe having it, that to the front if you want to add something else to mm. it. It, it. You know, almost like a, a fancy link, isn't it? They're a bit infinity-like, aren't they? Yes, yeah. So I'm wondering, um, Claire McDonald, silversmith extraordinaire, mm. could you maybe just get, maybe if you multi-bought on these, would they link together? Yeah, have a lovely bracelet. Make a nice mix, bracelet. Yeah, mix metals, that'd be really nice, wouldn't it? That'd be gorgeous. Yeah. So you get a pair, if you multi-bought, maybe mix the colours, go a little bit, uh, channel your inner Cartier. Yeah. Um, yeah, why not? Graphics are live. We have 100 available opportunities, jewellery makers. So um, lots of precious metal invested into these, which is what you want. You want them to be solid and nice and secure. Um, how about £10 per S-Class? That's pretty good, isn't it? Pretty good price point. I agree with what Claire, you just said there. You know, if they were to make their way round to the front or um, on the wrist, which obviously happens quite a lot, um, it's a nice about, feature, wouldn't it? Yeah. yeah. You, you, that that almost looks like the main focus mm. design. What about attaching things like your pendants and things? Like yes, this? yeah, yeah. You know, we had those on and offable clip bales. The bales, yeah, could be a version of that, couldn't it? But without a clip. Yeah. Actually, just using the S, the yeah. fluidity of yeah. the precious metal. We're at ten pounds each. How about? Never mind, ten pounds each. How about five pounds each? I'm looking at your kits on the web right now. These will be lovely with those kits that you had earlier on. And yes. kits that you've got yeah. coming up. Already we've got collectors um, getting involved. You get two. Solid 925 sterling silver. It's been ages since I've seen an S-Class. Sorry. Ages since I've seen an S-Class. And like I said, you're getting the two of them. To show you the quality, the thickness. If I turn my tweezers around, you can see. Um, yeah, you can see a lot that's in the, the the amount that's in there, and again, you want them to have that to be closed to a certain degree because obviously then you always have to push them on, don't you? Otherwise, it's not secure. We're at five pounds per S class jewelry makers, um, and already collectors getting involved on the phone lines. Pamela in Monmouthshire, Anne in Essex, getting three West Sussex, Susan Nottinghamshire, Anne in Warwickshire. How about we go even lower? It is one of those days, I tell you what, if you are shopping and able to shop with us today, you are bagging some serious bargains. Mm. Ha okay, this is ridiculous. You know it's not a normal day if I say this. Sterling silver, gold plated sterling silver. How about you get two 
S clasps for under five pounds. Claire, two pounds. Very, very good. And I would look at them as, as you know, fancy links because you could just turn them around, couldn't you? And they'd be sort of the reverse, nice earrings as well. Mm. You could you could add them into um, shepherd hooks like that. Maybe hammer them too. You know, I always find if I try and make my own, I never leave enough wire. Mm. So you know, I never have. You look how perfectly balanced they are. You know, those loops are. They're just yeah, exactly to get that the right. Yeah, yeah. And that little ball detail at the end. Yeah, can you see? Yeah. So actually that bracelet that we said earlier on, which I kind of said, oh, it's going to be quite an investment, uh, that yes, will be. Yeah, but yeah. actually it's not. Yeah. £2.50 per link. What are they measuring? 11 millimetres, Russ. So how many 11 millimetres are in a seven inch bracelet? Yeah, Ross is, um, Adam's pretty good at this with the metric system. We'll do the maths, we'll work it out. <laughs> <laughs> Alyssa, it's 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 going to be affordable. There we go. I mean, it depends on your wrist size, doesn't it? But if you sort of work on the sort of classic seven inches, that's a tricky one, isn't it? Text it if you know the answer. Because <laughs> I think I've stumped everyone on that one. But if you multi bought, they'd be absolutely great, wouldn't they? To be able to make a full bracelet. Oh. So 177 divided by 11. Divided by 11. You'd need 16. Okay, so eight packs. Eight packs. Which will total... 40 pounds for that bracelet. Nice, well, yeah. You wouldn't be buying a bracelet of that gram way. Nice, yeah. Who's bought... I mean, Alice in County Durham has got 10 of these. Absolutely amazing, and that would be a lot of precious metal. That would be a weighty bracelet as well to create. Anyway, two pound fifty each. Well done, Alice. Multi buying, stocking up a stash. Nikki in Merseyside, Catherine in Lanarkshire, Sue in Northamptonshire, getting four. Susan in Perth and Kinross, Maker in West Sussex, Nottinghamshire, getting two. Pamela, well done to you. Anne in Essex, getting three. Julie in Boston. I think Julie in Boston. Were you shopping yesterday? Is where we we're like, oh, which Boston? Boston, UK or USA? Uh, I bet you hear that a lot. I bet that gets quite annoying, actually. Uh, Patricia in Middlesex, Nicolette in Surrey, uh, Warwickshire, well done. Love the return of the S class. I know, yes. I hope it's here to stay. I went a bit X Factor then, Claire, didn't I? <laughs> the return, love it all. Go on, you do it, you, you do it. Yeah, Come go on, Michael. Michael. Return of the S class. <laughs> it's very good. Very good. Well done, everybody. Let's, do you want to link them together? Yes. Let's do two. the rose, shall we? S clasp. <laughs> <laughs> do you remember that conversation, Claire? Reach up for the S sky. sky. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, let's do the rose gold colour. Climb every mountain. Oh, these are lovely. They're beautiful, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, really lovely. Ah, oh, look at that. Lovely luster. I particularly like them in the rose gold. Um, again, they'll work with any strand. They'll work with any technique, obviously, that you need to incorporate um, a class two. But at the same time, like Claire was saying, I think they'd be lovely little motifs, little connectors. Um, how many got, Rusko? We've got 50 of the rose gold, so, uh, rose gold, so more limited. But we're going to take it to another amazing price tag. Oh, so do they work looping together then? So they, yeah, you can loop them together. I'm wondering whether what I might do is, if you've got some jump rings. Oh, so you would do I like, might keep them flat. Scooch it right a bit. Ah, so you would go So they look nice like that. Ring. Yeah, I think I'd go, uh, yeah, have maybe two, two jump rings in between. Yeah. Because they're, they're nice that. like that. But then when you wear it, you know, it's going to move a little bit. So yeah, it depends yeah. what look you like. And obviously, if you use the jump ring, it's going to space them out a bit as well. Well, that's They're really that lovely. Then, even more, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. 4 99 jewellery makers to get hold of the uh, rose gold. We don't actually see rose gold that often, do we? What do you say? Seldom ever seen. I know. Seldom ever seen jewellery makers. Um, I only had 50, so... What's tickled Michael? I don't know. What's tickled you? What hair? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I can see it now. 
Hang on. Oh, do you know I can see it on the TV <laughs> it's monitor? It's there. <laughs> I love it. So <laughs> Probably crying laughing now. <laughs> the gallery have gone really quiet. I'm very sorry. It was just quite funny. Uh, our cameras literally pick up everything, but that's a testament <laughs> to our gemstone. Because we get really close and you can see literally the smallest little hair there. <laughs> so if our gemstones were rubbish, you'd really see it, wouldn't you? <laughs> Funny. We knew we were going to have a giggle today, didn't we? Even amongst the chaos. Um, how many we got, Roscoe? We've got a big quantity. 300? Amazing. 300 available opportunities, jewelry makers. Again, make sure you're checking them out. Um, oh, it's like a river of lustre right there. Minus the fluff. <laughs> Amazing. £2.50 per clasp. I'm glad you're doing that, Claire. Do you want one of these? Oh, yes, please. Mm, thank you. There you go. Yeah, that's... Oh, oh, oh. Nice, Claire. That's nice. lovely, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, lovely. That's... And they look but like... So if you do them like that, remember turning them... Because they're like a mirror, aren't they? So you do earrings. Yeah. Well, they'd be lovely like earrings. Yeah. Because then you just flip them, don't you? So they're... That's a nice idea. And then you only need sort of one of each colour, don't you? Because you're getting two. Love that idea. Yeah, loads and loads of you there. Helen and Patricia, well done to you. Pamela and Bristol. Um, Paula and Anne in Essex, multi buyers. Um, I can see web bidders coming through. So again, hopefully you're okay. Um, you've got to have a laugh, haven't you? Ah. <laughs> 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 Oh, you gotta have a laugh. <laughs> Life is too short not to have a laugh. You do get two. <laughs> you do get two. I know I've only got one here, but Claire's nicked one. Um, basically, oh. um, thirty second clock. We've got quantity of them. Let's put it there. Thirty second clock. We've got quantity of them. Um, is the oh. web okay now, Roscoe? There we go. Yeah. Cool. It's been alright for hours. <laughs> no, you're joking. Um, yeah, it's, it seems alright right now because there's lots of people getting involved. Um, I reckon there's going to be people up, upping their quantity. So like Alice, who's got five, I think well, she might have a quantity. Jane might as well. David might as well. Patricia might. Helen might. Paula might. Bristol might. Anne might. Nicole might. Susan might as well. Oh, there's loads of you. Um, the web seems to have sorted itself out. Fingers crossed. Three pounds and 49 pence you're getting sterling silver, a pair of S clasps. We have got a massive quantity of these, but again, that's an absolute giveaway, mm. Claire, isn't it? Yeah, it is. And you can see, so you've got that, that stamp on there haven't, as well, yeah. haven't you, in that centre? There's a good amount of silver in there. We're on the, sil on the silver now without any plating, so you could use those in soldering, couldn't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, absolutely you could. And, you know, maybe you want to texture them as well, like, you know, like we did in the, um, the first demo. You could... Uh, Take your hammer to those. Yeah, that would definitely work. Like that, use them as on and offable bales. I think, yes, yes they're a class, yes. but you can use them as yes, so much Yes, they sort of like sit like that, wouldn't they? And then, yeah, they'd be... so you'd have maybe a nice, nice big pearls coming down there. Yeah, lovely, I like that. Love that idea. Lots of you there, jewelry makers. Christine in Suffolk, why don't you? Makers got in Bristol's got three. Susan in Hertford has got three. Um, Paula, well done. Um, Linda, it's super, super busy today. Your kits are coming up. We've had fun. We have had fun. <laughs> it is busy. It is still busy. Like our call screens literally have not stopped, but it's just been one of those that some people are having issues. It seems to have been sorted out right now. So um, fingers crossed. And hopefully we've had a fun show as well. 
I knew getting ready for today's show that, like, literally, there's a meme that I saw the other day, and it's like it's this young little pigeon, and and it's like me going into work, and then there's me leaving work, and there's that video of that old bedraggled pigeon. <laughs> That's me today. That is from all the laughing. That's all the laughing makeup stuff. Oh face. dear. Um. Oh yeah. It's been fun though. Um, well done, Shani. Well done, you, Nicole. Well done, you, Linda. Um, again, you can get as many of these as you wish. You're not restricted. We have temporarily put Nugget Mania back to Saturday. Um, that's well, mostly more than anything, it's because we won't be able to give it the, the time that it deserves. Um, so, so, um, and that was a really beautiful strand. So, I, the last thing we want to do yeah. is rush it. So, we'll launch it on Saturday. Um, now, projects coming up, Claire. Do you want to talk us through your projects? Yes, yes. So you've got, again, another really, really clever, um, some clever findings. Really, really gorgeous gemstones uh, in that donut shape. So you've got black onyx. Yes. Yeah, lovely. Which one's next? Red jasper. Which is gorgeous, isn't it? Real warmth at yeah. the moment of it. And then green onyx. I know, I love this one. We haven't had green onyx for ages, have we? And it's just, the glow is like nothing else, is it? I love, I love yeah. onyx and green onyx, my um, favourite. And all of these are silver? Yes, yeah. So the chain is a paperclip chain. Um, so it's like those elongated links which are super popular. And really, really, really clever clever findings that, that come with it. So I, I've not seen these before. Shall I hold one up to show the customers yeah. what they're about? They almost look like, like a little horseshoe, but not. Yes. Do you know yeah. what I mean? It, it's like, it's an open jump ring effectively, but yes. it's got. With two closed um, loops. So, and there are a couple of different ways that you can use them. So really, really easy to use. Uh, it just depends how you want to do it, um, whether you want to cut your chain or not. Mm. So do shop ahead, they're on pre-order jewelry makers. So you've got the three different projects. They are sterling silver um, in, the, well, yeah, I'm gonna say the most popular link of chain right now, and that is the paperclip. Um, incredible. So which one would you like me to start with? Well, I'll tell you what, Claire, you choose. Uh, I, well, I love I love all of that. I'm gonna demo with that one, I think. So, so um, let's go with the green. Yeah, let's yep. go with the green. I mean, okay. I think it'll, you'll be able to see it be now, brighter. Um, before we get into the uh, um, the actual, the new finding that we're launching today, I wanna to show you this necklace, but look at that. You know, think about on its own, if this was an auction on its own, which we do quite frequently, um, the paperclip chain is easily the most popular link at the moment. Would you agree? Um, so much so that there are, it's headlining, basically there's been lots of headlines uh, written about the um, paperclip chain, lots of the big jewellers, little jewellers, and everything in between are all including um, the paperclip chain into their uh, designs. Um, there's an article that was written back in May 2022, and it says, perfectly trendy, get on board with paperclip uh, jewellery. Um, it says, remember when you were bored in homeroom and you strung together, um, paper clips from your mm -hmm. pencil case to pass the time or maybe you gave them to your friend to cement um, what's that word friend clique is that right either yeah. way paper clip jewelry um, has come a long way um, they are now the trend so get on board whether a single strand or layering paper clips have reached a new level of chic and you can see her um, wearing a lovely paper clip chain just there um, they go on to say um, but this style is actually not new um, whether this trend takes you back to homeroom or makes you nostalgic with the style of the 80s, the paperclip necklace may be trendy but it's anything but new. Created by Coco Chanel and made famous by none other than Jackie O herself, paperclip jewellery is actually a classic masquerading as a trend. Paperclip necklaces have come a long way since you strung them together as a kid. Available in both yellow and white gold, um, as plain paperclip chains and even accented with pearls. Paperclip pieces need to be part of your fine jewellery collection. After all, if Jackie O and Coco Chanel approve, how can you go wrong? And it's that same look, basically. I mean, that photograph that you can see has got a mixture of the chains, hasn't it? But there is that the, the actual um, main features are a lot, an exaggerated paperclip. These days, you've got Monica Venade, you've got Ashley Clark, you've got um, 
all the designers working with it. Glamour magazine, paperclip necklaces are the fashion uh, pack's fave style of jewellery right now. You can see a perfect example actually straight there. They go on to say the jewellery you choose is such an expression of your personal taste. Although there's one jewellery trend that seems to unite every style tribe right now and that's the paperclip necklace. We're spotting the traditional stationary staples glowing up adorning the neck of every influencer around. Beyond um, whether you're a fan of gold or silver, if you're a minimalist or love to layer, paperclip necklaces are a versatile addition to anyone's accessory arsenal. Um, and I love that. And it's layering, it was saying there, layering mm -hmm. with the actual pearls. Even the likes of gorgeous Reese Witherspoon. Oh, that is a perfectly, look Look how beautifully manicured that pooch is. <laughs> it's just a lovely little face. That's it. expression. Why are you looking at? Yeah. Why are you looking at? Hello. Um, <laughs> look, and she's, you can see her there wearing uh, her paperclip necklace. Monica Vadeda. In gold for me, you're talking, what is that, £105 with 30% off. It, I've seen that necklace. It's really fine, by the way. It doesn't look... It looks a lot bigger on that photograph than I think it actually is. Um, I can show you another example. In silver. £100. Uh, don't be fooled by the photo on the left. That's her wearing lots. Lots of chains. So that's got to be at least one, two, three, four of those. Mm. Um, well, so that's 18 inches there, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. So she's wearing four necklaces in that photograph. It's a, at a hundred pound each. So even if you go to the more affordable end, go to Argos. Five, uh, four star reviews. Um, Thirty-four pound ninety-nine pence. It's not bad, is it? It's not a bad price. In ninety-five sterling mm. silver. That's not a bad price. You Very don't good. just get a paperclip chain jewelry makers of eighteen inches, which is the same as this. Yours is eighteen inch. You also get green onyx. Look at that. Ross, did you just say what I think you said? Look at that glow. You get these two. Oh, I'm not showing it very well there amazing would you describe them as a bale claire well they are a bale really aren't they yes yeah there's the paper clip so ross has just said to me that this is natural i don't think i've ever seen natural green onyx ever it's amazing normally green onyx has undergone treatment and that's okay it's lovely i don't think i've ever brought natural green onyx before so you get everything that's on the back of my hand, plus you get two, I don't know if I can, I'll try. Jump rings. Can you see those up there? Just about. Plus you get the two jump rings as well. Claire, this is a brand new launch. Yes. Yeah, as far as I know, absolutely it is. Yeah, and it's such a clever finding. It's a bit like, you know, when you just see, sometimes you can be uh, wowed, can't you, by gemstones or really, you know, they, the whole thing about them is that you know they're beautiful and they wow you but, but as jewelry makers you know it's those little bits that, that are sort of almost that supporting act that are almost they're totally. just as expensive are you know yeah. just as important um you know as, as a side to the the gemstones because you need those to to actually do anything with the amazing uh gemstones so i guess as a jewelry maker yes you get excited by the gemstones because that is incredible but the, finding, but it's those it's the that, yeah. findings that pull it all together, Absolutely, isn't it? yeah. And totally when you see agree. something like that, it's very different. Yeah. It just yeah. works really well. And and the fact that they literally, so, well, you, you were saying earlier on, you can use them actually in a different, uh, a few different ways. Yeah, yeah. Um, so clever, though. Yeah. Because what's the alternative? Lark said not, you know? Yes, or, yeah. Something, or, or um, which I like as well. Uh, you know, when I've worked with them before, you've had to do much more um, ornate wire work Bale, yeah. for example, which is a lovely look, but this way it's just it's, it's really about quick. that that gemstone, isn't it? Yeah, really quick, really simple, and all the yeah. attraction is yeah. on the actual yeah, uh, donut definitely. itself. Um, okay, so hang on a minute. You've got three exciting headlines here. A, the fact that it's the paperclip, the most popular 
design of chain mm -hmm. in 18 inches. So B, you've got green onyx, which I can't remember the last time we did green onyx on air. But the fact is natural, I know I've never brought natural green onyx to air previously before. And then you have these brand new findings. So really, really, really clever. Mm. Would you describe them as a bale? Would you call them Yes, a bale? I think they are, aren't they? Yeah. 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 Now, all the projects are on pre-order, Jewelry Makers. So, um, yeah, do shop ahead. Let's bring the graphics live. Natural green onyx. Sterling silver paperclip chain in 18 inches. Brand new findings with your jump rings. Um, have we got quantity of these? A hundred of each of these kits. You could be a complete novice, Claire, couldn't you, to jewelry making? Totally, and not have lots of tools as well. And you know, you're making, be because everything has been very, very cleverly designed, hasn't it, to fit together. Yeah. You know, they are, they've been made for, for that purpose. So, you know, the idea I, would, is I wouldn't recommend it, but say you don't have any pliers. Yeah. You know, you could you could do it with your just your fingers. So you could, you know, you just might have just, you know, channel hopped and you're here now and you never made any jewelry before. You can absolutely make that. And how you know, amazing that piece is that? There. You could be wearing yeah. it then, maybe yeah. that evening. Go, yeah. Oh, I like your necklace. Thanks, I made it. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know you made jewelry. I've just started. But you're working with precious metal and big designs at the moment. Yes, and when you look at those prices, you know, the price comparisons. Yeah. The graphics are live, jewellery makers. Good luck to each and every single one of you. Um, three headlines. Just looking at the hard uh, at the Argos um, chain, um, the paperclip chain, which is 18 inches as well, I do believe. £34.99. That's not bad. I think that's where, you know, I don't think anybody would think that's... Uh, um, that's overpriced I think that's fair yeah. it is precious metal it's a classic chain as well it's one of the most popular looks let's match that price tag straight away and then tell you jewelry makers we're going lower not stopping there you know we're already you're buying your paperclip chain and you're getting everything else for free aren't we and it's a lovely heavyweight chain too. Mm, it is. Okay. If you have any questions concerning this, obviously uh, we are live in the studio if you're watching in the 12 o'clock midday hour. Um, if you're watching in the evening, then we've probably gone home. But you can uh, text in if you're watching right now live. Um, <clears throat> if you've got any questions, my voice is going. Um, if you've got any questions about you know how to use these findings, but Claire is obviously going to talk us through it and demonstrate. To go anywhere lower than what's on your screens right now, how about we take it under 30 pounds? How about 60 seconds and the whole project goes under 20 pounds? That's a great price for the necklace. Mm. Michael, can you just pass me that blue bus that I was just using in the previous hour? Yeah, you know, for the chain alone. That's amazing. Yeah, it is. Because it's not flimsy, you know, like one of those, what they call trace chains, where... No, it's a necklace, isn't it? Yeah. It's a, it, yes, that's it, it. Yeah, exactly. it is. It's a... it's, if it, it, it is like, okay, I'm on Monica Veneda website, imagine, and I want to get a, um, a, a paperclip chain, instead of paying £100 for theirs, which is slightly textured, granted. Um, I actually prefer this. I'll actually prefer the sort of more industrial like shapes i mean i would happily pay 29.99 for this necklace it's a finished chain yeah yeah that's good clasp on it yeah it is finished complete i'll show you that that's why i've asked for the bus there because i didn't think you could actually see that in the shop window 29.99 no way yeah it wouldn't be that price look at the amount of sterling silver that's invested in there you don't just get that though. You get your beautiful onyx. Is that going to stay there? No. You get your beautiful onyx and then you get these amazing findings as well. Brand new findings that Claire's going to show us um, how we work with. You get two of them and you get your two little itty bitty jump rings. They are little jump rings, aren't they? They Claire? are, yeah. But they're perfectly sized, aren't they? That's, that's what you want. 
There you go. So you get all of that as well. 1999. Well done, everybody. Again, lots of names I can see um, in the process. Congratulations. If you are having any issues, keep refreshing. It is going to be available on the website all day. So these aren't going to time out this hour. Don't worry. All the kits are on pre-order as well. So just literally revisit it if you like a little bit later on if it's if you're having issues right now that being said i can see web bidders dialing through as well um so the red jasper is available on um pre-order as is the sorry what are you after I'm just as gonna, is the on take these everyone and any questions text in have we had any more exhausted pigeon texts because uh, i think <laughs> I think we should have an auction called the Exhausted Pigeon. Oh yeah, people messaging by the web, that's true. Oh. That's true, so that's why it's got a little bit quiet on the message front as well. Ah. Oh. <laughs> right now, pigeons are offended, because we're like, we're not exhausted. <laughs> why is everyone calling us exhausted? Anyway, take it away, Claire. Okay, so I'm gonna show you some of the different ways um, that we can use this now. So we've got our lovely, um, our lovely chain. Yeah, it's beautiful, so, yeah, it? it's really lovely. It's it's really you know it's really smooth and because you know when we were talking before about if you hammer or you you know imprint into the metal, you're going to get different angles, aren't you? But this has got with that sort of link, it's that so lovely is it like luster. A it's like I think a it is. Wire, yes, isn't it? yeah, I think it is. So you just get a different sort of luster, don't you, with it? So we've got the um, the chain and it's got the uh, the jump rings and the uh, and the bolt rings. So we don't need to worry about any of the findings on there. So if I pop that down, so your first thing that you you, that you could do if you have a look at it you've got your your two um the two bales that we've got mm. so you can see here so you've got um textured wire going along here and then you've got two uh soldered loops at the end so you just need to sort of pull those apart a little bit so you're couple of different ways uh, that you can work now. So that now is gonna be secure. So we've got our, if we think about it, you know, we're making, most jewelry is made up of, um, isn't it, different loops that you connect in some way. Um, so we've got the, the, the gemstone itself, that, that donut is a closed, um, closed loop. We've just put a, another loop onto it, uh, and at the moment, so it's, we've got an open loop here and two closed here. So what we wanna do is we're gonna use another loop, which is our jump ring, to close all of that up. So if I just get that, so I'm gonna open this up a little bit. Give that a bit of a wiggle. So the first way of working with it is, so now I'm just gonna squeeze that because you've got a little bit of spring in that okay let's bring that together so your first way is you just pop that on and if i just close that up, remember you'd you'd be working with support your elbows and you have a lot more control okay so that's our first first way there okay so we've used one of them and that works and that's absolutely fine that way. It looks really, really nice like that. And you could still do, if you've got maybe others in your stash, you can absolutely uh, work in the same way. If you wanted to then, the other thing you could do is, maybe you wanna have this and you wanna work with a tassel, but you, again, you don't want too much bulk at this, this point here. So you could then, so again, I'm gonna open this up a little bit slide that through and again you would use your jump ring to close here and say i'd just cut my lengths of chain and i would have it like that so if i bring in this one here so we can see how this one works so rather than sort of cut everything there you can see so i've got the bale that's coming up here and then this is I've just got cut lengths of, um, so this one, the one that I've done here, different sorts of chain, and then you're adding it in there, and you can see and it just looks super neat and tidy, but because of the, how those bales are, you've got nice movement there, nothing is catching around those. But you could, you know, if you've got, um, maybe you've got some jadeite or something like that at home, you could absolutely use those use those on there so that's another way if you want to have say you want to use uh, all of it and you want to have a more permanent way so if I just I'll leave that one on there and let's open this one back up and you're happy to uh, 
cut the chain. So what we can do, if I just find the opening of this jump ring, so you decide that you want to have it so it's sort of sitting. Let's have a look. So if I just open that up. So I'm going to find, I'm just going to pop that one back on here so I don't confuse it. So let's pop all those there. I'm just going to find the mid point. So let's bring this down all the way. And just so we're going to cut that there. Okay, so you're opening the chain. Yeah, so with this one, remember, thinking about links all the time, so we've got lovely soldered closed links here. Okay. So if you actually see, if you can see here, so sometimes what you might get is that sort of the whole, um, the whole chain there, you, you're looking at the gap that is in between sort of that, that middle section there. It might be that your jump ring, the wire that goes through might be a little bit, the jump ring wire is a little bit too thick for that. So all you need to do, if you just get your, so I'm gonna hold that final link and I'm just gonna go in and open it up just ever so slightly. So I'm just putting a little bit of pressure. If you've got an awl or uh, something like that, anything, you know, one of the, uh, maybe a file, um, something like that, just a tiny, tiny amount so you can see just a little bit there and do it little little bits at a time and then that means so if you can see can you see how that's opened it up ever so slightly it just means you can get that that jump ring in there so let's take one of our bales there close that up and let's just hold that there and close up so that now means that it's going to go, we're going to have one either side. So it's going to sort of, that rather than sort of sitting at the top, they're going to sit either side. So let's go the other side as well. And let's open it up just ever so slightly. So I'm holding here, tiny bit of pressure. So I'm sort of squeezing at the end there. Let's see, just open that one up. Uh, let's give that a wiggle. Let's get that. Let's check that it's going to go through. Okay, and let's get the two ends here as well. Such a clever idea. They're genius, aren't they? Mm. So discreet. It just becomes like a part of the design, isn't it? It's a. Yeah. You've got all the circles. And again, Those you loops. don't have to be a silversmith. No, it's just. But you, can you see how it's not ideal? It's really not ideal to make jewelry without. Uh, good pliers but you could you know especially if you weren't going to cut the chain you're just going to open and close the jump ring if you've just sort of like got that you know I'm, I'm looking at that something I would buy and I want to you know that's a really good deal I'm going to make it myself that well, 20 have, pound massively oh that's lovely Claire it's great isn't it like that yeah so it's whether you have it so it's if it's going to you know maybe you want to have the tassel and it's going to go they're going to go vertically yeah, lovely. you could um uh, Shorten the chain as a Absolutely, joker. yeah, and use the chain for something else. I yeah. was just thinking, if you wanted, keep the chain as it is, and then do what you've done there, and then you could like macrame, couldn't yeah, you? Yeah, lovely, really lovely. Yeah, you're just using these, there aren't you? There's so many different ways of using these findings. Yeah, very, very clever. Really lovely and discreet, and they're just because I, I guess you've got all the circles, haven't you? They just fit really, really well. Super yeah. neat. It doesn't sort that. of disturb all the, you know, the lovely, the journey well, of that circles, circle. Circles are so meaningful as well, aren't they? Yeah, so you don't want to really interrupt it, do you? No. Absolutely incredible, so Claire. So that's the, the onyx. Um, somebody's asked, what's the length of the necklace? 18? Let me double check. I should be able to tell. Yeah, I think that's 18. It's 18. I can usually tell. But I'll join me to double check. I don't want to give you wrong information. But I'm at I'm 99% certain it's an 18 inch. Let me double check. Yeah, 18 inches. <laughs> 
You'd think after so many years that I would be able to tell. Yeah, no, they are. They're 18 inch. It's an 18 inch solid sterling silver. Should we do the red jasper, Claire? Yes. Yeah. Shall we? Yeah. So you get two of those amazing new findings. That's what I'm going to call them. We need to come up with a name for them. You know, like Wire Guardians have got a name. Yeah. French Wire. These need a title. And by the way, Claire, I didn't mention Claire, your instructions. Yes. Yeah. So you do um, have these. They're available upon dispatch, dis, uh, dispatch of your order. <laughs> 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 dispatch of your order um so you can either print it off you can file it or you can save it to your desktop whichever you prefer so claire's instructions so um talks to you about basically how you use the filing yeah yeah basically and you never know you might forget so you get those two findings you get the two little itty bitty jump rings and then you get this absolutely gorgeous red jasper and it is a natural red jasper as well so everything that you see, an 18 inch paperclip chain and the findings and the gemstones and the jump rings and the instructions. Hello Tracy, loving these kits, fab demo Claire from Claire as usual. Would love to see these bales separately. Oh um, yeah. Wink, wink, yeah. nudge, nudge. Yeah, um, yeah I think Tracy we would too, good. Tracy. So usually when we see something new like this, it first, it's first introduced mm. through a project and then I think they do it separately afterwards. Usually, not all the time, but usually. Mm. Um, so watch this space, Tracy. Maybe we can put that yeah, down in our shift though. report. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I mean, Ross, you do what a shift report, don't you, on every show? So, and he says, look, our law is already written down. These should be brought together individually. They're you a go. good finding, aren't they? they are a good, yeah, good very finding. clever. Yeah. Um, very, very clever, because you think how many times we bring you things like uh, um, high goo shapes or donut yeah, shapes. Yeah, yeah. Um, you know where we're going. But actually, Tracy, I know you want them separately, but that's a great deal for everything that you're getting there right now. You know, for the for the heavy necklace. I don't want to call it a chain. It is a necklace, yes, isn't it? Yeah. It's a hundred yeah. pounds for something similar yeah. on Monica Venade. Yeah. Um, or even £35 in somewhere like Argos. Here we are bringing you the chain and everything else for 19 .99. And Claire's knowledge as well. Is that two and a half grams in total? <laughs> Claire is very clever. <laughs> right, Adam, that's it. Is, is he teasing you, Claire? Yeah. He is teasing yeah. you. It's only because he's missed you, you know. Is it? <laughs> is it? So he's being rude. Yeah, um, no, you are very clever, Claire, aren't Thank you? Thank you. What, very, 50 pence worth? No, you're definitely worth more than that. 100%. By the way, that was not my words. Uh, 19 before we get people sticking up for Claire. We know that clever she is. She's amazing. Um, amazing. And you don't need to be a silversmith or solderer um, to work with these do, projects. Can you? you could just do it if you've never, I don't know, not, that you're not crafty at all you've never made any jewelry and maybe you've never never done anything like Guess that what? adam could probably do this oh, i don't know about that do you, <laughs> do you reckon ads do you reckon you could have a go no Are i you don't know if i'd lend him my pliers either no i don't blame, I don't blame you yeah now let him let him do it with his with his own fair hands yeah yeah, fine, Adam, it's fine. Uh, 1999, well done. We had 100 of each of these projects, jewelry makers. We've brought you the green onyx. This is the red jasper, and we also have it in the black onyx as well. Um, that's a great price for the necklace, isn't it? And it is a necklace. Um, well done, everyone. Um, you could link them as well, couldn't you? So you could link them like that. So, you, you know, that sort of price. So if you're going to. 60 pounds, you can get all of them. So you could link like that. <gasps> wait, wait, wait. Yeah, wait. that'd be lovely, wouldn't it? Look, going that oh, way yeah, and then. that's nice. Which if you saw that in any high-end jewellers, it is not going to be anywhere no near way. the price that we're bringing these projects to. Um, unbelievable. Well done, everyone. Okay, let's do the black onyx, shall we? Um, graphics are on your screens. Just a little swapperoo. Have you put one on there? Thanks. Just a little swapperoo. Oh, they're a nice size, these two, because you must they are, assume they? everybody wants the big yeah. high goos um, or the big donuts. Sometimes you want something a little bit more delicate. 
so a really nice size your black onyx is 20 millimeters um so again just to clarify just for people who've just tuned in you get one 18 inch solid 925 paperclip necklace that's here you get um two of your open jump rings which are four mil you get two of your twisted clip bales which is what you've seen uh, claire demoing they're eight mil um and then you get your black onyx as well which is 20 millimeters in its size i've got a hundred of these available and we are going under 20 pounds no surprise there so you can get all three all three for under 60 pounds today and they get a big investment of your sterling silver also um loving that absolutely loving that if you have any questions for claire do text in um because we're still live aren't we yes we are oh, no. if you can text in <coughs> sorry i keep forgetting that i know mm. we've had issues on the web um it's been one of them days jewelry makers it's been one of them days i think a glass of wine will be had tonight Oh, that'd be nice. Yeah. yeah, I might have a gin and tonic actually. Oh yeah, nice. Yeah. yeah. Oh nice. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Ross, I think that's Ross's favourite. Mm, gin. Is that mm. your tipple, Ross? That's your tipple. Um, <laughs> Do you have it with lime? Oh. Lemon and lime. He had lemon and lime, and he froze it. Nice. Yeah. <gasps> yeah. Lovely. Really nice. Um, have you tried a big? Um, a big chunk of blood orange in your gin and tonic. Ooh. That's nice. Do you know what I made over the summer? I need to move on from this because it's not summer anymore. But I actually made, I saw it on Facebook or something like that. And it was, so um, got some of the big ice cubes. You know the ones? So I literally ordered off Amazon like yeah. an ice cube tray. Yeah. Big ice cubes. You pour like, um, like an elderflower drink into each ice cube so with a little bit of strawberry. Yeah. Froze it drop it in your prosecco Ooh, oh it was so nice. good so good very moorish Ooh. very very moorish that could be a winter drink couldn't it you could put yeah berry. definitely you could put berries in there <clears> instead <throat> couldn't you strawberry is a berry i know but you could put, use like your seasonal mm, berries yeah in your prosecco yeah some nice edible black flowers berries, yeah. blackberries Ooh, yes that'd be very pretty adam wouldn't very it? very nice yeah. like that check us out check us out yeah. anyway Shall we, <laughs> shall we do some um, donut shaped hoop earrings to go with your projects, Claire? Oh, wow. They're cool, aren't they? <gasps> We've not oh, seen my, these no, I haven't. They're very cool. We are aware of the issues, by the way, if anyone is thinking of oh, uh, texting in there and saying, aren't they? <gasps> Look at these. Just so, can I pop, see if I can try one in? my gosh so then you can actually see i might need a mirror for these these are beautiful so you get the donut in <gasps> sterling silver and this lovely um oh oh okay so we have i've just put the oh my gosh the gemstones are amazing on these they're gorgeous aren't they look at the look. quality of that labradorite can you see <gasps> yeah it's incredible so beautiful jewelry makers now you get and they are are they silver yeah solid sterling silver look at that from there you know they're quite an investment of precious metal in these these are lovely they're gorgeous and they're, they're in a sense a huggy earring so they clip closed basically um okay they will go beautifully alongside claire's projects now we have them in three gems sorry we have them in three gems we have them in the malachite we have them in the um Labradorite, and we have them in. Is that black onyx? Yeah, is that black onyx? Um, okay, we've started with the labradorite, and they are encrusted by the way. Um, with your topaz, look at that sterling silver. That is crazy, isn't it? Massive gram weight, and the quality of those high goos. Wow, they're gorgeous, they aren't are they? They are stunning, absolutely stunning. I could stare at that all day. Mm. Look at those. <gasps> yeah, quality Labradorite, aren't they? 
Look at that blue sheen and all of this sterling silver and it is parve set as well with some um, absolutely amazing topaz. <laughs> it's a funny shot, isn't it? You got three, three hands for just to complicate things. Uh, like, what is going on? Oh my! God. I could stare at those all day. It's almost like I'd, I'd, I'd be tempted to take them off. I'd, you know, because I'd want to see those. Yeah. I'd have to multi buy those to then have that as a pendant as Which well. Which you very easily could do because they literally yeah. just open. Let me show yeah. you. They, uh, they literally open like that. So you can very easily take these off if you wanted gorgeous, to wear them as earrings. Gorgeous. That's not an issue. You can do that. And then you clip it closed like that. They're stunning without it, aren't they, as well? Yeah, gorgeous. Ah, oh, I'm with you, Claire. That, look at the quality of that labradorite. So the best labradorite we've seen. So you are looking at 14 millimeter labradorite donut. 925 sterling silver twisted earrings. Gosh, Ooh, hang on. Over five grams of solid silver. Oh, I love these. They're nice, aren't they? Yeah. There you go. Look at the movement in them. They're, they're beautiful, aren't they? This is a mad deal. Five grams of sterling silver. The quality of the uh, of the labradorite as well. Jewelry makers, thirty nine pounds and ninety nine pence. I mean, they are like you know you know when you start going things like your Christmas parties and stuff like that. Yeah, I would be separating these out. I think though. Would you? Yeah, I think so. Use the earrings as they are. They are beautiful as they are, aren't they? Yes, they don't need yeah. the gem. They look lovely as is. Um, yeah. Already there's collectors. Sorry, I've got an itch. Um, already um, collectors getting involved. I'm not surprised. And if you wanted, if you were lucky enough to get, um, if you were lucky enough to get them all, um, then you could interchange them. Sure, for sure. Um, today, big price crash on your screens. We are very, very, very aware um, that it's been one of them days, isn't it? So we've done apology oh, deals from stinker, start to finish. It? It's been, yeah, it has been <laughs> a stinker. Did you call yeah. it? Yeah, it's been a stinker in terms of, in terms of our in terms of our web accessibility. Um, but we've <gasps> brought it to we brought you the most unbeatable deals. So again, it's not to say the web issues are going to continue in the afternoon or on the repeat. You might very easily be like, I'm checking out. Fine, what's the drama? Um, so you get five grams of sterling silver. You get the two beautiful labradorite donuts. Oh look, yeah, look. Nineteen ninety nine, Ross. What are you doing? Oh look, it works on that one as well. Oh, that's a good idea. Oh, I can't. That's it. No. Go on, Claire. So if you've got the um, if you've got the uh, the projects as well, it works really well with that. Using a new finding with those. I like that because it really does show off the lab, right? Yeah. It? Well, then then there you've got, haven't you? So what maybe. Your pair of earrings and your two two pendants, if that's what you're yeah, gonna, yeah. gonna do. So yeah, that's separate fantastic. these yeah. components if you do if you would I actually think I prefer them separate. Yeah, I think I do. I do. I think I'd wear the earrings as they are. Yeah, you know, just that on cord. Amazing. When did when did these sneak in? Absolutely amazing. Also, can I just say what a great Christmas price tag that yeah. is? You don't get a great deal for, for, for 20 quid these days, but you're actually getting five grams of sterling silver and the beautiful genuine gemstones. Mm. You know? 20 pounds doesn't get you that much these days. Uh, Susan, Janice, Eileen, Robert, Nicolette, Kathleen, Sue, Holland, hello to you. We have had a mountain of web issues today. Um, so if you are having issues, checking out. Our free phone telephone number is still working. 0800 644 So our call and our call centre are lovely. They really, really are jewellery makers. Um, so speak to them if you are having any problems um, and they can add these to your order. If you're watching on the repeats, then you never know. It might have sorted itself out by then. Um, hopefully. Hopefully it will. Our team have been working on it, believe it or not, like pretty much the bulk of the morning. Um, so again, make sure you're checking them out. And the quality of the labradorite, these are absolutely incredible. Sylvia Buckinghamshire, well done everybody. Keep on dialing through. Right, let's do the malachite. Oh, I don't want to give those ones back. 
Do you know? Oh, I'm pop that there, that there. I think you deserve them, Claire. Thank you. If it was me, I would give them to you. Thanks. These are nice. I love Ooh. those. I'm running out of hands today. Yeah. They're gorgeous, aren't they? You can choose your favourite. They're so designer. Look at them. They're lovely. Look at that quality of the Malachite jewellery makers. And again, totally and utterly natural. That texturing of your sterling silver gives you that parve impression all the way around. But it is also um, topaz encrusted as well. So your Malachites are on and offable. Or you could literally be I looking. love these. I really, I think these are some of my favourites. Really, really like. Yeah, that's a great price as well. 30 seconds. The gemstone of the moment. Over five and a half grams of sterling silver. You, you got that bracelet yeah, earlier you on. You definitely need that to go with it, yeah. They look lovely together, don't they? Yeah. Five and a half grams. It's a big investment mm. of sterling silver. Ooh. I think I know what's going to happen, Claire. I think I know. Do you think you know? What way it's going to go? Mm. Yeah. Check out. If you can't, dial through, speak to our, our call centre team. 0800 655 is the free phone telephone number. Um, yeah. Keep checking out your basket, if refreshing all of the things, because people are, do, are, are shopping with us online, but we are aware there has been uh, multiple hiccups um, with the website. And that's why we haven't had many messages into the studio today either. It's because you message us on the web as well. 19 pounds and 99 pence. Um, here's a bit of information for you. Did you know approximately 80% of our audience, jewelry maker audience, shop on the web? Do they? Mm. Which I know it's very different, a very, uh, that's a massive number in comparison to our other channels. So yeah, 80% of our audience will actually shop on the web. So they do know all this amazing information. Mm. So, um, but that being said, like I said, if you're having any problems, you can go the old fashioned way and pick up the phone and speak to our call center. Um, you can keep refreshing, people are being successful. You've had apology deal after apology deal after apology deal throughout what will be the five hour show because it started from the very get go. Sylvia, Janice, Jane, Patricia, Nicolette, Tracy, hello to you, Airship, Sue, Maker, Angela, Susan, Buckinghamshire, North, uh, Nottinghamshire, well done. How many you got, Roscoe? 50 available. Tell you what, if you're watching right now and you are an organised person, you can get your Christmas uh, Christmas jewellery. Yeah. I can think of loads of people that would like these and would wear these. For 20 quid? Yeah. Which they shouldn't normally be 20 pounds. No, but they don't look anything like 20 pounds. No! They? What do you think? Put a price tag on these. What do you reckon? I think that what Adam said, 70 quid is like an, a very good... I think, to me, they look like they're designer, don't they? They look a... Look at the quality. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look, look, look as well. You see the peacock's eye? Right there. You've got it in the actual donut itself. Yeah. Amazing jewellery makers. Well done, everyone. Um, again, these have been apology deals. That's why we've gone astronomically low. Um, it's one of those things. But actually, great for you. Great for you. Mm. So, you know, sometimes these issues can be fantastically positive for you um, because you get unbelievable savings. Right, the last ones is what, sorry, Black Onyx. And they just literally click into place. Okay. Literally click like a hoggy design. Okay. First price crash. First. Oh, look at that. First price crash under £20. In 21 seconds, we're taking these even lower. The shape and the movement is brilliant, isn't it? Because it does look like, like we know it's, it's static, but it does look like it's cord yeah. or yeah. it's just caught in a moment, doesn't it? great movement because of that movement unbelievable jewelry i'll show you these in the air in a second 
Is it five and a half grams again? Of sterling silver? 5.48, just a whisper underneath um, five grams. So again, let me show you how these, hang on, make sure I do it properly. There you go. So you, they open and close. Like a carabiner almost. Whee! <laughs> um, literally, then they go in the ear. Very elegant. Mm. Uh, I love these. Always easier to put earrings on when you've got a mirror in front of you. I like to put myself under this uh, this kind of pressure there. You know, why not? What could go wrong? <laughs> um, here you go. So, have I done it? Have I done it? I'm not sure. Have I? Have I clipped it into place? I don't know. I've only gone and done it. Yay. So nice. Big. They are, aren't they? They're yeah. really beautiful. Massive gram weight of silver. Well done, everybody. I love this design. I really like this design. And of course, all the beautiful gemstones. How much would they be in somewhere like, oh, I don't know, Cartier? Well, mm. because they'll be gold then, wouldn't they? But And they work with Onyx, of course. They won't be 14 99 so that for free, says Ross. <laughs> <laughs> How much would they be in Monica Veneda? Yeah, I think 150 there mm. or thereabouts. Um, which would be great because they're genuine gemstones and solid 925 sterling silver. It's us that's mad. Completely mad. Um, hopefully, you've started your Christmas shopping today, Claire. That, that has, they, they've inspired me too. That's it. Mm. Just because I can think of loads of people. That would love these yeah. earrings. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Um, right, okay, let's do what? Have you seen it? I, I can't see. There you go. I couldn't see what I was doing then. Okay. This is a collector's piece. This, I forgot we even commissioned this. It's absolutely beautiful. Do you remember at the beginning? Um, it was around about the beginning of when we started seeing all the jade. And there was the colour wheel launch. And that was part mm. of our birthday celebrations, wasn't it? Um, and it was one of those th uh, pieces that we were like, okay, it took about a year to, maybe even longer actually, it took about a year to bring to air. But it was an idea based on the Mason and Kay colour wheel um, that the GIA use now, by the way, which came originally from Mason and Kay, which shows you all the different colours of jade. Um, so that strand was launched as part of our birthday collection. Um, I'm going to borrow one of these chains, Claire to show this. This is definitely one for the collectors. So if you got the projects just a few moments ago. This chain would work beautifully with it. This is higher. It's worth the wait, I promise you. Did I just hear this has been under an embargo? Three mm. embargoes. Three separate embargoes to play it in today's show. I mean, I get it. Oh my gosh, look at that. It's amazing, isn't it? So one of the embargoes was actually called Centre Gems, which means exactly that. They were going to send it on to our sister channel. Look at how beautiful. This is your colour wheel in a pendant. Wait, 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 Ross. Can you just clarify what we're looking at here? Because I don't want to say it and then be wrong. So we're looking at type A green jadeite, natural nanhong, type A black jadeite, and type A imperial white jadeite, all set in 925 sterling silver you can see stamp there and 20 genuine zircons that's so impressive isn't it it's amazing it's a really striking piece of jewelry i can totally see why it was tagged for our sister channel we have actually lifted three embargoes to include it in today's show what a lovely piece of mm. jewelry and again quite i don't know it's giving me 1920s vibes but at the same time yeah. modern yeah was ti yeah, timeless, isn't it? It's a timeless, it's a gorgeous design. We're going to do this in two price crashes. 
It does look very Cartier. Mm, it does, yeah, really high design. Mm. The first price, we're going to show you the launch price. How many do we have of these available? Four zero forty, right. Launch price. Are these more than three grams of silver on this? Definitely. It's. I think we've massively underestimated that. Launched at one four nine. Thirty seconds. We're going to do a massive what? Brand new low. We've lifted three embargoes. I think that's excessive from our management team. One tells our producers, don't touch. <laughs> three is absolutely categorically do not touch. But you've lifted three, Ross. Yeah. And if you're gonna get away with it, today's the day it will. Unbelievable. We've got four zero available. Massive closeout deal, jewelry makers. I mean, we think about, like I said, 92 days until Christmas. I think that's the number. What a piece of jewellery this would be. I'm not sure I could part with that. No. Oh, goodness wow. me. That's half price, isn't it, pretty much? Pretty, pretty much half price. Pretty much almost 50% off that price tag. That's incredible, Claire. The colours are amazing, aren't they? Yeah, beautiful. Whether you wear it on a long line chain, the size mm. of it, it's gonna, I'll hold it up to the neckline so you get an idea of perspective, but it's a big piece which measures what, 31 mm. millimeters in its size. Nanhong agate, mm. natural jadeite, three, yes, yeah, so the Nanhong's the red, the remaining colors are, are of your type A jadeite. I mean, look at that, so it's, it's a statement piece and the kind mm. of piece that I think you could put on and never take off. 79.99, does that look double figures? I think this literally looks like it's, like you say, Cartier. Yeah, like those thousand pound pieces that you yeah. look at for, you know, inspiration. It's really, really high end. Tens of thousands. Yeah, yeah. Totally agree. And you've still got your four-way split pay. I do appreciate jewellery makers. There have been an absolute bombardment of issues on the web. I do appreciate it and it has been um, incredibly frustrating for us here in the studio. It's annoying, it is annoying. You want your show to just run seamlessly. You want everything to work, don't you? There's nothing work. <laughs> it's like when your car breaks down. It's nothing, it's so inconvenient, so inconvenient. Um, but if you keep checking out, keep an eye on the website um, because you know, if it, it has been working on and off as well, so keep refreshing. Um, the Malachite bracelet that I'm wearing is still available, by the way. We'll bring the graphics on your screen. This is Bullseye Malachite. So literally, I bought this on the weekend and we brought you the remaining quantity today, jewellery makers, every single one of them. I think, what did we call it? The Heart of the Malachite. This, yep. Um, sapling. sapling. Yeah. The sapling yeah. of the Malachite. Yeah. Where it all lovely. began, the rarest uh, variety. Yeah. Tomorrow, you're going to be joined by the lovely Carol and the lovely Mark. So that's oh, going to be a wonderful be nice. show. Hopefully, everything gets sorted out um, web wise. Um, coming up on tomorrow's show, they have at eight o'clock your pinch bales. Oh, I love a pinch bale. Mm. Um, a bit we'll similar to what you've shown in the yes. day. Of the day. Uh, yeah. Sorry, is your um, in your tech in your projects? Um, nine o'clock. Then you have inspirational shell pearl with Mark. Um, then at ten o'clock you've got your nine two five sterling silver heavyweight chains, Ooh. which are stunning. Eleven o'clock you have your Alashan agate selection. Um, love Alashan ag agate. I know it's a firm favourite of Mark's as well. Twelve o'clock you've got howlite and mukite. That's a nice combination, mm. isn't it? Um, with Mark, Claire, it's been wonderful today, hasn't it? Well, it's been wonderful it's been to see coaster. you. It's been a roller coaster. It's been a roller coaster today. <laughs> it's been lovely to see you. It's been the morning. See you. With Honestly, you. we like well, if we reenact this morning when I saw Claire in the car park. We literally Aww. pulled up at similar times. I was just getting out of the car. You're getting out of the car. Claire, I know. Oh, lovely. we've missed you, my darling. I missed you. When are you back? Uh, I think is it with you next week, Ross? Yeah. Is it Tuesday? Oh, there we are. Next Wednesday. Wednesday yeah. Amazing. Yeah. Have a wonderful afternoon. Keep checking out your baskets. We'll see you after this. Hello, everyone. It's Mark here from a very damp and soggy Whitney. 
I'm here to tell you all about my up and coming show, which is this Wednesday, the 25th of September. I'm going to be joining lovely Carol, Tom and the crew. And I want to tell you quickly about my two project hours. Nine o'clock hour, we have got the most beautiful shell pearl kits. We've got four millimeter and six millimeter rounds alongside seed beads. They're absolutely beautiful. And this will be the tutorial that comes free of charge when you purchase any of the kits in the nine o'clock hour. And then at 12 o'clock, you probably heard me and Carol mention over the past few days, we have got two beautiful, beautiful Howlite kits. For the first time, I believe we have matte Howlite in four different size strands. And then we've also got, and this is a work in progress, we've got this beautiful bracelet here and I've teamed this alongside some beautiful fire polished beads as well and again this is going to be the tutorial that you're going to get in the 12 o'clock and if it couldn't get any better we've also thrown in the most amazing mustard mukite project as well three different size strands Ellen teamed up with beautiful seed beads so that's Wednesday the 25th We've got beautiful shell pearl at nine o'clock and then the incredible howlite and mukite at 12 o'clock. So I hope you can join myself, Carol and the team from eight o'clock. Makers, Monica here. I'm back in the studio on Thursday so I'll quickly show you what we've got coming up in the project hours and since October is nearly upon us in the nine o'clock hour we're going to be uh, celebrating tourmaline which is October's birthstone so this little necklace that you've got here uh, is what I'm going to be doing the instructions for um, it's all made of tourmaline and a few little seed beads in there as well um, that's in the nine o'clock and we've got red tourmaline we've got pink tourmaline we've got black tourmaline so uh, it's all about tourmaline and then in the 12 o'clock hour we've got these rings coming up right which are shell pearl and cup chain uh, I can't remember the last time I had cup chain in any of my projects and they also include adjustable rings which is what they're attached to um, that's in the 12 o'clock hour that's on Thursday on the 26th hope you can all join us with Carol and the rest of the team see you then Thank <laughs> you.